Disney Jewel Remakers. Look who it is! Hello! We got the black memo today, didn't we? Oh, yeah, we did, didn't we? I've just noticed that. Yeah, I'm always twin. in black, though. We're twinning. Twinning! Twinning! It's beautiful, <laughs> Debbie! How are you doing, darling? I'm good, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm um, good. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Firstly, I'm so glad she's here today. But not, not just because she's an incredible talent and she's helping me out majorly this morning, <laughs> but also because um, you are... Oh, such a talent and beautiful jewellery as per usual. Yeah, but the kits were pretty epic. I mean, our kits lately, I mean, we've got loads of new stuff, haven't we? Yeah. It's just like, I mean, we've got findings with hearts on. I know. I love that. I know. The kits are amazing, aren't they? Are aren't they? They're really amazing. Really aren't they? beautiful. Just buy cones in gemstones. I love. Oh. I'm so used to using the glass ones, but it's to yeah. be able to get them in gemstones. Yeah. So I loved it. And do you know what? Initially, when you look at these, and they're on the desk before us, when you look at these buy cones, you would be forgiven for thinking they were glass because they're that good a quality. Especially the um, garnet. transparent, the garnet and the uh, peridot. Is it peridot. Yeah. I just, oh my God. I know, they're amazing, aren't they? Yeah. Well, these are coming up at... Masterclass. They're 12 o'clock. Yeah. Um, and then your nine o'clock kits. I've got pearls and also, you know, with the heart findings, but also I've got coloured findings. I've never in my career no. before ever seen that. No, they're beautiful. So You'll notice them on the earrings. Red. Yeah. Yeah. They're amazing. I clocked those the moment I got in. Can you see them? They're on the red earrings. <sighs> never had those before. So they're all coming up. At nine o'clock today mm -hmm. for your coloured findings. Plus, we've also got it, it, a variety gemstone launch. Now, you've had the gemstone before, but you've never had this variety before. Ooh. And you know when you imagine something, you know it's going to be beautiful, but then you see it in person, it's so much better mm. than what you had in mm. your head. Take a little look at this display just here. Sorry, King. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah. What is it? it? Angelite. And it's totally natural. Serious? Serious. I've Peacock never seen Peacock coloured angelite. That yeah, most beautiful. people think angelite blue, that sort of opaque blue. And lovely. Um, yeah, matte. Yeah, and it not, oh, I need that. That's, there's areas of translucency. These are totally natural. There's no enhancement to this whatsoever. So that's your deal of the day today. I love it. The launch, the official launch. Um, but we've got loads, like you said, loads of sterling silver. We've got some beautiful pearls. You know this hour is early bird hour, so you can be looking on the website right now, shopping ahead. Some of the items are quite limited. Um, some of them are more plentiful. So go to jewelrymaker.com, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com, click watch live, and then scroll down ever so slightly. You'll see at the right, right next to our lovely Debbie, um, <laughs> you'll see um, your early bird as well, which is a beautiful 925 sterling silver lobster clasp with bail, so it's on and offable effectively. That's really good. Yeah, shop ahead on those. Um, in fact, I can give you a little sneaky peek of it. Uh, where is Oh, it's there. There, 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 there. King had displayed it for us really beautifully. Oh. Um, and look, how amazing, how amazing is that? So you've got parve setting. You've got a burr on your peg, so it's going to secure nicely. Um, and then yeah, it means you're better your pendant, effectively, or charm, or whatever it wants to be. It's on and offable, isn't it? That's... <laughs> That's so, so clever. Now, of those, we've got 104, and I don't think that's going to be enough. I think there's. I think we, if we had a three times that quantity, I'd have been a bit more comfortable. But 104. No, and I just think that you know, there's so many things. I love the idea that you can take it off because sometimes you, it depends what neckline you're wearing, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Or yeah. even you know, like if you're stop it from here to here. Yeah. Move it. Move it around the I body as such. <laughs> Yeah, I need about four of them because the amount of jewellery I wear on a daily... Oh, I'll put it on this bangle. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> um, and your necklace is like we planned it, Debbie, and genuinely, I don't think we did. We're not that organised, are we? You're I wearing we your were. Taipei Red Jadeite, which is amazing. Now, if you love this beautiful necklace that Debbie is wearing, um, then we also have in your early bird a natural Type A Red Jadeite carving. Do you know I'm obsessed with this Red Jadeite? It's beautiful, isn't it? It's just like, it goes with everything. I mean, yeah. it's like... 
this is going to make me sound weirder than I normally am. You're but like right. when it's hanging there and I go and put, to put my pearls on, it kind of goes, oh, and I, it calls me. It calls me. And I, I keep choosing it. Yeah, every time. Here it is. Here's the pendant that will go beautifully alongside, well, your, how about alongside your <gasps> angelite? I was just going to say that. Lovely with the yeah. angelite. So that's an item number two and it's totally natural. Remember what we've said about red jade, everything that we have within the vault, that's it. Oh, is it? Yeah, they can't get any more. And that's the skin of the apple. Yes, isn't it? that's right. Very, very rare to get that quantity of red. Um, so we did, uh, um, yeah, basically we said, we did like a little showcase of this is it, this is all we have. I think it was Saturday, yeah, on the weekend anyway. Um, we were like, this is our entire red jadeite vault. This is it. We can't get any more. Wayne has said to us, look, I can get, I can get the heat treated variety, but it's actually more expensive than the natural variety. Um, there's nothing. We can't buy it, basically. So um, what we have of red jade, I, I think it's fair to say, is the end of the road. Um, but we missed one piece. It was under lock and key, um, and that's this piece. So you can shop ahead on that. I love that kind of infinity-like design. Yeah, it's so simple. Yeah, love and I it. like that because you don't need it to be complicated when you've got that red jade. Totally. Can we say hello to our lovely crew as well? Because we've got hello. a um, we've had a little bit of a mix-up today. So um, so our wonderful crew. We've got Michael on camera. Good morning, Michael. How are you doing, lovely? Great. Nice little treat to see you this morning. Well. Are you in tomorrow too? Yeah, you get a double dose of Michael then. On floor, we have the very beautiful, another lady I'm, it, it, you know, immensely grateful for is our beautiful Inga. Inga. Hi, darling. Oh, these girls ain't half helped me out this morning. Um, and in the gallery, we have got another treat. Giving them a, uh, get, getting up early this morning, weren't you? Getting up early. Normally, he's with paper, isn't he? Oh, hobby. Normally, he's on Hobby Maker, but we've got our lovely Daddy Adam. Hello, Daddy Adam. Oh, Yay. Adam. Hello, Adam. There he is. I didn't know whose voice that was. Daddy Adam. How are the twins? Yeah, doing all right? <laughs> all good? Yeah. Are they terrorising you? Ross and I have this conversation all the time, don't we? You know, we say that our day off is not the day off that we have at home. It's actually in work. And we're talking about how, how well, manipulative, let's be honest, the two-year-olds are. They are, Ross, bless him. You were offering um, McDonald's the other day, weren't you? In the car. <laughs> Do you want a McDonald's? Do you want a McDonald's? No, no, no. Do you, want, are you sure you don't want a McDonald's? No. And then you drove past McDonald's. I want a McDonald's. That's a day in the life, isn't it? Oh, that's typical. Typical. You, go, yeah. you should have said, the other one is you're on a long journey and you stop at the services. Do you want a wee? Are you sure you don't want a wee? No, you don't want a wee. Okay, get in the car, go down a mile. I want a wee. Yeah. Why didn't you go? I didn't need it then. <laughs> you do a lot of deep breathing, don't you? <laughs> a lot of deep breathing. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We've, yeah. They are, they are <laughs> challenging somewhat aren't they um, but can I just tell you a little story uh, just quickly um situation in the Stevens household <laughs> Debbie's laughing because she knows exactly what story I'm about to tell you <laughs> so my willow goes up to middle school um as of September and we've got the leavers performance now this leavers performance she's got lines these lines are basically two words um <laughs> that we have been uh, been practicing and practicing these words are yeah cool rock out so Willow is, Willow is a rock star starfish. Okay. So I'm thinking, right, oh, let's have a look. Let's see if I can get just a starfish costume and we can rock accessorize it anyway. Wouldn't come in time. So then my husband comes up with a genius idea and goes, Patrick of SpongeBob SquarePants. He's a starfish. I didn't realize that, but apparently he is. So we order a costume whilst Willow's at school. And then I told her, thinking she's going to be really excited about this when she got home. She's mortified. She was like, Mummy, he doesn't look like a starfish. He looks like something else. And she's kind of got a point, if you know who Patrick is, by the way. She actually does have a point. She does have a so point. So she's a little bit upset about this. I was like, right, I'm not going to make you wear Patrick. Fine. It's fine. My mummy, please, I don't want to go. I was like, okay, don't let's not get upset about it. Come in. I work with creative people. 
So you're on the case, aren't you? I'm on the case. I'm on it. You're, you're going to make a headdress. I'm going to make her a rock star headdress. Oh, bless her. I've raided the bead scoop and everything. We have. We have. I'm we've, on it. We've Deb if anyone can do it, Debbie can. That's what oh, I said. The to, pressure. No pressure. <laughs> That's what I said to Willow last night. Look, I'm on with Debbie. It's okay. <laughs> everything will be okay. <laughs> <laughs> right then, um, should we get cracking? Because we've got an absolutely amazing yeah. Wednesday show for you. We'll keep you updated on the rock star starfish headdress <laughs> as well as when. And I just want to say good morning to my granddaughter because she usually watches it this time. Oh. Hi, Clemmy. Hello, Clemmy. Oh, bless her. Does she, are you nanny? Nana? Nana. Nana. She calls me Lala because she can't say Nana. Oh, Lala. Like, you know... Like the telly tops, <laughs> yeah. Well, I look a bit like a telly No, you top. don't. <laughs> <laughs> you really don't. Right then, let's, uh -oh. Uh -oh. Right, let's get cracking, shall we? Because we have got... Hi, Glimmy. Um, <laughs> we, we launch these during the birthday. And oh, if you're ooh. making to gift or making to sell, then you're going to need to think about the packaging, aren't you? Oh, look at those. You could sew on your logo or your... Um, initials yes. of, your, of your company or, or a message the person or a message happy birthday oh i love that you can embroider onto it couldn't yeah, you yeah yeah stick onto it in my world and me. um <laughs> i'm not an embroider you could I, i've been seeing lately on uh, um and like i say big brother list, always listening to you so um school uniforms you know like putting the names on those stamps stamps you could stamp oh, with fabric onto, yeah Ooh. there you go we've got fabric things on hobby that Baker, would be so we? nice um so you're getting what five of them is that right five yeah, pack of five, and they've got three, uh, five different colours as well. How about a pound each? That's very good, That's isn't very, it? Very, very good. I mean, you'd fit your malas in there, your stretchy bracelets in there, your earrings in there. A pound, really? Do you know you can even just get some nice lavender from your garden, dry it out, and make make nice little smelly pouches. You you struggled <laughs> smelly. I'm not saying anything. Um, you would it's put me right off my train of thought. Um, you would struggle to get a. a I can't speak. I'm sorry. Paper bag. Uh, there you for go. A pound. You probably would, yeah. It was at the smelly pouches convert. <laughs> <laughs> this show's gonna be like that. For your knicker drawer, yeah, totally. For <laughs> no, your knicker drawer you mean. and things it like that. You put your dried like... lavender yeah, and lovely, stuff. Yeah, lovely. Nice. Four ninety nine, but there's a clock a tick in. How many have you got, Roscoe? We've got 30 available. They were launched during the birth. They were a pound per bag. That's pretty amazing. And I'm guessing there's going to be people thinking, right, I'm going to get a few of those. Because how often do you create a piece of jewellery to gift? Or if you sell your jewellery, then it's so much better than just passing it in like, a, I don't know, a money bag or something oh, like that. Or if you want to keep your pearls uh, or something oh, yes. like that, your nice jade eye, and, you know, store it nicely in a jewellery box, put it in one of these. Good idea, so it doesn't get scratched. And pearls yeah. don't like plastic, no. so take them out of the plastic bags when you buy uh, pearls. They don't really like it, so um, something like this would be absolutely ideal. Really good point. So at 4 .99, I think that's a great deal. Do you all agree? Very, very good. But for the final 30-odd... £3.59. That's a really good deal. Amazing. There's about 71p per bag. Shall I, shall I, shall I right, imagine there's... They're a good should... size, aren't they? There you go. So imagine that's a pearl necklace or something. There you go. Ross, where, where, where were you, darling? We've, we've already had that conversation. <laughs> where were you? We were, oh, you? Oh, you were listening. That's all right, Ben. It's like you go with the smellies, would you? Like potpourri and things like oh, that. Yeah, dry... dry lavender from yeah. the garden yeah be really nice i never had you down as a potpourri kind of man roscoe Ooh. but i i you like the you like the house to smell nice yeah absolutely you like a candle yeah absolutely so yeah me but it's probably because i've got four dogs <laughs> yeah same <laughs> Same, I've got to, I've got, I need candles in yeah, my house, too. absolutely. Um, so yeah, you can see, look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Can I feel it? <laughs> yeah, of course you can. Oh, they're really nice. <laughs> I would, I'm not saying my house stinks. My house doesn't stink. It's doggy, mine smells doggy. Yeah, you can't avoid doggy no. smells sometimes. No. So yeah, I get, I get up, I get <laughs> up, let the dogs out for a wee, make a cup of tea, light the candle straight away, straight away. And I, I, can I just say I do clean? <laughs> So do I, but it just, you know, you have animals or you have a perfect house. You exactly. Really not, not, you can't have both. Absolutely. Um, okay. Um, stay where you are. Sellouts already on the website, says Roscoe. So keep an eye on that. Um, should we do some ruby next? Ooh, ruby. Now, it's not just any old ruby, mind. 
a, oh, darling, a meter. Eat your rubies. Eat your ruby, darling. How posh. And what, sorry? Oh, yes, remember what month we're in? It's July, isn't it? It is. It is July, so what does that mean? Yeah, 20. July 20 gets you 20% off. 20% off a show price. I was just going to say that on show items as well. That's really, really good. Isn't it? Yeah. I love the colour of that one. It's a, it's glowing ruby. You know, yeah. lesser quality ruby would look quite dark, uh -huh. uh, um, quite dark, almost borderline black. Um, ruby should glow in the same way that emerald should, really. They should both have this presence, this vibrancy, this luminosity. Um, we should expect there to be internal characteristics. You can get ruby, which are completely eye clean, but they cost absolute fortunes. But we should expect, they call it silks in ruby, and actually a silk can enhance, um, A, the beauty, but also the value of it. We're at £349, which, you know... <sighs> In all honesty, it's actually a really good price, especially as we're looking at 195 carats. It's totally and utterly natural. And you're going to be getting the lowest ever price. Can you see this one here? You've actually got the, the silks producing a chatoyancy. Yeah, remember like in the month of June, we went on and yeah, yeah. on and on and on about Pearl 10, didn't we? Mm -hmm. We did, because mm -hmm. it was 10% discount That's off good. pearls. Yeah. 20% on your rubies. That's very, very good. Very good. And sapphire. Ruby and sapphire. Why sapphire? It's not sapphire. Sa okay, well, I mean, it's good. The fact, but we're going to have to do that again, aren't we, in September? At 349, how many have I got? Have I got many of these? Ten. Oh, seven left. Use your Julie 20. Uh, Julie? J July 20. <laughs> <laughs> not Julie. Use your July 20. Yeah, you can put Julie 20 in, but nothing will happen. No, <laughs> <laughs> nothing. You don't get 20% off Julie's. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. Doesn't, we not, haven't got any Julie's, actually. Got any, if we I did, you might be able to. <laughs> <laughs> don't think there's any Julie's here, is there? I don't know any. My mother-in-law's got a Julie. I don't know any Julie's. Um, my mother-in-law is a Julie. Oh. Yeah. She likes her gemstones too. We're at £99. That's a pound a centimetre for genuine natural ruby. But actually less because you get, what, £20 off that oh, price really, tag. That's a metre. Yeah. It's not 38 centimetres. You're getting 100 centimetres. That is the lowest ever price. Of course, of course it is. There's only seven of them left, though. Um, you'll see on the graphics here, it's been higher, yes. You'll see on the graphics here, no enhancement whatsoever. So you're getting 95% uh, of the world's ruby is, uh, is treated. So you're getting um, that rare 5%. So this is, what, £80 then? £80 for natural ruby. That's amazing. And my point earlier on, it's not really dark. It's not borderline black ruby, which is obviously lesser quality. You want it to have that beautiful glow. And that's here in the studios. Imagine it outside. It'd be gorgeous in the sunlight. Yeah. In the natural daylight. It'd be absolutely stunning. And you've got a metre of it. Yeah. It's going to oh, go a long way. Amazing with the drops in the kit. Oh, in your nine o'clock kits. Yeah. Hang on. Look let's on let's build some that. lovely kits, shall we? How about this? Oh, yes. Thank you. Sold. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Make sure you're checking out. Gosh, that garnet's amazing. It's beautiful, isn't it? Um, okay, let's do what? Sorry, chains. Oh, these are beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Now, they were, I think they were birthday. On the actual birthday. Now, this is 925 sterling silver. Ooh. 50 centimetre lengths, is that right? Do I remember that rightly? I think so. We've spoken, spot on the money. Yeah. Do I remember how many grams there is? No, 18.7 grams of solid 925 sterling silver. No, I wouldn't have remembered that. D I don't remember what price. I know it's going to be an amazing deal, though. Um, so that's basically 150 centimetres of beautiful 925 sterling silver. We always talk about the paperclip chain, yeah, don't we? It's so designed. Um, how, oh, that's lovely. Um, how on trend, how on trend paperclip chains are. And it ha what's the, what's the, what, what's this, the title of that um, article? It says it's a trend mask. No. Yeah, it's a trend... I can't remember, something masquerading as a trend or something like that. It's actually not new. Here we go. I can read it to you. Not, let's flick forward. Oh, let's flick forward to the next one because um, I'm sure it says, 
There it is. Whether this trend takes you back to your homeroom or makes you nostalgic for the style of the 80s, the paperclip necklace may be trendy, but is anything but new. Created by Coco Chanel and made famous by none other than Jackie O herself, paperclip jewellery is actually a classic masquerading as a trend. I like that. Yes. And you'll see Jackie there in the bottom right of that... Of that um, image now two have already checked out which means i've only got five of them left remember you've only got till the top of this hour to make your confirmations as well all you need to do is attach a lobster or class that's yeah. all you need to do show you a few price comparisons so pandora lovely amazing beautiful paperclip chain very similar to a few of the ones that i've got here um misoma 310 pounds Slightly different style of paperclip, but still, £310, that's 925 sterling silver. Here's another Misoma, £155. Look, genuinely, you could recreate that necklace with a, with, a, with a lobster claw clasp and save yourself quite considerable sums of money. Yeah, definitely. All you need... Ah, oh, I love this. Absolutely love it. Love this too. Oh, you, all those open spaces. That one... Have a look at Muru on London. And that's one of the more affordable paperclip chains that we actually found that online. That is affordable. Yes, yeah, very good, isn't it? Very, very good. Well, like I said, like I said, you're going to be making savings. Uh, very similar to Gucci, this one here, in that it's got quite a condensed paperclip chain. Yeah, that's 80, eight and a half grand. I know it's gold, but still. But that's so overpriced, it's untrue. You could, I mean... <sighs> Often you'll see these on all of these sort of people that we've been talking about, and they'll have like um, a fireball pearl, yeah. one, won't they? And then it's even more expensive. So if you think you want to recreate that kind of look, you can definitely do it with these chains. Yeah. Because they are so designer and, and sought after, aren't they? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a huge trend at the moment. I mean, the fact there's articles being written about the paperclip. Um, so we found this one. Now, this is a bracelet that you could make quantities of. Um, it's not exactly the same, but it's very similar. So there's eight links on that bracelet, and that will actually be magnified. Because can you, oh, can you, is this on, online right now? Yeah. So could you click on the, where she's wearing the bracelet? No. But if you look at the bottom, it's not a big, chunky sterling silver bracelet. No. You know, it's just zoomed in. £69. You can make that bracelet multiple times over, couldn't you? And you don't even need to be a silversmith. Now, remember that price point for one bracelet, or you can get a metre and a half of solid 925 sterling silver. Um, super easy to attach your class. We're at £50 each. Wow. That's already beating the prices that we've seen elsewhere. Do you know what's amazing, though? All three, we beat the price of that bracelet. Seriously? A metre and a half. We're actually over-allocated, so we're going to do it in one price crash. Lots of you dialling in for this one. Um, it's been one of the, I agree, one of the most designer uh, um, sets of chain um, in sterling silver that we've ever, ever done. I mean, imagine, that's six beautiful bracelets and leftovers with it too. Ooh, yeah, you can make um, earrings just to use yeah. the link and put a pearl on the end or whatever you want on the end. Some of that um, lovely ruby. Beautiful. $59.99. These aren't lightweight chains. That's the point. You know, these are solid. You've got, what do we they're say, gorgeous. 18 grams? 18.7, so it's actually closer to 19 grams. Amazing. Um, for the silver weight alone, yeah, absolutely. 29.99 on your 0% interest split payments if you wish, but no, I've only got five left. That's it. Well, and there's loads of you adding it to your basket, so make sure you are checking out nice and early, everybody. Um, I hope we get these again, because they were launched only in May, just gone, and I think today we'll probably see their final live show. Um, I hope we do get them again, because like so I said, I. I'm not a silversmith. I'm not great at silversmithing, but something like this, I can just open and close a jump ring onto this, can't I? And why would you want to make those chains out of wire when you can buy them for this? Yes! You, yeah. You know, because it's not it's, worth your while. No, not with some things it isn't. Amazing. Well done, everybody. You've got the final few of those. Make sure you're checking out because you've got what? Oh, they've sold out. Congratulations. Um, okay, shall we do? Ooh, Taipei Black Jade Eye Angel. Ooh. Oh, I do remember. I got some of these. They're so beautiful. You've got something massive to tell me. Okay, I'm excited. But you're going to wait till nine. Okay. Ah, okay. I don't know what he's on about either. 
um, that something you've just had confirmation. Is this relating to black jadeite? Oh, okay, right. Related to something that's happening tomorrow. Oh, okay, okay. Um, now, look at these. I bought some of these when we first launched them. They absolutely flew. They were little, they're little mini kits, effectively. A little angel. It's a little angel. And even I could make these, and that's saying something. I don't know if we've still got the photograph of them, do we? Um, um, see if I can do it. See if I can do it. So you put your head pin, yeah, and then you get, see if I remember how to do this. You get your type A black jadeite for her. Is that the right way, Ross? Do you remember? Body. Or do I put, yeah? I think I put the little bead on the bottom. So I put this little flower spacer bead just here on the bottom. I think, I think we're doing this right. But you can do it how you want, can't you? Yeah, that's true, yeah. It's your angel, your guardian angel. And then you put another little flower spacer bee just here. Obviously, then you get a head, don't you? Wings. Wings, thank you. Then you go wings. Yeah. Then you go head. Then halo. And then you go halo. And then you've got your statement jump ring. Come on now. Oh, that's lovely. And then you've got these two to connect her together. Isn't she sweet? She's lovely. Isn't she adorable? I bought these when they were first launched. Oh, so lovely. It's like, and we were talking about the sentiment of the angel, you know, not just, to, you know, lost loved ones, but also guardian angels. Yeah. Ultimately, Jade is considered to be ultra protective. Yeah. So, you know, uh, and not everybody is a uh, jewellery people. So my husband, for example, isn't a massive jewellery person. Oh, really? So something like this. Well, Brett, stretchy bracelets. He'll do stretchy bracelets. But He's something... on a key ring, yeah. couldn't he? Or yeah. hanging in his car or something, something like, like that. How yeah. lovely. How lovely. It's type A natural black jadeite seven and a half carats of we're at 49.99 and look like i said even i could put that together you might you might reconfigure it it's up to you um i'm fairly sure actually see this one here or maybe it's that one there in the middle that goes there yeah yeah so she kind of had like she kind of had a little ruffle didn't she um around the neck yeah she had like a ruffle on didn't she but you could do it that way too it's up to you 19 pounds and 99 pence um, now, we brought these for the first time ever with base metal, and the reason why we did that is because we wanted everybody to be able to own Taipei Jadeite. Oh, that's... You know, because feedback, you know, lots of people said, love Jade, but maybe it's beyond budget, mm. so um, put these little mini kits together. So you're getting Taipei Jadeite, um, but instead of putting the gram weight of sterling silver, which is obviously going to increase the price tag, we'll include it with base metal, um, so it, help, but it keeps that cost down. I love them. I absolutely love them. I think they could be nice little bookmarks. Oh, excuse me. I think they'd be amazing bookmarks. We didn't stop there, though. Oh. No, we weren't amazing. These flew, by the way, hundreds of these. Um, we had 160 to start. I've got 22 left. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> they absolutely flew on the original launch. Um, we're at 19.99, but going even lower. I know I haven't got many left, though. Is there 22? You said uh, 22 of them left. It's not polymer impregnated. It's not dyed. This is totally and utterly natural uh, Burmese black jadeite we all know the rarity of it don't we we know that jadeite is one of the world's rarest gemstones in the world um, these kits for the first time were actually put together with base metal so that we can basically make it accessible uh, to as many people um, as possible if you're thinking okay no well, i would only want that with silver then swap it out use it with something else that's fine um, and you've got these additional components too um, good luck everybody we went super duper duper low the lowest i've ever seen black jadeite on screen for by a mile, in actual fact. In seven seconds, it's happening. Remember, 22 of them is not, uh, not going to last long. 12.99. That's so good. I wasn't expecting that. If you're gifting it to somebody. It's lovely. To, um, I, had some, I made some angel charms for a craft fair that I did, uh, not with jade or anything like that but just with you know little wings and things and they just flew yeah because i put them in little organza bags what those little bags that we just had on a little ideal. just a chain so that people could put them on oh. key rings or hang them from the window or you know keep them in the purse it's just well you, that this is the thing that susie and i were talking about you know angels are 
significant to everybody, aren't they? Yeah. You know, whether it's a, from a protective, whether it's, you know, your beliefs, whether it's, like I said, uh, reminding you of a certain lost loved one, whichever it might be. They are universal, aren't yeah. they? So I think I'm not surprised that, uh, you know, that um, they flew. Well, my neighbour, when she lost her husband, um, that's what I gave her. I gave yeah. a little gemstone angel. Not the exact same one as this, but it was a gem uh, an angel all the, all the same. But again, it's the meaning behind that. £12.99 pence only, everybody. We had 22 um, Making one of the rarest gemstones, certainly uh, that we stock here at Jewelry Maker, but the reality is internationally, J Burmese jadeite is not coming from the ground. That's hundreds of years um, of history, um, which has well, stopped basically over um, over the past year or so. Twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. So, uh, and when we've got we've got uh, um, our suppliers, our wonderful jade suppliers, of which Dave is going to see. They go on Monday. Oh, really? Yeah, they go on Monday over to China. So it's Dave and Jake um, going over to meet up with Mr. Liu. Um, they're going to try, of course, and get some more jade, but. Um, it's not guaranteed because what our suppliers have all said is we can't sustain prices like this. No. Not, and it's, that's understandable, isn't it? When the world is willing to pay whatever price. Um, they've sold out. Congratulations. I do have that in the green jade as well. So um, if you would prefer to get it in, the, uh, in your sort of apple green, then you can do that as well. It's on the website. So take a little look at that one. Is it at the same price? Same price tag, so but there's only four of those ones, so do be quick on that one. Um, let's do the red jade out, shall we? Yeah. I'm just going to move this over perfectly, perfectly displayed by our lovely Kinga. So, yes, uh, uh, um, last weekend, yeah, it was, weekend just gone, we brought you a showcase of, uh, of kind of the last chance saloon basically of red jadeite that we right. have within our entire vault um and wayne actually came on air wayne's our gemstone buyer and sales manager and he actually said look this is it i can't get any more um well no let me rephrase that he can get more it's more expensive and it's treated so he's like, I don't want to do that. Um, so you referenced this earlier on. So why is red? Red jade is the rarest color of all jade. It's rarer than imperial. It is. Imperial green has actually been stockpiled over the hundreds of years. Yeah. That's been coming from the ground. And also this diagram, whilst very basic, kind of highlights that. Now, this doesn't happen every single time, though. Not every boulder will oxidize. Oh, really? No. I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah, not every boulder. So you don't wow. even, you're not guaranteed to get red in every boulder. So it's even rarer than I thought it was. Mm. Right. And you're lucky if you get like a proportion of red. But if you see this boulder as an example, you can see some imperial colours. You can see some of the apple blossom. You can even see the, where they've drawn on it on uh, the boulder to sort of map out where they're going to cut. Look how little of it, though, is red. I know, it's the tiniest bit. The smallest amount. That's why, you know, if you get red in a carving or you've seen red in a carving or in jewellery, um, it tends to be an area of. Whereas, look at this, it's complete solid red. Um, and that, yeah, it does come under the red umbrella. I know it's an orangey red, but that's... That's solid, exclusively red, no other colour additions. You know, we've shown that bangle in the past, haven't we, where they say, oh, red jadeite bangle. I'm sorry, it is, there's areas of it, but it's more white than it is red. Definitely. Do you see where I'm coming from? Mm -hmm. um, and look what it sold for back in 2014 when the mine was operational. Crazy. Yeah, 25,000 US dollars. And that's, that's what, almost 10 years ago, Imagine what it would sell for now. What would it sell for now, yeah. now that the Burmese mine is closed? Oh. This is the thing. Um, so red is easily the rarest colour of jade dye in the world. So much so that Roland Schlussel, um, who is, and I always mention him because he's kind of like the figurehead of jade in the West, you know, um, and he's also um, a fountain of knowledge, you know, he's hugely qualified in gemstones, but, and he specialises in him and his wife um, in jade. And when he was at uh, Tucson um, this year and the year previously, um, he actually said to um, our team, he was saying, look, when this, got, this is gone, and he was looking around the booth, when all this is gone, I'm going to have to diversify into another gemstone because I can't replace it. And there's his booth. Um, Look behind him, if you look over Dave's shoulder there, I can see lavenders, I can see some whites, I can see imperial greens, very, in fact, I don't think there is any red on there. Um, 
the closest one, second shelf down, about orangey-ish in the mm. middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, which would come under red, I suppose. But it's 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 very, very, very exclusive. We are talking about the rarest colours. So that's Roland Schlussel there. And the reason he's holding the magazine is because he wrote that article in that magazine ah. um, all about Jade. So if he can't get hold of it, then you can bet your bottom dollar we ain't going to get hold of it either. Um, here we go. And these are his words. The price of type A jade eye is right now at an all time high. Particularly difficult for us is the sourcing of the skin. Uh, this is the fancy colors of jade, the lavender and the red. These prized colors are so rare because this is the skin of the boulder as it oxidizes. This is why you never get solid red color sculptures or jewelry. Pardon? This is why you <laughs> never get solid red sculptures or jewelry. Yeah, I'm looking at a solid red sculpture. Um, the skin is so thin comparatively to the boulders, uh, sorry, and the boulders aren't coming out into the current market. Well, they're not at all now because no. um, the mine is closed. Um, so we did a showcase last weekend and it was the last of it, basically. This is it, I'm not going to get any more, end of story. And I've never been so definitive in that say sentence. Okay. You know, normally I'm like, oh, never say never. Yeah, yeah. Because you don't know, do you? However, we have been told categorically, no, you're not getting any more red jade eye. Um, it will be treated if you, if, if you get it at all. If you want the natural, now is the time for you to get hold of it because we're not going to get any more. I'm so glad I got mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know our sister channel, Gemporia, yeah. hasn't got red jade. Really? Not in, not nothing like this. Mm -hmm. They 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 have a couple of beads here and oh, there, yeah. but nothing like this or like what you're and wearing. That is size. If you showed Dave that, honestly, he would be an absolute gobsmacked. And you know that it, attention to detail, like when you get these jade pieces, like this was on um, such a lovely knotted yeah. cord, and it even had like it went thinner so that you could. Um, put your clasp on if you wanted to but I left it on the cord because the cord was so lovely so if anyone pulls on it it won't break no nope. it's knotted and like this is a tiny little piece of jade this is a really yeah good it's a big size. size so you could put it on the bottom of a mala or you could wear yeah. it up on the decolletage and you're really going to see it. it oh wow can you imagine yeah, it, it what earrings it's go as well to, yeah. well yeah good point that is a good <laughs> point because type a jade I, there is a type, type a red jade I, in particular there's no two ways about it it's an investment Investment stone. You've just heard from Roland Schlussel. Yeah. Here is a gemstone. Um, these colours have turned the industry on its head. The demand and supply is a real issue. As such, we are seeing some of the highest prices for this material, and still dealers are reluctant to sell because it's simply irreplaceable. We are finding easier to provide imperial green to our clients at a more affordable price tag for the first time. Imperial green is more affordable than red at the moment. So, yeah, that does speak volumes. Mm. At £499, I'm not going to sit here and say that's not a uh, you know, considered amount of money, but comparatively speaking, it absolutely is for what you are actually getting here. It's irreplaceable. You've just said it there. You've just heard it there from Pillar and Stone themselves. At £199, I love this. You've got that wonderful infinity, um, beautiful fluid carving. Um, you could so easily just put this onto a lark's head knot. You really could. So it's it's very. You can change the style of it quite easily by you know. Imagine if you added a mala or rosary link, or then if you wanted to add cord or leather, you'd go down a completely different style route. Yeah, I love the simplicity of it. I think it shows off the red jade beautifully. It's stunning, absolutely stunning, and it is solid red, isn't it? Mm, it really is. We're at one hundred ninety nine pounds. How many have we got then, Roscoe? Twenty available. Wow. Now is the time to get it. If you love red jade, I always think it's, I always say it on air, it's like a cherry tomato red, isn't it? It's, yeah, not like any red that I know. Really. No, it's really distinctive, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Today is the day to get hold of it. Now, what we have within the vault, because it's irreplaceable, we aren't going to be able to get any more. We've made peace with that fact. And I understand it as well. It makes sense that our suppliers are saying this to us. Look, you can't have any more. Sorry, that's it. That is it. That's still hand carved. It's a yeah. yeah master carving. Yeah, we haven't even said that. No, I mean, just overlooked the fact that it's a... Hand carved by an artisan that's probably had those skills passed down through generation yeah. to generation. This is the kind of jewellery that I like, that I get passionate about which yeah. you know has given lots of artisans their business their livelihood over hundreds of years and passed down that knowledge it's what we all do as jewelry makers yeah. isn't it that's true that is true you know to add that to your and then you make something with it it's adding to that story it's lovely that's a nice way of looking at it it is isn't it you're adding like to the like story. your your never ending loop effectively exactly. we are we are very fortunate genuinely 
to get this opportunity. And if you love the look of Red Jade, I do it now. I did not expect that. I thought it was going to be 149. Did you? <laughs> yeah. I mean, that would have been amazing too. Because the reality is, if this was at Pillar and Stone, you'd have been talking four figures. Wow. Eat at a wholesale, by the way. That's a wholesale yeah, prize. Absolutely a wholesale prize. Um, look, you can look elsewhere. You can find. Oh, let's show the Mason K color wheel because that shows the quality of what you're getting here perfectly. Um, so, and you look, you get the yellows and the oranges and the reds all come under red. Okay. So that's that, that umbrella. Um, but you can see the quality that you are getting here. The boulder skin has completely disappeared from the market as it's the only material that has never been stockpiled. This has resulted in the most drastic price jump in the jade market uh, Jade market has ever seen. We strongly feel that it won't be long before the auction record is held by purple or red uh, jade, which changes everything we've ever understood about jade. And that's Tucson 2022. And he's not wrong, is he? No. He's, not, he's not been wrong. We knew that... Um, um, uh, yeah, stockpile. You can't stockpile this colour because there's simply not enough of it around. How many do we have of these? 20? My core screen's playing up. I can't, I can't see anybody as of yet. 11 of these have already gone. Amazing. So I think you, sorry to interrupt. No, I think you'll regret it because I am denied about this red jade. I was like, I'm really attracted to it. I, I really want it. I am Denard. And I'm really glad that I've got it now because I didn't even realise. I mean, I knew about skin. I knew about the rarity, but I didn't know that we couldn't get any more. No. And I'm, I'm really in love with untreated yeah, gems. Yeah, same. Treated gems definitely have their place and I've got those and I like them, but I... There's something special about untreated, like, as Mother Nature intended. And do you know what, Debbie? In years to come, if ever you did decide that you wanted to maybe generate some income, mm. you have something incredibly valuable yeah, in Red Jade Eye. Incredibly yeah. valuable. Please know that what you've just purchased is not a £99 price tag. It is for us but not anywhere else. Now, just before we go into the next auction, so we have an announcement at 9 o'clock. Oh, King is going to part. So I'm not to say this out loud. Okay. Okay. So I'm in the know. Can I show Debbie? What about it? tomorrow? <gasps> is this a. Okay. Tomorrow. Oh my goodness <laughs> me. Oh my goodness me. Make sure you're watching at nine o'clock and I'll tell you. Oh my goodness. That's so exciting. Oh, oh, no, sorry, I'm being that really annoying person now that's got something you're really desperate to know. And it's, I know I'm being that really annoying person. Oh, my goodness. me! You've only got, you've only got 20 minutes. I'm not allowed to tell you. I want to. Believe me, I do. Nine o'clock. Oh, my goodness. That's epic. Very exciting, that is. So exciting. I'm going to say that is probably one of the biggest deals in jewellery maker history. Ever. Uh, ever. We didn't think we'd ever be able to do this. Let's just put it that way. Ever. In fact, we've said that on air, haven't we? We've mm. said we'll never do that. Oh, oh I can't wait to tell you. <laughs> Don't have to wait too long to tell No, me. I know. I'm sorry. I know it's really annoying when people do that. You know, oh, I've got the most exciting news. That I can't tell you, though. There's nothing no. worse. There's nothing Me worse. Too. There's nothing worse. Right then, make sure you're with me at nine o'clock today. That is amazing. Um, in the meantime, though, let's do white jadeite high goo. Um, so we all know that. Look, ninety-nine pounds for red jadeite. It's a, you know, it's a great deal, but it's still a lot of money. I get that. Yeah. I totally get that. Um, so let's try and bring you Imperial White, by the way, that was once upon a time exclusively reserved to, uh, um, to uh, um, it was the Imperial Crown, wasn't it? So you were never allowed to, no, what do we call it? So I've just gone blank now for a second. Emperors, there we go. So um, exclusively emperors were allowed to wear this. Really? Nobody else. Um, the white was considered to be, um, at that time, uh, the most sought after. That's pure. It That's is. natural. It really is. Look at it. Circle of heaven. You've got all those lovely connections. Now, $49.99 wow. for type A pure white jade eye in a high goo. I mean, you look on the colour wheel just there of, of Mason and Kay, you'll notice, again, look how pure and white those colours are. Natural, of course. Look how pure and white the one I have here in the studio is. Natural. This is formed within the ground over millions of years. We're at £49.99. And we're going lower. 
I'll tell you what we're going to do. There are 40 available. Ross wants to see 40 of you on the phone lines. On the next price crash, and, and notice I said next. We're at 49.99. Let's, what? This is bonkers. We've half the price, and I still said the word next. Look, then 24.99. Uh huh. Oh, that's a good deal. It's an amazing it's deal. A good deal. <laughs> oh. That's amazing. 24.99 is amazing. Stay there. Stay there one sec. I'm not leaving you, Debbie. Don't worry. Come back out. I'm not leaving you. Oh, I clocked yeah. this earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. I found it earlier on. It was in the studio, just on the shelf. So I can't not show it. Claire made it yesterday. Oh my goodness me. That's gorgeous. Stop the clock. No, I can't see you at the moment. Our call screen's having a funny five minutes. So Ross is just saying, be honest, there's 40 available, three in baskets. We have a look at this. Really? This is, you know, this is pure white natural jadeite not bleached and dyed we are uh, uh, it's uh, do you know right now if sotheby's or christie's or bonhams were tuning into little old jewelry maker they'd be rolling their eyes at us you know it's not it's not dyed it's not bleached it's not polymer impregnated no. it is the investment stone that that roland schlussel has spoken about in the past it's totally and utterly natural and I know, look, I get this question all the time. Well, how are you bringing it on air at $24.99? It's purely down to how we bought. Please know that this is worth so much more than what's on your screens. So, so, so much more. Do you remember, cast your mind back to when we, when we launched Imperial White Jade with Sally Hewer. Think, think back to those yeah. prices. And we have sourced, which were amazing, by the way, Remember, Richard, Richard Wise, which if you are a gem enthusiast, you'll probably have heard of his name. Um, Richard Wise wrote Secrets of the Gem Trade. Um, I would encourage anybody to get that book and get it on Amazon and places like that. It's not one of those gem books that's cost a fortune. Okay. I mean, if you go for the, uh, uh, you know, hard official back, hardback yeah. ones, yes, they're a bit more expensive, but you can get it in a paperback. Um, and he said, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochon of pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency, that's precisely what I'm holding, exactly. would be the finest of its type. Wow. That's Richard Wise. I, I unbelievably, we're at $24.99. At this price, stick a round brilliant cut diamond in the center. Oh. I mean, I know that's... Yes, please. You want it up to the neckline? So you can get an idea of perspective. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Pearl choker with that on. Oh, can I also do this? At this price point, why not? That would be gorgeous. Wouldn't they be lovely? And they? easy to make because you could use sterling silver wire, just pop it through, wrap a loop at the top. You could put, um, you know, any gemstone that you wanted. It would go with absolutely anything on top of that, and then just put it into the earring finding of your choice. Super We've got simple, stunning. Oh stunning my goodness, me, amazing. Truly amazing. And we were, uh, Ross was just kind of flicking through a PowerPoint there of white jade and I noticed some pieces that have sold at auctions, Christie's, all of those. And, and I, I, I'm not really bothered about what they sold for, but immediately I noticed just how pure white this is. Yeah. In comparison, because theirs is still like an off-white colour. Yeah, this is very, very... That's linen fresh, isn't it? Yeah, very, very sort of clear white. Yeah. Like a cloud. Like a fluffy cloud. Mm. Twenty four ninety nine. We are going lower. Good luck and well done, everybody. Uh, uh, by the way, staff members, we're better off getting involved oh. during this auction as well, <laughs> considerably so. That's ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. We do we do faceted calibrated stones. Imagine putting them on a tube set and then setting it in I've the middle. I've done that on a 
jadeite donut oh. a while, good long time ago. Uh, it was in a kit. Was it in a kit? Anyway, I did it. And it's not difficult. No. You just, you know, get the little tube settings and then a gemstone, set it in, pop it in the middle. Beautiful. Just, oh, it looks gorgeous. This is the stuff that you wouldn't be, honestly, genuinely, you would see on first dibs for fortunes. I'm not qualified to value items, but we all know that that's not, this is not 19.99 in terms of what I'm holding in my hands. It's 19.99 for you to get to purchase today, but it's, it, you know, we know for type A Burmese, pure white jadeite with that translucency, um, that texture that Richard Wise spoke about, that's not, you know, does it, you can't connect those dots. Um, make sure you're checking out. We had 40 available opportunities. I can't see your name, so I'm sorry, but um, Roscoe will keep me updated on the quantities. They should be flying out. Is that right? Are they flying out? 17 left. 22 of you have it in your baskets. Well, if they're available come the top of this hour, I'll be getting on, on that. Uh, and I'll probably get a couple of them as well. Imagine this. I was thinking a ring. <coughs> Excuse me. It would be a gorgeous ring. Absolutely stunning. Do you reckon if we put together a kit with some, with some round, brilliant cut stones to put in the centre? Yeah, that would be absolutely stunning. Wouldn't it? Even gallery wire. So yeah. yeah. I'm looking at your, the ring you're wearing today. That's just claw set. Um, but you could do that, couldn't you? Oh, yeah. You could do that with, this, with, with, with type A jadeite. That's Moonstone. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. That's from our sister channel. Oh, Debbie, that's amazing. I'm loving that. 19.99. Make sure you are checking out because they are, uh, we're over allocated on those anyway. So amazing. Don't forget your early bird as well. Coming up, I've got 104 of these available. Um, not long to wait on these, so solid 925 sterling silver with your lobster claw, so it's on and offable, basically. What is it? I can't see it from here. Is it a little, it looks like a little mushroom. What is it? Is it a little like It's just, cap? yeah, it's like a cap. Yeah, just like an embellished cap. I love that. Isn't That's it so unusual. Yeah. So you can, you can... Yeah, it looks like a little, because I'm a bit obsessed with little toadstools. It's just, <laughs> it's so cute. It is. I really what, you like it. You want to put a little fairy it. under there. Yeah. Amazing. You can shop ahead and pre-order on this one. Thank you. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Coming up. But should we do some pearls? Oh, I love this strand. There aren't many left. We've only got a few of them left. Seven, to be truthful. Um, um, it's the, this is the only strand that we've ever brought to wear with your embedded pearls encrusted pearls um <laughs> what was that sorry i just mouthed to l i want this because i put it in my basket and i didn't check it out stupidly <gasps> because i was busy and out and about and then it's in, still in my basket and it says out of stock so you must have i know you must have had a few back in stock and I, it, this is the one with the little yeah with the gemstones i'm not going to get it on my um have you got your phone with you now no well, yeah, but I'm not logged in or anything. It's not fair if there's only seven, but you never know. There might, one might pop back. Wish, wish list, list it. it. Wish list it, absolutely. Okay. Um, so we've brought them individually where they're half drilled for you to make your pendants and your earrings. That's it. I love it. These are through drilled, so you can incorporate them into your, um, into your um, knotted pearls if you wanted. These aren't just crystal. The, that's genuine gemstone. So you've got within here peridot, sapphire, and also tourmaline, and they're framed with sterling silver. Mm -hmm. um, in the past, certainly I've shown you lots of different, well, I say lots, there's not that, that, that many, but there's a few high-end designers that are encrusting pearls. And what we've got to consider is that th th something like this, I know, I know some of our audience can do it. I know you can gemstone set into a pearl, but it's quite labor intensive, isn't it? You need tools. You need the tools. You know, and it's, it, a lot of our viewers, I'm sure, could do it, but whether they want to spend out on the tools to do it. Yeah, true. For the amount of pearls they're going to do. You could get one with with diamonds in a ring. Oh, hello. It's lovely. £2,900. Maybe not. Oh, maybe something like, I love oh, this. Perfectly imperfect cute. Baroque and Keshi pearls embedded. Three. £3,200. I've got seven of these left. Are you ready? Because we're not even stopping there. We are no way near done. Oh, I hope you do wish list it, Debbie, because the seven, the last seven, and the only strand of embedded pearls that we've ever brought you, encrusted, I should say, uh, 79 pounds. That's crazy. Um, absolutely amazing. And I love the size of these Baroque pearls That's as well. Thing. That's why I like them. I've got the larger ones, but I think these are 
perfect. You could even make earrings of these. They're beautiful, aren't they? So can you see you've got sapphire, topaz. There's your topaz. There's your sapphire. Tourmaline and peridot. How, oh no, that's the sapphire, beg your pardon. There's your tourmaline. How beautiful are these? I mean, that one on its own, that one on its own should be £79. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On its own, look at the split payment, £26.33. pence. So just having that on a pendant, on a sterling silver chain, would yeah. be so beautiful. And that's more than your £79. Definitely. I mean, you know, and then you've got all of the others amazing a full strand of them well done everybody the final few opportunities now um i'm going to bring you um one more auction before we step into that beautiful sterling silver class um always display pearls on a white piece of paper um now these are lovely so you've got uh, a bundle of drop pearls la peregrina uh -huh. which is one of the most uh, uh famous pearls in the world these are natural colors so you've got your apricot and you've got the pink and you've also got a pair of your um, pure whites remember we always talk about the five virtues size shape color firstly size they're generous shape they're drop pearls which can be some of the most expensive color is natural then we start talking about the nacre and the luster but when you're talking one or more pearls you also need to talk about uniformity as well so these are perfectly paired you're getting three genuine natural cultured pearl pairs of earrings if you wanted to potentially or maybe six necklaces whichever yeah. at 99.99 but there's a clock on our screen. How many have you got, Roscoe? 22 available. Ross is like, oh, these are, this is a lovely bundle. Yeah, I agree. Pack of six of them. It's timeless one pearl on a necklace. Yeah. And, you know, if you don't know what somebody likes, I made one of Daisy's best friend's mum. She wanted me to make her mum something for her birthday, so we decided on one pearl on a sterling silver chain. Lovely. And absolutely loved it because it's timeless. Yeah, and you think how much that would cost in a jeweler's? And she was writing it down. I was telling her what kind of pearl it was. And if she's writing it down, she went, I'm going to get so many brownie points. Oh, <laughs> bless her. Look at the screens. Oh, are you kidding me? Uh, That's three pairs of earrings right there. I know. £6.66 per pair of earrings. I know. And but they're natural. They're not even dyed. That's amazing. Isn't it? So you think, or six pendants, as you were just describing, and you could get, you, your, 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 did you say your friend? It was Daisy's friend. Daisy's mom. friend. So she go, oh, here we are, mum. This is a natural papaya, natural pink pearl, That's natural, it. She wrote it all yeah, cultured yep. pearl, um, drop shape, size this, uh, and yeah, love that. Absolutely love it. Look at the quality of them. Six pound sixty six per, per pair. How amazing is that? Make sure you are checking out your baskets. Um, they're half drilled. So, for example, your early bird. Let's have a little look. Your early bird, that is coming up. I'm going to go with a Ooh, pink. Yes. I wonder. I do have some hypo cement in my... You might need to cut the peg down a little bit. It's better to have it longer, though. Yeah. Because, you know, you don't... You, for the security of your piece, very, very easy to um, just snip off if you don't... Oh, look, that is so cute. Look how beautiful that oh, is. I love that. When's that coming up? This is coming up next. <gasps> it's coming up next. So yeah, if you cut it down a little bit, it would fit on top of the pearl and the peg. Yeah, there's always, it's always better to have too much sterling Definitely. silver than too little of them. This is coming up in one auction sign, but that you get the idea. You can use that with um, your half drilled gemstones. Um, make sure you're checking out on these. We had how many, Roscoe? 22. Make sure you're checking out. There's already lots of you there. Fabulous. We're going to dive into, um, into a little break. Um, and then after that break, we're going to bring you that beautiful, beautiful class. Be ready. Be ready to check it out. Also happening after the break is the announcement. I'm not going to sleep tonight, am I? I know I'm not going to sleep tonight. <laughs> Seriously, because that's... Eff this is historic. If you, oh, I'm just going to give you one kind of last hint. It's historic. What's, what, what we're going to announce. And it's incredibly exciting. Don't go anywhere. Check out your baskets on this hour. That beautiful clasp stroke bale is coming up in a few moments time and the announcement.
this July. Join us for the big summer blowout. We are launching 927 brand new products. We have a mega managers clearance event. Mark Smith's anniversary show and Christmas in July. Yes, you heard that right. Christmas in the summer. So join us for Jewelry Maker's Big Summer Blowout. It's going to be a scorcher of a month. Miss it and you'll miss out. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Uh, welcome back, everybody. She's on it. I'm making a starfish for Willow. Carry on. Yeah. <laughs> Carry on, guys. I just, yeah, I'm listening. Yeah, it is. It's 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 important. It's for you know. Can't Willow does not want to go as Patrick from SpongeBob SquarePants. Fair enough. I thought it was brilliant. She's mortified. Okay. <laughs> so, we need Rachel so Morris. I was like, don't worry. Willow, I'm on with Debbie in the morning and I'm sure she'll be able to sort Rachel it. Rachel Norris would be better. <laughs> no, you'll be amazing. Right then, your amazing class was coming up as your early bird. You're already shopping ahead on that. But the announcement. Now, oh, yeah. this is huge. To put it into perspective, this is absolutely huge. And this is huge not just for jewellery maker, this is huge for the partnership. Um, because... Do you know, to put this into perspective, there are very, very, very few jewellery establishments, certainly not your high street jewellers, definitely not. Um, we are talking about creme de la creme, 
the, the maisons, as they call themselves, mm. it's that ilk that could possibly, and I do say possibly, be able to offer you the opportunity that we have for you tomorrow. It's exciting stuff. Name your rarest gemstones in the world and you'll name your granddigerite, your jadeites, mm -hmm. won't you? You'll name your alexandrites, those gemstones which we've had. A gemstone that we have said on air, we will never have this gem. We will never be able to bring this gem to our audience because if you see... I saw one at Tucson, by the way. I saw one and it was about, that, I don't know, six mil? One. And that was the in, for, of the entire booth. There was only one. And it was staggeringly expensive. Incredibly expensive. You might think, Al, just come on. Sit <laughs> it out. What are you talking about here? Sorry, I'm building because this is so, so monumental. For those of you that love rarity beauty this is a very definition of what a gemstone is isn't it is it rare oh my goodness yes is it beautiful breathtakingly so we've just googled what is it why is it so rare mm -hmm. there you go oh that will be a question that many of you will answer another Why is it so valuable? That's the other. Catch me if you can. The rarity of bleep gemstone. We are talking about something that is usually so rare, so expensive, none of us could ever even entertain um, owning. And another title, say it again. This gemstone, I believe, to be the rarest in the world. I'm talking about mellow pearls. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. I know. I can't get my head around that. A mellow pearl, by the way, is not a traditional pearl. It's not the same thing. It's not the same thing at all. It doesn't form in the same way. Um, and, and like I said, I, I, listen, I'm not nearly qualified enough to even uh, sort of I don't want to start talking about it because in case I say it wrong, um, I will be researching it this evening. But, uh, but Dave is stepping into the studio to talk to you and introduce Mellow Pearls to the Gemporia partnership for the first time ever. When we first launched Conch, he spoke about Mellow Pearls, didn't he? You know, like it was like a fantasy, like we would never actually own this, never see it in person. Goodness me, no way. Um, and that conch was likened to a mellow pearl. Um, this is not likened to, it is a mellow pearl. How, what, you know, how are we, because I'm learning this at the same time as you right now. So how are we getting this? Is it in singles? We don't even know. All we know is it's happening tomorrow. How unbelievable, so exciting. Um, do you want to just see a visual of it? Mm. Can, we, can we show a visual? We've got nothing. Oh. oh, oh, we've got nothing to show you. It has literally just landed. That's how excited we are. We can't wait. We want to bring it to you literally the next day. So how amazing. Again, if you've never heard of Mellow Pearls, if you go on, the, if you go on, if you go on Google, so let's show you a few of the headlines. What's a mellow, uh, mellow, mellow pearl and why is it so valuable? Okay, um, these are just the top three headlines. What is a mellow, mellow pearl and why is it so rare? Catch me if you can, the rare mellow pearl, the world's most valuable pearl found within giant mellow, mellow snail shells and once thought to come from dragons can change wow. hands for thousands, I guess that's of years. Um, we are talking ex probably the rarest opportunity, not probably, the rarest opportunity we've ever done here at Jewelry Maker uh, and probably it will ever do. That's happening tomorrow. It's a big announcement. Okay. <laughs> Compose yourself.
the deal of the day today, another brand new opportunity. Not in a gemstone, because you've seen angelite before, but you've never seen this color before. No. This is brand new. It's peacock angelite. It's stunningly beautiful. I want it. And me. It's got areas of translucency in there as well. It's absolutely beautiful. That's happening at 10 o'clock today, as, as you can see, um, in different sizes. So just to go back to the Mellow Pearl, Ross has just found Christie's, okay. Um, Christie's had one for auction, an extremely rare Mellow Pearl. Look at the estimate. Oof. Look at the price realised. And, 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 and that's not set in jewellery. That's just a single Mellow Mellow Pearl. Whoa. Not set in jewellery. Are they going to be affordable or i mean what are we gonna be we know not? nothing okay we got know so nothing. many questions probably we'll do i mean it's jewelry maker yeah, so yeah. it's not going to be it's 722 000 is it i hope not i mean that, that <laughs> of course not three quarters of a million for one mellow pearl don't know the size but it's sold right then okay <gasps> 10 o'clock tomorrow for that. Okay, let's bring your early bird, everybody. Um, I hope that you've been shopping ahead on this. We had 104 of them. That's I'm not really going to be this. enough. Yeah, me too. Um, on and offable, you know, just like the tortoise said in Creature <laughs> yeah. Comforts. Um, don't go anywhere because it's your early bird. <laughs> Jack Jonesy, that isn't it? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, <laughs> Jack Jones. Um, it's always better when we're together. It's, it's not it's Jack Johnson. Johnson, there you go. Jack Jones's clothes, yeah. <laughs> Got a bit wrong there. But Jack I'm Johnson. It's always better when you're together. There you go, that one. It is a little bit like him. Um, anyway, anyway, <laughs> let's bring your early bird because what's better than a beautiful peg bale? A cup of tea. A cup, <laughs> a cup of tea is... Uh, well, I'll tell you what's I better. I don't think people can argue with that, though. A cup of tea is good. Oh, I love tea. What's better is one that looks like a little mushroom. Looks like a little mushroom and it's on an offer bowl. It's easily on an offer bowl. <laughs> Every time you say that, I picture him saying that. Yeah, a little plasticine tortoise. This is so pretty. What's it got set into it? I can't oh, see. it's embellished with beautiful gems. Are we talking topaz here? Or are we talking cubic zirconia? Oh, it's so sparkly. Dazzling luster, though, and it's yeah. 360, too. Um, the fact that this gives us adjustability, Debbie, because, like I said, we all wear, I, I, well, I certainly do wear multiple pieces of jewellery on my days off. I, I don't wear, I'm not allowed to wear much when I'm, I'm, I'm in work, but as soon yeah. as I'm outside the studio, I've got my jewellery on, my necklaces, my chains, my bracelets, whatever it might be. And this means you can swap it around because it's not sort of set in one piece. Well, I've got this favourite pearl that I've got, and it's just like a plain pearl pearl and it is just formed in a heart shape mm. so and it's really beautiful and it's on just um a, a peg bell like this yeah I got it um god years ago from here and it's around my neck but I've got this big fat sterling silver bangle that I made Ooh. I'd love to have it on but I'm not gonna dismantle it now because so if you had something like this and you thought oh do you know what I'd love to put that on my bangle just for tonight because it goes with this outfit or whatever you could do that. So you don't have to be dismantling things. You can just put them on different, you know, and also, you know, if you've got one of these on a bracelet, it's kind of hanging down and it gets in your way. Yeah. Then you can just take it off and yeah. you don't have to have it. Yeah. So that's really, really useful. So super adjustable. Um, you might deconstruct these components. Yeah. You might, it's, you know, you're the jewellery maker. You might go, I'm going to use the peg bail on its own and I'm going to use the lobster claw clasp elsewhere. Yeah. Um, but everybody, I've only got 104 of these available, or I should say had, because lots of you are flying in for this. Uh, for me, out of all my sterling silver findings, I use a peg bail probably more than anything. Mm. I make pendants more than anything. Yeah. Because they're so, so, so giftable. Are we all happy at 14.99? Yeah. Yeah, what do we absolutely. think? There's yeah. a lot of silver in that. Yeah, that's good. There's a lot of silver. How about... Twelve ninety nine. It's a lot of sterling silver. 
I'd be getting multiples of these, like Sandra's just done on the website. I'd be multi buying too, Sandra. Oh, we can see everyone again. Yay! Yeah, we haven't been ignoring you. It's just our, our TV screen. Michael's fixed it. Thanks, Michael. Um, yeah, we haven't been ignoring you. We just haven't been able to see your names. Another price crash. Big statement clasp. Beautiful, beautiful uh, um, pendant feature. Eleven ninety nine. I've paid seven ninety nine for a large lobster claw clasp on its own in the past. Seven ninety nine. Not encrusted. No, and it doesn't have a little mushroom on it. Doesn't I know it's not a mushroom, but it is. Doesn't have the bail. No, just the clasp. And <laughs> on that basis, then. That means you're going to be getting the bit at the bottom, the, the peg bale bit, for £2, because we're going under £10 today. That is an incredible I want to multi-buy on these. Oh, have we got lots? No, there's only 104. It's not enough. Oh. If we had 300, I'd be a little bit more confident. With I'd multi-buy. And me. Like, at least three, because you've got um, earrings. Yeah. Possibly. Um, you know, if you've got hoops and you want to just clip this onto your hoops. Oh, hoops. Yeah. Um, and uh, a necklace. Do you like hoops by any chance? I, 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 like, I like all jewellery. I, I like just wanted to say hoops, that's hoops. all. Hoops. <laughs> it's just a good word, isn't it? It's hoops. 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 Um, we're going under £10. Lots of multi buyers like Debbie and I are saying I would be getting involved on this one. So all of a sudden it's like, okay, I don't want to wear that on my bracelet today. I'm going to attach it to a curb chain. I'm going to attach it to a knotted necklace. I'm going to attach it to a stretchy. I'm going to attach it to some of my wire work. Exactly. It's, it's interchangeable jewellery. Or even, like, forget that. I mean, that is genius, but even forget that. You could take the lobster claw clasp off, mm -hmm. use it as a regular bale, and you've got a really decent sized lobster claw clasp. Yeah. And your little mushroom bale. Absolutely. Love it's, that. It's not supposed to be a mushroom, but. I no, but it looks a little it's bit. It's so cute with the little encrusted. Oh, I love it. It's cute. It is cute. Loads of you there. Loads of multi buyers. Well done. Good morning, Linda, Winifred, Kirsty, Leslie. Nine ninety nine. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a brilliant price. Aren't you glad you multi bought? I wish I had more. Though that's the only thing. Sylvia, Jackie, Christine, Linda, uh, Winifred, Kirsty, Ruby, Cambridgeshire. Hello to you, Nancy. Hello to you, Jamati, West Midlands, Claire, Sandra, Sharon, uh, Jacqueline. Look at the quantities. Those two threes and fours getting snapped up and yeah, purchased. I'm not surprised. That's why I was like, oh, 104 is not going to be enough, is it? And we've all got, you know, the gemstone that's half drilled. Yeah. That maybe when we got it, we feel, oh, bar humbug, it's half drilled. I, don't I know like half drilled gemstones. See, I do, but sometimes I think, oh, I wish that was drilled all the way through. Just sometimes. And then you think, oh, I haven't got the right thing, the ones I've got, da, da, da. If you've got those, that's perfect. It's perfect. I love half drilled gemstones, because look, I even carry it around with me, bear with. Even I, even I, who's not a professional jewellery maker, got hypo cement that's all you need <laughs> that's all you need uh, get your hypo cement Literally. get your bale get yeah. your half drill gemstone glue it together leave it overnight job done professional jewelry and just make sure you leave it i know you, you know i oh, i'm saying i know it's me i've got no patience i put it on think i can't wait to wear it so i have to remember to do it the night before or whatever do you, um, do you remember fleur she did that with a pair of earrings and then they got glued to her ear <laughs> That's the sort of thing I do. I would feel so much better that I've heard that. Not because I wanted Fleur to be damaged in any way, but I've done that to myself and I thought yeah. I was alone. I, no, 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 I would be that impatient. I've glued person, my fingers but... to the table before now. Yeah. I'm like, hurry, yeah. oh no, I put too much glue in. Patience with the patience, glue. Patience, patience, patience. Uh, so many multi buyers, <laughs> we had 104 of them. I definitely do not have anywhere near that quantity now. There's twos, threes, fours um, getting snapped up. I'm not surprised. Make sure you are checking out your baskets to guarantee your success, everybody. Embellish, beautiful luster. I mean, you think about big Brock pearl or... Mm, definitely. Um, amber. One of the angel eye. I mean, it yeah, doesn't that would love. that would be lovely. Should we do it? Should we just, should we just imagine? You've got a long enough pin that you could do that. Just one. <gasps> Look at that. Yes. Now we've got 30 left, says Ross. Says oh. I'm going to give you one minute to close this auction. Okay. Yeah, we've for the last 30. If you love the gemstone I'm holding, it's a launch of your peacock angelite. It's coming up at 10 o'clock today. Look how beautiful that is. That's what I mean. I mean, look, it doesn't have to be half drilled at all. No. Because the benefit of having that long pen is it will hold the gemstone. Yeah. Gonna get that adherence. Do you know I could be a designer? You know, you, you, you'd, you'd be good at that. You'd be good at that. Should I ever go? Definitely, should definitely should. 
if we were in school, you know, your careers advisor, oh, yeah. they would, uh, um, they'd say, yeah, you should try jewellery making, you know, you should be a designer. They told me to go to art college and I ignored them. Oh. I wish I had. I wish I'd gone to art uni. But they I, my career advisor, because I, I always wanted to do, because uh, um, in my A-levels I did law, and biology and art. Oh, that's really interesting. Yeah, and then I, because I always wanted to go into criminology, because I'm really oh, fascinated that's really by that. But they're like, no, they weren't very. They weren't. In <laughs> oh, bless. Like, <laughs> how no. rude. Yeah, they didn't have confidence in me going into that. And to be honest, they weren't wrong. <laughs> they weren't wrong. <laughs> well done, everybody. Yeah, oh, bless. Them. You could be like um. She's a trier. Abby Shuto on NCIS, but you'd be the most glamorous criminologist that ever walked in. <laughs> Fascinates me though. Stand Fascinates aside, me. police officers. Yes. I'm here. You can't handle the truth. <laughs> <laughs> right then, shall we do? I do. Yes. <gasps> Can I just show you this? Now, this is brand new. It's never been on your screens previously before. In fact, this has been um, authorised by um, Mr. Mr. Uh, uh, Pasco, um, <laughs> a.k.a. Wayne. Um, these are brand new. There's 100 available. <gasps> oh, that's so... <gasps> I, I need know. that. Look at the bail. Um, and then I'm gonna look how beautiful that is. And then and it comes with these two. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm gonna say out loud that this might well be the lowest priced type A jadeite kit you've ever seen. Brand new. Can oh, I make a gorgeous. suggestion with this? Oh, stop it. Can I? I need that. I, I absolutely need that. Look at that. <gasps> that is so oh, that's heavenly, isn't it? That's I mean, pure white jadeite. Oh. Can we open the kit when? At the end of this hour, as a star buy, so you haven't got too long to wait, it will go perfectly with your peacock. Natural, by the way, natural peacock's jade. Uh, I, I can't cope Angel with uh, Angelite as well. I, oh, I've gosh. never seen anything like so that. Lush. Oh. Such a beautiful show today. Oh. Beautiful, beautiful show. Here's me distracting you. You're meant to be making an angel, a starfish. Yeah, but look, I'm, I'm getting there. <laughs> This is as That's so good. I tried doing it last night. Mine looked nothing like a starfish. But I'll, yeah, Patrick. Um, it looks like Patrick at the moment. <laughs> right then. Are we ready? <laughs> Roscoe? I'm ready. Uh, are we going to do Debbie's kits? Now this, to our knowledge, I think it's the first time that we've had coloured findings. I've not seen them. If we, if we have had them, it was donkeys years ago. Yeah, many, many a moons ago. So you've got two three, four kits to choose from. Um, they're all available on pre-order right now. Um, so coloured findings. Look, if yeah. you uh, if you see or or, De or Debbie's jewellery, whichever way you want to do so it. So the coloured findings are on the red earrings, and then I'm going to demo with the black one. So you've got black findings. Yeah. So what I really liked was the fact that if you're making, you know, and you want to make a real statement by adding in those coloured findings. Like I've added silver wire there to show that, mm. you know, it doesn't have to be all like red. Um, no. But if you wanted to, you could get some red wire and have it all red. Yeah, beautiful. But I just think that the, the difference between the silver and you could also have gold would be nice with red. Yeah, that would, really that would be really nice. Quite, quite, um, does anyone else think it's got quite a like a, a gothic vibe to it? Yeah, it's, it's very modern, it's very different. It gives your jewellery something different. Edgy. Edgy. Yeah. Edgy's the word. Makes it really, really edgy. Um, okay, so I'm going to start with... So they're coming up there on pre-order. I'm going to start... Oh, this I is love beautiful. The on Excuse me, I'm having a sip of tea. You carry on with your cup of tea. Look at the findings. So I'm going to go uh, show you each and every single one. So 95 sterling silver. They are gorgeous. Heart head pins. They are so beautiful. They're really substantial as well. Heart toggle yep. as well. Let me get my tweezers. So there's your heart toggle. Pretty. 925 sterling silver. You get two pairs of your shepherd hooks. Oh, look at these. Yeah, little spacers. Little heart spacers. Very Van Cleef and up -ends. Um, So you get two of those. You get your length of sterling silver chain. You get your sterling silver jump rings. You get your crimp sterling silver yep. and your crimp covers. And you're getting that beautiful, beautiful strand of genuine cultured pearls. I mean, is that that necklace? That, yeah, I can see it there. Do you want to bring it, put it in the centre of the screen? Uh, centre of the desk, rather. <laughs> oh, Whatever, sorry. we're in a predicament now. It's between Michael and I. Sorry, Michael. Um, Thank you. Now, those pearls. Oh, Debbie, that's beautiful. And what I've done is 
I've used the spacer, so it's like one of those nexuses you're going to look at, but I've also used the um, head pins as spacers as well. So there's a couple of upside down ones, and so that you've got kind of little hearts actually in amongst. This is kind of very Chanel inspired. This is kind of jewelry very that I wear so. on a daily basis. I love my pearls and my chain and my kind of Chanel inspired. And then I've added sort of this little. Um, like a tassel tassel like yeah. waterfall effect that's beautiful but you, you know and i've put some of the little hearts on there as well but obviously you don't have to do that you could use them to make lovely earrings to match so this finding spacks brand new i know i know I, never i've never seen it before and i think you said that on social media didn't you brand new findings mm. um they're eight to nine millimeter cultured pearls so in looking at that where you've got the feature kind of toggle but instead of using it as a um for the on and offableness of it. Oh yeah, I've, I often do that though, don't I? I will use my um, silver findings as, I've, I've done this for years actually, as the focal point. Yeah, for, you're not alone now. Um, and, and so they've started doing that as fashion, haven't they, bring it to the front. Um, obviously those big designers were copying me. <laughs> Quite clearly. Yeah. Not. Tiffany's and Co, <laughs> absolutely. They were using yeah. toggle, now using toggle yeah, cast yeah. They at the front. Yeah, because they saw me You know, I mean, <laughs> lovely. It's absolutely beautiful as well. It ain't Debbie's though, is it? Let's Look be honest. That, and it hasn't got cultured pearls. And I bet that's expect. what's that? 815 say? pounds. Right, so, you know, you've got, it's Tiffany's, of yeah. course. But... Tiffany's and Co. All, I mean, there you go, how about this? Genuine freshwater Evelyn necklace, £69 for that. That's a very good price. It is a great price. That's where we've gone to straight away, just to start this auction. And remember, everything on this necklace is sterling silver. Yeah. Now, a lot of the ones that I wear every day are base metal. Yeah. Because, you know, so you get the chain in, in this as well, so that you can actually add the chain. And all, everything that you're seeing here is sterling silver. The little hearts, little spacer beads. I've even used the spacer beads as charms on my little tassel at the yep. bottom here. That was the word I was looking for, tassel. Um, yeah, so this was a real um, Debbie Kershaw type of jewellery. Yeah, and it's a luxury piece of jewellery. Yeah. You oh, said yeah. earlier on about Chanel. Well, Chanel uses faux pearls. I know. Whereas yours are genuine cultured pearls. The only way to get hold of this finding pack is within Debbie's kit. Okay. And believe me when I say you're better off doing that anyway. Mm -hmm. um, they're brand new pearls, brand new findings with your heart toggle, with your heart head pins that don't have to be head pins, with your heart spaces, all that sterling silver, the length of chain. If we said £49.99, and pence, how many do we have, Roscoe? Um, oh, there's 50 oh. available, so it's quite exclusive. If we said £49.99, that's your price, that's amazing. You've got a big gram weight of sterling silver. You've got genuine cultured pearls here, which are up to nine millimetres in their size. I'd be perfectly happy with that. Yes. Like, well, quite often, I'll add bits into the kits, because you're allowed to do that, because we always think, like, you guys have got stuff at home that you might want to add in. On this, I didn't add anything, because no. I wanted to show you that this will make your piece. You don't yeah. have to add in. Yeah. Both brand new components. If you want the findings back, the only way to get it is part of this kit and there's only 50 of them available. I mean, you're always going to want the pearls, aren't you? You know, pearls, I think, are oh, yeah. um, a, a fundamental to every jewellery maker's stash. Absolutely. If you want the, this, you know, the findings pack, which is launching today for the very first time in uh, Debbie's kits, then make sure you're quick on this one. And you know what I thought about as well? You know, like if you want to have a family necklace or you want to personalise, but you're not somebody who wants your children's names on or mm. whoever, if you use little hearts that only you know, so I've obviously got three children, but I could put three hearts amongst my design that represent my children without everybody needing to know that. Yeah. But I know that those hearts represent, oh. you know, or maybe, you know, you, my, I've lost my mum, maybe it represents my mum. But this is a way of your jewellery telling a story without being obvious so yeah. it's not like oh what are your children's names or what does that mean but you know that you've got three hearts or one heart or whatever and that represents this or that or a pet that you've lost or so again you can tell your story absolutely it can have meaning to you what oh that's amazing sorry 29.99 <laughs> crash sorry wake up everyone that what is incredible that strand of pearl shouldn't be twenty nine ninety nine. They're nine mils. I'm... That's incredible. That is so good. You know, I know it's different, but and it's got sort of a few charms like Debbie was just saying there. One hundred and sixty sixty eight pound for that, which I think is not a bad price. No, it's really all. not. But you can make that, right? Mm. The one that Debbie's made. 
I'd probably charge more because there's more silver. And also that's knotted, so there's less silver in that one. Um, we can't see the top, so it, it could go all the way around or it could have a chain. Yeah, um, don't so know. You do, I've obviously rosary linked this, um, but you don't have to do that. You can, you know what you want to do. You're the jewellery makers. You might want to knot it. You might want to put it on some tiger tail because you do get the crimp beads and you do get the crimp covers. So you most certainly can do that. Absolutely. I can't believe we're at 29.99. Were well, you always intending on going to 29.99, Roscoe? There's 18 of them left, he says. Um, London's got two, Maker, Susan, West Midlands got two, Catherine, Cathy, Muriel, Kirsty, Gale. The findings, which is brand new, these haven't ever been on our screens before, launching for the very first time. We get all of these, including the heart toggle just here. Um, not available outside of this kit. You know you can always need the pearls, aren't you? Uh, exactly and if you look at um, this is the other kit that's coming in a minute but if you have a look at these earrings look how long that um, oh, and I've wrapped lovely. loop that so if you want to do a basic loop you could get another so sometimes when you get these you have shorter head pins don't mm. you so but you can make links out of these or you can make nice angles and not actually have to add another eye or head pin because you've got this really good length yeah which I haven't seen for a while on sterling silver sort of decorative. No, that's true. You're probably talking about, talking about what, in fact, I can probably tell you this, about five centimetres, is that right? 50 millimetres in terms of the length of the heart hair pins? I would um, say so. Yeah. So, so they're a really good length. Even if you did, yeah, you, you don't have to cut that down. That'd be a lovely length. This kit, I've got three left. It's over allocated, majorly over allocated. Um, make sure you are checking out. So what have you just realised? You should have brought this kit first because they're natural pearls. Thought so. <laughs> With this next kit, I'd seen this necklace that I liked that had the pearls going down one side and just the chain on the other side. And it was um, a couple of designers had done it. And it was, I think the one that I liked was 300 something pounds. And yeah, then, you know, I was realistic, not at all. And, you know, I was going about um, being able to make jewelry that you can't afford. Um, it was just that I would never pay that for myself on a piece of jewellery, not for myself. I just Could I just say you should? I oh, know, but, you know, when you've got kids and everyone grandkids, you know, you don't, do you? But I thought I'd really like that. So when I got this kit, and I think the main thing being that everything in it was sterling silver and yep. you got the chain, which you often wouldn't get this length of chain mm. in sterling silver in a kit. So I made this necklace and it's this one here. And I used the chain oh, and I used the pearls and it was the design that I'd been wanting to make for a while. So I haven't outwardly copied it because I don't like to do that because I don't think that's right. I've done like my take on it. But it's a very simple design. It's chain on one side, pearls on the other. And they seem to be everywhere at the moment. And I quite like these asymmetrical designs. And they're usually like 300 and something depending on the pearls. Should we show that one? Here we go. So the this papaya. Yeah. And what I've used in this time is oh. three of the little hearts to represent um, obviously my kids and I've just got this is quite understated for me and quite elegant like often I'll I'll layer them yeah. so if I was layering them I'd have this as sort of the middle one that was yeah. more understated and I just thought well you know I can I don't genuinely didn't know what these kits were going to but I think that being able to make that for these pearls and sterling silver for the prices well, the first kit sold out, 55 oh, people missed out. Okay. But the reason why we were like, oh no, we should have brought this kit first. Uh. Because the strand on its own, it, it's natural papaya. Oh, it's so pretty. Naturally colored pearls. You can bleach, you can dye pearls, and oh. there's nothing wrong with that, but they're not as valuable as naturally colored pearls. You know, we had a strand of apricot pearls that we brought to air recently. They were more of a rounded shape rather than a drop shape. And they and they sold how much? One four nine. Yeah. Which is amazing. Which is what yeah. You'd expect that, to be honest. Yeah. From something like this in the shape. No. They're pretty uniform. And you get your heart brand new findings pack. Yes. So you know, to set set the you know to set the uh, the ball in motion, we would really like to say, okay, one two nine. That's an amazing deal. It's jewelry making. Yeah. You, know, you get an amazing um, price point with the kit. 
Um, it's not unrealistic to see. In fact, it, that would be a great saving, to be honest, on papaya pills. One, two, nine. There you go. There's your deal. Happy days. Well done, everybody. We can't, though. That's the highest that we can actually bring to air. Oh. We always, always, always talk about the fact that as part of your kits, you get the best possible saving yeah. and that would be a great price point i've had this conversation before people are saying well okay i want to buy the components separately and that might well happen moving forward i don't know at some point we're launching them as part of a uh, part of a kit but to be honest you get more often than not you're usually better off getting yeah. them as part of the oh. kit because you get further saving absolutely because you're allowed to do that as part of a kit you know i was helping out with the kits a little while ago mm -hmm. um and that is so true because as part of a kit, the comp and if you sold them separately, they are considerably more expensive. Yeah. And as a kit, because it's a kit, then you can do these And there's prices. less broadcast time. Yeah. That's how we do it. Even if we were to stop at 69.99, that would be unbelievable. I'd Look be at the quality of those pearls. They're natural. We're not stopping there That's though. Crazy. Have I got 50 of these? 60. Ooh, slightly more. But straight away, London's got two, Devon's got two, Kirsty, Susan, Andrea, Belinda, West Midlands, Carola, Michelle, Ooh. there's already people building up on the web and on the phone lines. £49.99 pence for natural papaya. Please remember that we've just said, look, there was another strand of natural papaya pearls, granted a slightly different shape and size. More, they were bigger. Okay. I'm not going to say otherwise, but they're exactly the same pearls. And they sold on our screens at 149. And they're so uniform. They're like little drop, teardrops. Oh, look at that one there in the centre now. Look yeah, at that one. Just, you can hand pick. And so when they're in earrings, they really draw your eye yeah. down to the heart. Oh. You know, and I think that's quite important when we're talking about shapes of pearls. These are something a little bit different. Well, and I don't have, and I've got some pearls in my collection, let me tell you, but I don't have any this size. It's 4.8 yeah, grams of silver. So much so in this, I was wondering if it was plated because yeah. I didn't know how we could do 4.8 grams of silver in silver, natural papaya pearls, and we're going lower. Than this? Yeah, we are going lower. Not I'd stopping. I'd be happy with 50. And me, I, I me. Mean, look, if we got a great deal, you get a great deal. How unbelievable. But be quick because there's a lot of people responding to that clock on your screens right now. 60 doesn't hang around. It doesn't hang around. 0800 644 Congratulations to each and every single one of you. Natural papaya pearls, not dyed, not bleached in any way, shape or form. Sharp luster as well. That's a great deal on your screens right now. But if we can do better, then we absolutely will do. At this next price drop, can I just say, you might even think, oh, I'll get both kits then. I'll get, I'll get both pearl kits because I can work them together. Well, you're actually getting both kits for less than what you should pay for that one strand, <laughs> basically. And that's almost 10 grams. No, it is. It's almost 10 grams of silver if you get both kits. That findings pack, you've got to remember you've got the chain, you've got the head pins, <coughs> would be more than what? Yeah, £20 for the findings pack, £20 for the pearls, which is just ridiculous. Just Google... Google um, heart, sterling silver heart toggle clasp if you want. Yeah. And see how much they come up at that you can buy them for. Yeah. And you think of all the other little hearts and things you've got in that before you even look at the pearls. If you're doubting the value for money in this kit. Yeah. It's absolutely. incredible. Well, here you go. Tiffany's and Co. One single, what I call a stylized heart on a sterling silver chain. £480. You could recreate that. I've got this heart. Someone gave it to me. And it, do you know, it's the most boring heart. <laughs> oh, you really? know, I know it's Tiffany's, but it's like, okay, that's a heart. And, it, you know, it just... Yeah! I, um, it lacks something. Even she doesn't look that enamoured to she be She doesn't look that happy. She? She's very pretty. She's got nice yes, lips. Yes, she is. She has very lovely lips. <laughs> She's got lovely Absolutely, lips. Absolutely, but she doesn't look over... There's nothing over wrong with that. But, you know, I like a little bit more oomph <laughs> in my jewellery. <laughs> Same, same. Uh, you can recreate it. She just doesn't look like she's that bothered. Yeah, she doesn't need that necklace. She's, she's not beautiful. bothered. Um, Thirty nine ninety nine. What are you doing, Roscoe? He says, "L, oh, I've got a slightly oh, bigger goodness. quantity. It's still only again. sixty, though. Oh, can't cut. Over half the stock has gone." He says, "Pardon." 
I can't really go lower, but I'm going to take everything that I can. Okay, mm -hmm. righto. We've got the coloured findings coming up as well. Shop ahead on those. They're available on pre-order right now for two absolutely beautiful pearl kits. Suspense is killing silver. me now. Kits back in the day. These kits would have been probably... 60 pounds. I was, was going to say 69 99 yeah. back in the day. I'm thinking about our booty kits. Yeah. That we used to and have. And our gems of distinction. Gems of distinction. It would have been about 60 quid, wouldn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Our oh, pearls, you can't beat. No. I think our pearls are beautiful. I've got so many of our pearls. I it's love, it's what I, the, the gems and I buy the most from here. Me too, I agree. Every single time. I, and I'm thinking back to when we launched papaya pearls. They weren't 39 99 No, 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 no. No way near that price point. And also I'm thinking about the email that we got over the weekend talking about how the price of pearls has gone through the roof. Again, we've kind of read that email gone. Eh. Point blank ignored it because thirty four ninety nine. Okay, that's incredible. That's I wouldn't hesitate, be, mainly because of the shape of yeah. these. Um, and believe me, I've got loads of pearls, but I've not got a lot in the shape. I think I've got one other strand, and it's not this lovely colour. It's just like a plain colour. The rose, the rose, the I mean. overtone that you're getting. And you know, as you look at it, you see the different colours coming through. Yeah. And then to have that partnered with not just sterling silver but completely new findings in a heart, which is yeah. one of the most sought after motifs when I was making to sell Absolutely. anyway. Um, it's just beautiful. Well, you think pearls, you think love, don't you? Affection, yes. it's, you know, a, a femininity. It's lots of different yes. emotions attached to pearls. We had 60, make sure you're checking out your baskets. That's an absolute steal. There should be one in front of that in my head. Um, Denise, hello to you. Eunice, Catherine, Sue, Fiona, Dorothy, Jacqueline, Pauline, Carola, Kathy, Cheryl, Christina, Alison, you disappear off the bottom of the screens. Um, um, people wanting multiples. Those earrings would be more than that. Oh, for sure. If you were to sell those earrings, for they sure. would cost more than that. If you want to be taken seriously, yes. Yeah, I agree. As a designer, totally you don't want to agree. underprice yourself. No, absolutely not. not but, you know, if, if you don't make to sell, imagine those being given as a present. Yeah, amazing. I mean, if I open those, I'd be oh. very happy. Uh, Debbie, what are you going to demo, lovely? We're going to bring the coloured findings um, as and when, but what, which one so are you demoing? What I thought I'd demo is um, you've got a couple of, of kits here that are with your coloured findings, but also you've got the drops that are drilled that way. And the most common question I get asked is, oh, but I don't know how to, you know, set those because they're not drilled long ways, they're drilled that way, and I want mm -hmm. them to hang down and not, you know, just on a... So I thought, well, I'll just I'll show that because I know that... A lot of our lovely viewers will know how to, but we have people that are, are new to the craft and even people that just haven't worked with this, this gemstone before. And sometimes we just think that everybody knows how to do this. So mm. I thought this might be useful. I hope so. OK, so if you have a look at the red drop earrings there, this is how, how I've beautiful set aren't those. They? So I think sometimes with this shape of gemstone, to put it in a waterfall design is very, very pretty. But because they're not drilled from top to bottom, they're drilled from side to side, that sometimes puts people off. Yeah. Because they're like, oh, well, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do with that. Do I put a bale on it? Which you can do, um, but you can just simply use wire, and that's what I'm going to show you. Okay, amazing. So there are the red ones, and then I've made some. Look, can I see if I'm in frame on the overhead? Oh, I am. Thank oh, you. Oh, they're beautiful. Those are the black. That, so these uh, are the black. And they come with spinel, I believe. Is that spinel? It's, I don't know. Spin or onyx. It's onyx. onyx. And they're lovely. And you, you get this really beautiful graduated strand. So you get really quite small ones to quite large ones. So they kind of lend themselves to this sort of waterfall design. Now, if I was adding into this, mm -hmm. and I really like the silver with it, but of course, equally, it would go lovely with gold. Depends if you're a gold or silver person. But you've got these findings, which I think give it, like you were saying, Elle, that edgy yeah. feel. It gives it something different. And you could add some little pearls in there you could add some bit of sparkle in there you could add a little you know some bicones oh, so from the yeah i think the red would be really nice or even the black so all you do so we've made one we're going to make another one of our earrings so all you need is your shepherd's hook from your findings pack and you get loads of chain i mean this is the chain i've got left after making that earring so you need to make to cut off an equal amount of chain as you used for your first earring. So usually I'd count the links, but for demo purposes, I'm just gonna eyeball it. And then I'm just going to cut off my chain there and pop it there. So the confusion often comes to when we want to 
sort of set something like this gemstone, but we, we're not popping on a bit of tiger tail. We actually want it to, it'd be lovely just on its own, wouldn't it? So usually I just use, if I'm not using um, a bale, and sometimes the bales aren't the right size, sometimes they are, so you're sort of left with a lot of these sorts of gemstones, is um, my 0.4 wire. So 0.4, this is silver plated wire. And just cut off a length that you're comfortable with. You don't want it to be too short, so you're fiddling about, but obviously you don't want to waste a lot. So I don't know, what's that, about 10 centimetres there? Yeah. And then I'm just going to find my drill holes and just pop my wire through my drill hole. Now just let me move this out of the way so that you can see exactly what I'm doing here. So I've popped my wire through my drill hole and I've probably left a little bit more than I need on that side, just because I don't want to be sort of really fiddling and, and, and struggling with it. I want to just be able to do it comfortably. So you can either do this with pliers, or I tend to do it with my finger. Often it depends on how malleable your wire is. If your wire is a little bit brittle, you can always run it through your fingers and that will soften it up. But if it still feels sort of a bit hard to work, then you can use your pliers instead. But this is really simple. So what I'm doing is, I've just flicked that wire up so that it's hugging the contour of the gemstone there on one side. And then I'm going to do the same on the other side. Now, with the other side, it's a little bit simpler because you can just pull it. Now, what you want to make sure when you're doing this sort of wrap, <coughs> excuse me, is that you don't do it so tightly that the gemstone can't move around or that you've got a possibility of crushing the top of the gemstone. Now, that wouldn't be an issue with this onyx because it's rounded at the top, but I think, you know, you'd really have to put some force on that to damage it. But maybe with the red kit, where you've got more of a pointed edge, you just want to be careful of that pointed edge. So once you, you're happy that you've got enough room to move without there being too much of a gap, and you're happy with your little sort of bale that you've made there, your little triangular shape, I'm just going to turn it this way because that's how I like to work. And then I usually get either my round nose pliers because they're tiny or a smaller jaw pair of pliers and just hold on to the little triangle I've made there. And then I'm just going to take this and wrap it around as you would a wrap loop. Now remembering that the more loops that you do, wraps that you do, the more you're going to see of the wire. So if you don't want to see a lot of the wire, then maybe just do one or two, which you can do with your fingers or with your pliers and then just you might want to just get your wire so that it's now standing straight up so that it's going to sit down as a drop and not be lopsided and then what you want to do is just snip off the excess wire now oh, I always run my fingers around any wraps that I do just to make sure because sometimes you can't see it by eye that you don't have anything sticking out because there's nothing more annoying than jewelry that catches on your skin or catches on your hair so then you've added that anchor point there for that bead. Just let me grab some round nose pliers. So what I did here, you can either add a bead on the top here if you want to have a little um, bit of interest, or if you just want this as a structure to actually add to your chain, I'm just going to add a wrap loop. Now think about how you want it to sit and how it's going to sit on your chain. And then... If you use the little tiny smallest part of your jaws, you're going for connecting, but not really wanting to see it too much. So I've gone down here because I want a small amount. So I'm just taking my wire across the top of my jaws and I'm just gonna cut off that excess so it doesn't get in my way. And then you just get your chain and I'm just gonna attach this large one to the bottom of the chain here through the loop. So you just, it's essentially now just a wrap loop. So this is what I have, I've got my chain on my loop and then I'm going to pop my pliers on there so that I'm holding and then I'm just going to wrap around as you would with a with a wrap loop. Now you can keep it at that or if you want to and you've got a longer tail you can continue wrapping this till you come right the way down and this is often you'll see this done with uh, briolet cuts where they actually make the wire a feature so they just keep going down and down and sometimes they cover the top of the gemstone with the wire as well so you can do that if you want to make it a feature and then again you want to just clip off any of the excess so that then what you've done is you've managed to hang that without 
having them sitting next to each other so that you've turned it into a drop or a charm essentially. And because you've got your lovely um, graduation on mm -hmm. this gemstone strand, you can then go for slightly smaller gems there and then your smaller gems at the top, just attaching them in exactly the same way as I've shown you, so that you kind of get that graduation coming down, so that when it clusters together, oh, it's really effective and really pretty. And then all you have to do is take your shepherd's hook, open your shepherd's hook away from you, like you'd open a door, and then once you've added all your little dangles on there, just pop the chain through close it securely and you've got a lovely pair of earrings and you would just then attach these other ones same way as I've shown you with the wire and that's just a really simple beautiful. way it's a very simple way they're of so beautiful though and they're really distinctive these findings well shall we do that kit yeah yeah let's bring let's that kit to here now I've just noticed that I've only got one head pin here but you do get more yeah you do you get I think four of them in total I think there's four yes yeah um, so we're going to bring you the black findings, which to my knowledge, I might be wrong. I might be wrong, but I don't recall. If we have, like you said, they were donkeys ago, if we did. I don't think I've seen I know black. we had coloured wires once upon a time, many moons ago. We did. I, I don't remember black findings. No, though, nor but, me. You know. um, so you get your two of your toggles, two of your black toggles. You get your crimps in black. You get four. I know I've only got one, but you do get four. And you get your jump rings and you get the length of chain that Debbie was just working with and you get the shepherd hooks that Debbie was just working with and of course you get the beautiful strand of stunning black onyx they're like oh look at that luster mirror like aren't they 29.99 for this beautiful kit and there's a really good graduation on this strand you know like sometimes there's a gradual yeah very um, yeah graduation on strands like this but like there's a big difference between that center one and the one right at the top of the strand yeah so that gives you lots of design possibilities even if you wanted to restrand that and pop some little pearls in between or some whatever gemstone in between you've got a really nice graduation absolutely i love this and i'd be tempted to use this strand also alongside um the pearls that we had yes. a few moments ago i think Agreed. they would really look uh, again especially with the black findings okay we're at 29.99 these are brand new never done them before i've got 100 available um would you mix these with the reds as well because i think black and red that's a gorgeous combination it's a isn't very it? classic combination yeah 19.99 <sighs> How amazing. Wow. For the findings back and also your beautiful black onyx. We're no way near done. Oh. Do, you, do you notice how they're strong? They are literally shoulder to shoulder. You do get a lot of gemstones. Yeah. And they're, they're not, very they're not substantial. Spaced. They're yeah. chubby. Ah, <laughs> oh, chubby. They're little chubsters. Oh, I like it. Michael just said they look, remind me of little penguins. That, yes. When they're all huddling. Yes. Yes. And they take turns, don't they? They take they turns do. to be on the outside. Oh, oh, is that not your price? No, they're going okay. even lower. We've got a hundred of them available. Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. That, for me, that's a great price for the Onyx. And then you're getting your finding pack for free. Yeah, and it's such a usable strand. I mean, black. You always need black gemstones. Definitely. If someone's always going to ask you. Oh, can you make me? You know. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, stop me in my track saying those. Gonna. What did Ross just say? He just said we're doing one more craft. Yeah. In sixty seconds. Give you the time to get on the phone lines here's your call to action join us on the website tap I, the app i particularly like um these sorts of gemstones depending on your um which uh metal color you like so gold or silver yeah i like them with gold or silver spacer beads like just keep it plain oh, lovely or pearls in oh between. beautiful my yuki you know imagine them with your, your oh. my yuki beads and it's very classic it's very audrey hepburn this yeah sort of yeah you know, definitely it makes the kind of jewelry that anyone could wear that you'll get out time and time again. absolutely i mean how beautiful if you're working with the jet black gemstones to so have that continuity of that jet black color in your findings yes. as well um is there enough people on the phone lines though or is there a bit of a delay in the call screens yes he says there's more than enough people there they do look like little penguins <laughs> they do they're lovely. They're like very cute, chubby gemstones. There's a, you get a lot of gemstone. Does that make sense? Yeah, because they're yeah. rounded rather than pointed. Yeah, absolutely. He dropped the egg. <laughs> Twelve ninety nine. Oh, that's epic. You've, for the, you've got a discount on the black onyx, and then you get your findings for free as well. Happy Feet's a great film, isn't I it? I love that film. And me. And what are you doing there, son? 
most of the things that hippity hoppity. <laughs> most of the things that we say to each other in my house are quotes from films. Yeah, but... absolutely. A bit like big summer blowouts. That's another one, isn't it? <laughs> it's another one. <laughs> um, amazing. Twelve ninety nine. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. So if I just bring the toggles in from the red kits as well, oh, I, would I would mix the red it. and yeah, black I Roscoe. I definitely would. Let me grab the. See how lovely is that? Yeah. Well, again, it's definitely got that gothic-like vibe. It's a classic combination, red and black. Yeah. And the strand. Would you mix the <gasps> beautiful garnets alongside Those your... Those garnets oh. are something else, aren't they? And now you know this kit's only twelve ninety nine. That might be affordably possible. Yeah, that's incredible for a kit. Twelve ninety nine. That's that's great. And I think, you know, if we've got people that are wanting to, you know, they can't stretch to jades. And mind you, I haven't no. said that. That. We've done Jade this morning for incredible prices. We really have. You can get a whole kit for twelve ninety nine. That's yeah, amazing. exactly. And 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 like thinking back as well, because uh, feedback from um, powers that be was our customers were asking for more affordable kits. Fair enough. There you go. Um, there they are. Well, yeah, that is a definitely an <laughs> and affordable the pearl kit. Ones. Um, yes, absolutely. Now one minute on your screens, and then we're going to be finding red. Right? Okay. Love that. This is beautiful, isn't it? absolutely beautiful it's a lovely shade of red too isn't it yeah it's, it's a it's a definite fire engine yes red. it is that's how i would describe like a dark it. red yes like a pigeon blood red yeah exactly isn't it yeah ruby red this strand is something else it's they unbelievable absolutely beautiful. <gasps> now i don't know what ross has taken this to it's always going to be a great price when ross is in the hot seat absolutely but Guaranteed sellout, he says. Ooh, okay. Look at the quality of these garnets. They are amazing. They're amazing. Oh, my goodness me. I don't know what Ross has taken it to, but I'd already be dialing if I was in your position right now because the quality of those garnets, they're huge. They're absolutely huge. You've got 25 carats. They go up to 12 by 8 millimetres yeah, in terms beautiful. of their size. And you could take that centre one and have a pendant and just have two drop earrings yeah. as well. So that's only three that you've made a whole kind of suite of jewellery from. Yeah, I could, you could take like one of these and I've just, I don't know, I've gravitated towards this one. That, yeah. That one on its own, $9.99, look at the quality of it. It's beautiful. You could put that as a solitaire ring, couldn't you? Oh, yeah. £9.99. pence. So even if you just divided this by two, that's £5 for these garnets. Well, wait a minute, this kit is £9.99? Yeah. So you can get both kits for what, £23? That's incredible. That's it is so incredible. good. That's one of the best values I think I've seen for a long time. I don't know where, I, I generally don't know I'd... anywhere else that can do this, Debbie. Or even for the Strand 9 99 I'd yeah, go over Yeah, exactly. The it's not nuggets. No it's disrespect to nuggets. No, they are but... calibrated drops. And they're beautiful. Yeah, big. And they're not, with garnets, they can be so deeply saturated that they can become almost borderline black. Agree. Not the case here. If these look good in this studio where there's no natural light, imagine what they're going to look like in sunlight. Oh, yes. I and know. they are nice. That's why I put them in earrings because I thought, you know, if you have them kind of dangling from your ears and the light catches them and, oh. Something just dawned on me. These are a little bit Moulin Rouge as well, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Hey, sister, go, sister. Mm, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> they are a little bit Moulin Rouge. I can see a bit of velvet and lace. You know, when you have said this before and you're having a day and you think, ugh. And then you put a piece of jewellery on and you're yeah. like, right, I can face the day now. Yeah, absolutely. Changes the entire mood, doesn't it? Um, OK, let's do... Let me show you. I haven't got it here. I ha oh, have you got a photograph? Oh, there it is. Kinga's on the ray. Hello, Kinga. I love this. It's so Oh, beautiful. my goodness me. Look at that for a recording. You've carved the... They've carved the bale. Carved the bale. So this oh, is a yeah. brand new kit... That is launching today for the very, very first time. It is coming up in one auction. We are going to... Yeah, yeah, carved braille look. Oh, I see. That's beautiful. Isn't oh, my it? goodness. And the fact you've got the leaves behind and it's two-dimensional uh, two dimensional, and you get these beautiful type A, natural, pure white rounds also. Um, Ross, I'm going to copy what Ross just did in our ear. He said, it's one auction away. <laughs> When Craig David's in the house. <laughs> <laughs> um, next auction, though. 
last remaining quantity. I have, yeah, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Aquapraise, mm -hmm. which is one of the newest gem discoveries um, currently. And Eddie Levion um, wrote about Aquapraise. And is it Boucheron? Yeah, Boucheron. Um, massively, massively uh, threw their weight behind this beautiful gemstone. Um, you can also get it from Ernest Jones, by the way. But I say that you probably can't because it's actually always sold out. Uh -huh. um, there's two varieties of Aquapraise, and I'll put it on the back of my hand in a second. Two varieties of Aquapraise. There is um, your Peacock Aquapraise and also Gem Jelly Aquapraise. Um, we're going to repeat what happened on Sunday. If you weren't able to tune in on Sunday, if you've never heard of Aquapraise, we can credit wonderful Yanni Mellis, who is a personal friend of ours here at Gemporia. You've met Yanni. He's done a show with me as well. Um, and Yanni, by the way, is a jewelry maker. Ah. He is a jewelry well, maker. there you so go, he then. really enthusiastic when he came on, our air, uh, came on air. Um So you can follow him on Instagram as well. So he's the Gem Explorer. Um, and if you read about it, so commercial success, jewellery brand uh, Levion started working with Acapraise a few years ago. It has since launched half a dozen collections using uh, uh, um, the gem with special emphasis on what is called Peacock Acapraise. CEO Eddie Levion described it as um, a somewhat translucent mix of green and blue and some brown matrix with white clouds that are reminiscent of waves crashing on a rocky shore on Ooh. a tropical island. Yes, please. The stone has been a success with his clients, he reports, every Le uh, Levion collector seems to gravitate to this gem. In today's world of mass production and conformity, there is something very genuine about a gemstone that is not treated and is different for every single piece. Amazing. They're works of art. They really are. And if we show you a couple of the pieces, um, you know, here in JCK, you see Levion will stage its first 21st annual trend. Oof. And here's their forecast. So they actually say um, Levion's annual red carpet revenue is one of the Las Vegas Jewelry Week's most glamorous and well-attended events. While uh, the Jewelry Week was cancelled this year, the mo uh, most trade shows um, have gone virtual. This is obviously on the back of COVID. The fine jewelry brand isn't letting the pandemic pandemic squash its signature uh, signature event um, again talking about that event where he's at where the, this is where Levion is let me just to put it into uh, into perspective Levion say the gemstone of the year is this the trend of the year is this it's the gorgeous. feature of the year is this and the rest of the jewelry world listen um, and they highlighted they could have gone let's think about it parade but tourmaline mm. They could have gone pink diamonds, couldn't they? Yes. They could have got any of those gemstones of the year. They chose Acapraise. Oh, the colour is just beautiful. Beautiful, isn't it? Peacock Acapraise 2021 um, takes centre stage as the exotic gem of the year. This gem displays a beautiful mix of uh, multicolour matrix floating against a semi-transparent blue-green body and showcasing individualised sorry, patterns um, of white sea foam. Each unique gemstone is a natural beauty, especially when accented by chocolate and vanilla diamonds. Oof. That's what Levion do. And you can imagine each of those pieces are astonishingly expensive. Oh, yeah. But again, go to Ernest Jones. They also uh, really back this gemstone. You can go there, but... Out of stock, out of stock, out of stock, oh. out of stock. And look at the prices as well. He's talking four figures. So, but you know, Yanni is a personal friend of ours. He's been on our shows. He's, um, he's been in the, um, uh, in the building many times. He's joined us on our screens here. Genuinely, this is one of the best prices that possibly we've ever done. Um, now, over 400 of these, that speaks volumes, have sold. Wow. I have 66 for you today. If you're a collector, then this definitely needs to be on your radar. At 19.99, remember that WhatsApp conversation that Dave had with Yarni? Yeah. Now, and lots of our audience love Yarni too. He's very charismatic. Yeah, he is. And he is. Uh, he's. If you imagine a gem hunter, it's Yarni, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you could, if you could make one, yeah, conjure it up in your mind. One. Yeah, it would it, be. Yeah, yeah, it's Yarni. And look at this. Uh, um, Boucheron has just launched Gem Jelly Aquapraise. I've been working on this for a while. Uh, you can break the news to Steve. And uh, Dave answers, that's amazing, mate. 
Congratulations. I think you should. He'd love to hear from you. One of the hardest things about COVID has not been able to know what your close friends are up to and how they are winning. And this is a win. Um, we should create stronger gem jelly collections, says Yanni. 100% gem jelly has become uh, super exclusive. This is what I have right now. Um, exactly, says Yanni. No more silver, please. We can't even get the rough, so don't give it away. Uh. Yanni, who discovered the gemstone can't get hold of the rough anymore because the mine's been bought out the locations he didn't own that mine he discovered it wow. um so the mine's been bought out he can't get hold of it and we went even lower don't give it away says yarny <laughs> yeah which is exactly what we're doing right now we are giving gem jelly aqua aqua, uh, aqua praise away 9.99 for the slider bracelet on its own, that's absolutely unbelievable. But to be bringing you Gem Jelly Natural Aquapraise when you've got Levy on, when you've got Boucher on, when you've got Ernest Jones all selling it for four figures and then some. We didn't. We didn't. Did we? I hope, y I hope Yanni's not watching right now. I really do. <laughs> Hi, Annie. Don't give it away. Sorry. Sorry, <laughs> Sorry about that. Sorry. This would go amazing with the angel light. <gasps> oh, yes. Can you imagine putting one, a couple of those angel light in the middle of this? Oh, I can't believe we went lower. We went lower. I, I, I was part of that as well, so I can't even throw stones. <laughs> I was 100% part of that. So you're going got, lower? The yeah, nine, nine. But, but know that this is probably the last time we're ever going to see Aquapraise. Okay. Or if we do, it's going to be in our coveted collection. Um, we've got two strands in our coveted collection, but they're not nine ninety nine. quite clearly. Look at Boucheron. Boucheron Perry. Oh, that's beautiful. Look, Look one that. gem jelly in a talk bangle. Beautiful. Six grand. <laughs> Six grand. And that's me shaving £300 off that price tag. <laughs> We're at 9.99 and going even lower. I only had 60 left though. Kirsty, London, Shona, Fiona, Alan, Sharon, new customers, London. I can't believe we did that. It's a sterling silver slider bracelet. That should be more than what's on your screens. But most importantly, it's the fact that you are getting gem jelly aquapraise, one of the newest, most exciting discoveries, the exotic gem of the year, year 2021 for 7.99. Goodness me. Again, it's classic, isn't it? It's classic jewellery maker. We take that we take that message. We read that WhatsApp message. We even showcase it. We even go, oh, yeah. Look what Yarni said. Look what Yarni said, everybody. <laughs> Yarni was like, Yarni did it. By the way, Yarni discovered this gemstone. How cool is that? Look, it was in JCK. It was, at, it was at Las Vegas. And they were talking about how exclusive and exciting and how unique each and every single one of these gemstones is. And the world completely went nuts over it. But look what Yarni said, don't give it away because I can't get any rough anymore. Oh, let's just do it 7 99 then, shall we? <laughs> it's so classically jewellery made. Yeah, it's it hilarious. Is. Gem gel, uh, gem gel. And we'll even go, look. If you want to go to Boucheron, you get it in gold, granted, and you have a few diamonds in there, but it's £6,300. But even for a slider bracelet on its own, or those two gemstones on their own, £7.99 would be amazing, wouldn't it? Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Don't give it away. <laughs> That's what Yanni said. I hope he's not watching. I hope so. I hope not, rather. That's what I mean. <laughs> I, I, I don't want him to be watching, because that would be an awkward conversation, to yeah. be truthful. Yeah. Awkward. When the mine, you've got to remember this, just because he discovered it doesn't mean he owns the mine. Of course. He can't get hold of it now. He discovered the gemstone. Seriously? Yeah, he can't get the rough. And it's one of them, you know, Boucheron, he's got Levion, Boucheron, oh, all those course. big designers, so he can't get it at those prices. We might have the we might be amazing friends with Yanni, but... He can't get it. He can't get hold of it. Which means we can't get hold of it. I see, yeah. Uh... Seven ninety nine only. Well done to you, Gillian, Devon, Amanda, London, Mrs. Uh, Cornwall, Alan, Cheryl, Kim, Ray, Linda, Patricia, Jackie, Manchester, Carmen, Alison, Richard, Belinda, Catherine, new customer. I look at the quantity, though. I've only, this probably is the last time we actually have an opportunity at a single-figure price tag for Aquapraise. I don't want to say full stop, you're never going to see it again, but it's, you're, we're not going to see it at a single-figure price tag, surely. 
if, if Yarny can't even get hold of the rough. Um, there's a lot of multi-buyers on this. Congratulations, Heather, Jacqueline, Belinda, Catherine. Your jade carving is coming up. It's brand new. It's a premiere opportunity, so make sure you're ready if you've got your eyes set on that. Um, it's beautiful, and we're going to do one of the lowest prices also. Down to the final seven of these. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. I'll leave those final there. Uh, final five there. Okay. This is star by da, 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 trumpets, <laughs> da, 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 all of that. We haven't we we haven't got time to actually do it because we're um, obviously running a little bit over. Um, we've never shown this piece on air before. It is brand new. You get both. I adore this. You know, we could talk about the meaning of flowers, not just in Chinese culture, you know, internationally, like hearts, it's a global symbol, isn't it? Absolutely. You know, new beginnings. Um, love. Love. It just flowers evoke an emotion in people, you know, like, hence flower therapy. Yeah. yeah. They, flowers evoke an emotion in people. You know me. I, I, if you know anything about my work over the years, I love a floral design. Yeah. I love a flower. There's something romantic and beautiful about having a flower in your jewellery. I, re I read about this the other day, actually, on there. We were talking about the, you know, every single jewellery house. Do you remember, Roscoe? Every single jewellery house has got, pretty much, has, has got, like, like Tiffany's, um, Chomet, Van Cleef and Arpels. Mm. They've all got flowers. Yeah. All got flowers um, within their collections. Um, so, of course, when you think about your master carvers, and we work directly with master carvers over in uh, in China, you know, not please understand that in terms of there's, there's a carver and there's a master carver. There's a big difference. Yeah. Big, big, big difference. Um, here we go. So, Tiffany's & Co. Bulgari. Chomet. Van Cleef. They've all got floral designs within. Flowers are consistent, aren't they, in jewellery and And have been for and have hundreds been of years. Hundreds and hundreds upon hundreds of years. Team that, instead of with your precious metals and, say, mother of pearl, like, uh, like Van Cleef and Arpels, imagine carving it out of one of the world's most valuable materials, one of the world's most rare materials. Oh, not just jade, not just jadeite, which I should never say just jadeite. Mm -hmm. It's the top ten rarest gems in the world. Ice white. Remember, for top quality jade, it should look like melting ice. Yes. Like a melting ice cube. That indicates a fine texture, fine crystal structure, and it should have a, a beautiful purity of colour. This is totally natural. We've never seen this before. And for me, that, on one of your um, beautiful... Um, Angelites that's coming up, the, the new Angelite. I Can love you that those Angelite. Two together? That'll be so stunning. How many do we have, Roscoe? There's a hundred available. Oh, okay. Just put a few of your Jadeite rounds here and here. Oh, beautiful. I love the simplicity of it. Me too. You yeah. know, that flower, it's a flower. I'm sure somewhere people must have made flower jewellery because flowers die and we all love flowers. Yeah, they're everlasting. Whether they be they? in your garden or whether someone buys you a bunch of flowers. Um, it's beautiful, and to, but they die. I mean, yes, you can press them, but to actually give somebody a flower that will never die... Yeah, eternal, yeah. ...is absolutely... That together is stunning. How lovely are they? Now, when we first brought this, when we first referenced that this was launching today, um, we said it was going to be one of the best prices for a Taipei pure white, imperial white jadeite that we've ever done. That's what Ross said in my ear. That's what I re reiterated to you. Now, I've got a 100 of these available, and we want every single one of them to go. For those people that may be new to the channel and you're thinking, or new to gemstones, because we quite frequently, regularly have wonderful new customers join us, can we just put this into perspective? There are over 4,000 different minerals on this planet. Yeah? This is in the top 10 rarest. <laughs> Just to put that into yeah. perspective, because listen, myself, I can get blasé. And go, oh, jadeite, yeah, jadeite, we're going to do the best possible this. This is one of the most valuable materials in existence. There's an ancient Chinese proverb that says, gold has value, jadeite is priceless, or mm. jade is priceless. Mm. And there is obviously, as with all different gemstones, there's different degrees of quality. Look, I can bring you a diamond for a quid and I can bring you a diamond for a million pounds. There's different degrees of quality. There it is. 
history. Jadeite is one of two types of pure jade. Um, the other one is known as nephrite jade. Jadeite is much rarer than nephrite jade and is therefore considered to be significantly more precious and valuable. As the Chinese proverb goes, gold has a price, jade is priceless. Wow. Plus, what she's wearing, beautiful, don't get me wrong, I mean, that's imperial green. It's a cabochon. Yes. And it's a curved half bangle. Lovely, beautiful. It's not a master carving, though. No. You've got to remember that you have had an artist who has, who has you know, specialised, honed in their skills over decades to carve this piece for you. And a flower is so symmetrical. I yeah. mean, you know, if you get one petal slightly skew with, you're going to be able to see that. Yeah, totally. Aren't you? It's not like, you know, you're carving an animal and not that I'm saying that's easy, but with something that's symmetrical, I can imagine that there's extra pressure because Probably. the petals need to look like petals. You and can't if you have make one that's a mistake, tiny. Debbie, this is valuable. This is a valuable canvas. I drilled, a very expensive oh, canvas. I drilled through a jade ring. Um, to put a pearl on it and nearly had a nervous breakdown. <laughs> so I can't imagine yeah. just getting a piece of something like this and making that. I know, that pressure. Now, we did say, we made a promise that this was going to be one of the most affordable jade auctions that we've ever done. We want to see the phone lines light up. I've got 100 available. I don't want a single one of these to be left come the end of this auction. We're not stopping at 99.99. In oh. fact, we're no way near. Again, I... I, I I don't, even if you're thinking, I've got jade. I've got jade and moustache already. I've got jade and moustache already. Listen, it's, it's, I'm not going to regret this purchase because when I go, you know, the reality is my children, my girls, I never say never, but it's unlikely they're going to be able to afford this gemstone. Yes. That's how I always comprehend it and justify it. And I don't even have to say it to my husband now because he's, he's in a total agreement. I get it because I know they're not going to be able to purchase it. Never say never. Unlikely. They're going to be able to purchase it. And do you think they're going to, if they do, are they going to be buying it at double figures? No way. Categorically no but way. But like with the red jade, you know, definitely not. And I just think that being able to pass something like this on to your family even if you make a piece of jewelry and then they can wear it and this is wearable too isn't it very wearable this piece i love the fact i love the master carvings i love the big statement pieces but let's be honest you can't wear them every day can you because they are quite heavy whereas this i could wear that every day definitely absolutely 65 carats across the two components and you get the parcel as well next price crash <coughs> hand carved 79 pounds we have sorry i've just brought, we have a hundred of these available you know we are talking about if you go to if you go to if you go to china and you look at jade you're looking at dragons you're looking at um uh, buddhas you're looking at very definite lotus flowers all mm. those things definite obviously eastern influence to their carvings yes whereas a flower very poignant also within china but internationally all around yeah. the world yeah yeah oh it's beautiful look you know we're in that crazy jewelry maker bubble <laughs> yeah. that is uh, you know if you were to ignore this for a second and you were just to look at these the type a translucent natural white jade and they are perfectly translucent can I just just say that is six pound fifty eight per type A jade, I, <laughs> and there's aqua colours in these. Sometimes we forget, and, and we are as guilty of this as ever. Um, look, we forget that that's a great price for type A jade yeah, with that sure. quality. Six pound sure. fifty eight per bead. You don't just get those though. You get this too, and it is drilled. All you need to do is pop it directly onto silk cord, whatever you wish. Lark said, knot it, bead it, whatever you want. We're not stopping at $79.99. Another price crash. Now, for these beads individually, £5.75 each. <laughs> Seriously? Little beads. How many is there? Two, four, six, eight. I think it is 12, yeah. 
four millimeter translucent ice white type a jade not polymer impregnated not dyed how about five pounds per type a four mil round and this for free who gives type a jade eye away seriously this is why i always think mason and k pillar and stone you know sotheby's bonhams christie's they must look at jewelry maker every so often and believe me they know they do know and roll their eyes but you uh, but dave actually referenced this that's five pounds per gem dave actually referenced this the other day and on the back of his trip that's happening on monday so he himself jake um, and a couple of other, the other jewellery maker, uh, sorry, Gemporia staff are going to China. They're going to meet a gentleman called Mr. Liu, who is arguably one of the most influential jadeite dealers in the world. Um, try and get some deals. Remember, that's why we've actually been doing some crazy prices, because they want the purse strings for it. Um, but what's my point? What am I actually getting out here? I've lost my track. But seriously, we're going over there. Do you think we're going to be able to get hold of type A jadeite at 59.99? Those earrings, I know they're different colours. They're not £5 per bead from Mason and Kay, are they? <laughs> oh, no. We are in a very unique bubble, really, here. One that yeah. we every so often need to give ourselves a little reminder, a sort of wake-up call. See those two yellows at the bottom there? And they're not going to say, I'll tell you what, see the master carved pig? You can have that for free. They're not going to say that, which is essentially what we're doing here essentially and i'm always asked the question or it's put on facebook or whatever well, why do you do it then you know why is why does jewelry maker if you could sell this into the market um, at a higher price point why don't you do it because that goes against the entire ethos of the company and we and that's the ethos that we have had from the beginning from the very beginning you gotta remember steve is still in the building do you think we can go against what steve's ethos is no of course not I and mean, we wouldn't we're still not done at 59.99 We've said from the start of the show, this may well be one of the most affordable carving deals that we have ever, ever done. <sighs> oh. Everybody relates to flowers, don't they? Oh, yeah, they're just... Oh. And it's so beautiful in its simplicity. It's quite obviously a flower. Carved jump ring too. You've got the carved jump ring, which is really unusual. It's just stunning. Remember Richard Wise's words? A jadeite jade of pure translucency with a fine texture and moderate translucency should be considered the finest of its type. That's precisely what I'm holding should be considered the finest of its type. We're at 59.99 and in 60 seconds we will go lower. I want to get hold of this too. So do I. I don't think there's an event in there. Flowers in Chinese culture symbolic of love in particular young love. But I think all around the world we relate to it. Do you want me to show you? There we go. There you can pass cord through there or silk through there if you wanted to. Could lark's head knot onto there if you wanted to. So yeah, there's the actual drill hole, very cleverly. Uh, uh, they often actually really consider how it's drilled, how, uh, how you attach it, because you would, wouldn't want to interfere or disturb that beautiful work of art. It is master carved, it is type A, it is natural, it is imperial white, and it is going lower than 59.99. Use this time wisely, because 100 is already an absolutely unbelievable deal. Half the stock has already confirmed. Amazing, congratulations to you. We said it from the beginning this might well be one of the biggest deals we've ever brought to air for your type a jadeite has something changed can all of a sudden we buy jadeite once again especially the rare whites that were exclusively for the emperors no nothing has changed nothing has changed we still can't get hold of it the mining operation hasn't set up again in burma but we're still doing that extra low price tag remember we always say it we get a great deal you get a great deal make hay while the sun shines <laughs> Genuinely, because there will come a time in the very, very, very foreseeable future when this will be a distant memory. That's the thing, isn't it? You know, there was a time when we used to have Tanzanite on every show. Yeah. How often do we see Tanzanite? Really, now? really, really, really. You know, and you think, oh, I'm really glad that I bought that when I did, and I bought a few really nice pieces. I forget which expert it was, but someone was saying that with gemstones, 
Oh, who was it? I think it was, um, oh, guy, oh, I've gone blank. Guy that discovered tanzanite. No, not D'Souza, um, Bruce, his son, Mark. Oh, gosh, I've gone blank. I've gone blank. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, but it was actually him who actually said, it'll come to me in a second. He actually said, if you see a gemstone that you love and, and you can afford it, buy it. Because the market goes up and down. If you think about mm -hmm. it, the, the price may drop when, when it's available in the market. Yeah because it's available, but as soon as it becomes unavailable, that's when the price skyrockets. Yeah. We're, we're at the unavailable stage, yes. you know, but we're still bringing it to you at the affordable price tag. Get it whilst you, ha you can, because like I said, the market changes. Yes, we've got it here. That's why we always say make hay while the sun shines. We won't have it indefinitely. That window of opportunity we've been saying over and over and over again, it's not closing, it's closed. Mm. The mine is gone and it's, ha it's hand carved. It's not type B, it's not type C. Get your certificate of authenticity and it will actually say not enhanced. Plus you're getting both. Ross, at this price, so you've got 12 rounds here. So we're about £4.16 per type A jadeite round and you're getting this for free. It's madness. I generally don't know anywhere else in the world that does this. Neil and Linda, Mariska, all that glitters, Susan, Teresa, Sandra, Lisa, Wiltshire, Belinda, Linda, Anne, Patricia, Christine, Catherine, Marie, Tina, Elizabeth, Olga, new customers, Janet, Lisa, another Belinda. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. We had 100. You don't have to take my word for it. Richard Wise, who is probably, when I did my GIA qualification, um, I remember it, so, you know, it was like, there, there's the wedges of paper that that you need to study <laughs> and Steve was like here you are here's a book secrets of the gems trade written written by Richard Wise read it and then read it again mm. so it's, that becomes your bible in the gemstone world so Richard Wise is probably the most respected individual in gemstone and he's the one that said in modern, modern connoisseurship a jadeite jade cabochon of pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency would be the finest of its type you're getting it for 49.99 <laughs> today absolutely unbelievable Catherine, christine maria tina make sure you are checking out those baskets and you get the rounds they would work perfectly alongside your deal of the day today absolutely the beautiful. launch of your peacock, yeah. uh, peacock angelite yeah. Make sure you're checking out, though. Again, I've got to say it, Debbie, we're very fortunate in our wonderful little bubble, aren't we? Um, I buy this knowing that my Willow and Tiggy, they ain't going to get type A jadeite for 49 .99 moving forward. No. Out of the 100 that we originally had, 27 of them left. I'm not surprised by that at all. Do you do that? Do you buy gemstones for your children? Yeah, and, I, and then now I find that Daisy's got to 16, that she then goes, Mum, can I go through, like, a prom? I made her jewellery, but she wanted rings. So she went, Mum, can I go through your rings? And I'm like, yeah. So the fact that she could borrow this necklace, which is red jade, or that she, she loves jade. Like, she loves jade, like, you know, you can just pluck jade off the shelf. But Daisy has jadeite stretchy bracelets because it's one of her favourites. And the fact that now I yeah. can give that to her. Yeah, yeah. She's old enough. I know. You know. But you rewind 10 years ago, when before Jewellery Maker had jade, they, we'd have never even entertained that, no. would we? Never in a million years. Forty nine ninety nine. Plus, we're not just bringing, you know, jadeite, which is like a coarse crystal, quite matte, quite opaque, yeah. not necessarily glowing. That's imperial white. We're going to do a 60-second clock to close this auction. <gasps> um, I hope you check out. It's absolutely beautiful, universal symbol flowers, universally loved flowers, um, and the most unbelievable, historic, I think, price points. Um, uh, and then we're gonna dive into a break and we're coming back with the launch of your Peacock Angel Eye. Oh. I absolutely adore it, it's stunning, and it would go amazingly with this as well. Um, so the final 11 opportunities. Um, we're gonna go straight into the break from this clock, so make sure you're checking out. Good luck, Lancashire, Keith, new customer, London, Lorraine, Sandra, Julie. Christine, Catherine, Maria. We're at £4.16 per round. And then that pure imperial natural type A grade master carved. I know it doesn't, doesn't say it on your graphics, but it is a type A grade jadeite. Look, there's no there's no treatment there. No. Um, type A grade jadeite for £49.99. The final seven of those. Amazing. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. Good luck to you all. The launch of Peacock Angelite is coming up after this. Be 
This July, join us for the big summer blowout. We are launching 927 brand new products. We have a mega managers clearance event, Mark Smith's anniversary show and Christmas in July. Yes, you heard that right, Christmas in the summer. So join us for Jewelry Maker's big summer blowout. It's going to be a scorcher of a month. Miss it and you'll miss out. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. back everybody that was good wasn't it it was so good and your kit's amazing we've still got more kits to come and look patrick's growing it's all good yeah, patrick's growing um, um patrick the starfish just in case everyone's, everyone's going what what who's patrick <laughs> just, <yeah. laughs> who is patrick? patrick the starfish i know she's saving saving my bacon right then oh. how exciting i can't sit here and tell you this is a gemstone launch it's not officially a gemstone launch however it is a gem variety gemstone variety launch i've never seen it so before. yeah uh, and it's also uh, comparatively speaking we've just spoken about type a jade I, that has been mined well if we use jade for thousands of years nephrite's been mined for thousands of years jade yeah. has been mined for hundreds um here's a gemstone that is 37 years old really yeah is that all i'm sure 30 is it or 30, 36 maybe it was discovered in 1987. I absolutely love this gemstone. I've never seen anything like it. It's, it's so gorgeous. beautiful. 
and, we're, and we've brought it to you before, angel light. And if you can imagine angel light, you know, if you're conjuring up an image of what angel light looks like, it's not going to be too dissimilar from what you're about to see. Angel light, it, it, for me, it's got that, it has got that heavenly colour palette. They're always mm -hmm. pastels, so really pretty, but more frequently seen in the blue, which we've brought to you. Then we launched the green angel eye, which was sold out. Yeah. Gorgeous. This is like that balance of the two. It's so if you've got green angel light and you've got blue angel light in your stash, imagine putting this in between. I just love angel light, but I, honestly, I love this colour. So put the two together and oh. yes, please. Well, let's learn some more about angel light because, um, and I've kind of taken snippets from different articles to read to you all. Okay. This one is actually from um, the Gemporia Learning Library. Um, so these would have been, I assume, Steve's words or either Steve or Matt Bennett. Anyway, recently I received a very excited phone call from a good friend of mine who was in Peru. What are you doing in Peru? I asked him. I thought he must be on holiday as there was very gem mining, very little, sorry, gem mining in, that, in the country. It turns out that one of his friends had just discovered a small deposit of gemstones um, and he had called him for his opinion. Um, imagine that phone call. Oh, I just discovered a gemstone. Can pop you phone, over, can you phone me to, next time? Yeah, <laughs> pop over to Peru. Off you go. Oh, um, what had been discovered was a gemstone known as angelite, uh, which is a delicious pale, uh, lilac pale blue gem variety of anhydrite. Now, anhydrite is a gem that is formed uh, from the compression of uh, celestite over a period of millions of years. Anhydrite can also be found in white, grey, blue, pink and red, but only the lilac colour variety is known as angelite. Despite the common occurrence of anhydrite, uh, good quality specimens are extremely rare. It is also a fairly new gemstone, having only been discovered in 1987. Wow, in yeah. So we are talking about a gemstone, if you, you know, comparatively speaking, that is a positive baby. <laughs> um, so, yeah, and we think angelite, most of us will immediately, con you know, imagine the blue. If you imagine the most gorgeous summer's day, I don't know what the weather's doing outside right now, and say you were sort of stretched out on a blanket in a field somewhere having a nice picnic whichever oh, yes, it might please. be and you look up at the azure blue that's angel like color and it's like an opaque beautiful gemstone however this is very different to that um so i can show you a photograph look at the image at the top of these words and that's what the first discovery yes. of angel like looked like yeah. Angelite, in terms of its history, it's known, as we just said, uh, anhydrite, anhydrite, sorry, or angel stone. It's a glacier blue or lilac blue coloured soft stone that has a white centre and snow white flecks with the occasional black, brown or rusty inclusion. A relatively recent discovery in the mineral and gem world, an angelite was discovered, as we just said, in 1987 in Peru. Um, the name anhydrite comes from uh, the Greek anhydrus, meaning without water, a reference to angelite being a gypsum that has completely lost all saturation becoming a stone that is without water effectively oh that's but, really interesting um as the name suggests as well really strong metaphysical connections so i know another reason why debbie will absolutely <laughs> love this um angelite is thought to I improve your spirituality and your spiritual awareness with a peaceful energy that is calming and soothing. Many believe it promotes communication and self-awareness while dispelling fear, anger, and anxi anxiety. Angelite is closely related to the astrological sign of Aquarius. Because of its blue color, angelite is associated with the throat, third eye, and the crown chakra as well. And here's a gemstone that if you are lucky enough to see it in jewelry, I think it's fair to say it does come um, at a certain price point. Yeah. I love this paragraph. I think it's particularly beautiful. So um, the angelite crystal is a lullaby of light and love oh. and leaping to highest co higher consciousness. This is one of those stones that simply oozes spirituality and healing. The shades as soft as angel wings or the pale dawn sky streaked with a thousand promises. The angelite stone brings its blue color from ethereal energy and its message from the other side straight to your heart. Oh, that's it's, lovely. It's so pretty, isn't it? I wear an angelite bracelet every day. Having said that, it's not on this morning because I, I left it by the sink. <laughs> um, but my daughter made it for me and it's oh. um she just chose the strands she went in my drawers and she um got an angelite strand out and i uh, had some lamp work flower beads and she put them together on, on a stretchy elastic and i wear it every day 
because it's Angel Light, she knows it's my favourite and because she made it for me. Oh, lovely. And I do, obviously I don't wash my hands again in the shower on that in it because it's, you know, elastic. It's and, without water, so yeah. don't get it, try not so to get it So you wet. don't want to be doing that, which is why I don't go to bed in it, but every day it goes on. Yeah, I can see that, especially in a stretchy bracelet. Well, yeah. it is a beautiful stone. You know, I always think you can, gemstones can have, if you were to pigeonhole them, for example, so you can have a gemstone that is striking. Mm -hmm. You can have a gemstone that is, I don't know, uh, um, elegant. You can have a gemstone that's pretty. You can have a yeah. gemstone uh, um, that's intense or passionate, whichever it might be. This comes under that pretty paragraph, doesn't it? Because of the pastel palettes that you and get. And calming. Very calming. I find, well, I find it really calming. Well, straight away, look how, look how our demeanour has changed. I, you know, whether you believe in the meta... Do you know if you believe in the metaphysical size, uh, side of gemstones... Um, great. If, if, if you're not a believer of that, which I wouldn't say I read too much into metaphysical beauty, but straight away I, I do recognise when I calm myself down. How something makes you feel, whether yes. it be the colour. Yes. Sometimes, what, like, why do some people like certain colours and other people like other colours? And why, you know, like I did a colour therapy course, so they, I could go into this for years, but whether you believe it or not, sometimes you get a reaction. You have that to art, don't you? Yeah. Like you might get a physical reaction to art. Like you either love that's it or true. you hate it, and that's why it's art. And I feel like even if you don't go with the properties of gemstones, they will evoke, even if it's a, oh, I don't like that one. You have a reaction to it. And to Angel Eye, I usually find that people will say to me, they find it calming. And I personally find it really calming. So I'm not surprised that that is... Comforting. comforting. I find it quite comforting. It's gentle. Yeah. Yeah. Now, the last Angel Eye variety that we launched was that beautiful vivid oh, yeah, green. Again, natural, which blew my mind. And I think it sold out, didn't it? Um, in that selection, though... The largest size that we had was 12 mil. We've actually got 30, 14 millimeter. I love these. I'm not going to get any of these, am I? <laughs> now, 14, 12, 10, and then if oh, I jump to perfect. six, let me just swap those round. Hang on. There you go. 14, 12, 10, 6. And they are all limited. Now, I should also say the 14 that I've got 30, they're all available on pre order. Please know this is not dyed. This is not dyed, which was, would have been, I've got to be honest, would have been my assumption because I've never seen peacock colour. You think about peacock, don't you? That, you know, it's teal with blue, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. It's that tealy blue colour. And plus, you've also got translucency on these two. Um, if you want to shop ahead and guarantee yours, I would recommend that to be truthful because these, I am fully expecting this to be an on screen sellout. You know, because I can talk about the history, when it was discovered, you know, all that is knowledge, isn't it? Yes. Knowledge to have under our belt. This, is it beautiful? You know, that's the thing. Is this beautiful? First time ever, though, bringing you Angel Light in 14 millimeters. I've only got six lines. This is it. This is it. And I'm going to start with the 14 mils. Oh, Debbie. I just, I've never seen a colour like it. It's stunning. Isn't it's it? kind of like a tealy green. You've got areas of opacity, areas of translucency. Oh. You've got everything. So rare. Beautiful. It is beautiful. I love the kind of areas. It is a little aquapraise. Sorry, Ross said that in my it, ear yeah, earlier. It is. A little bit like your aquapraise. A little bit Larimar esque as well, isn't it? Because you've got. But Larimar doesn't tend to have uh, this level of translucency, but it's not exclusive translucency. These are flying out the door. Not 30 of you or less will be successful, and it's from the original location of Discovery. Brand new to our portfolio, and I think it's going to be a one show wonder. I don't think this is going to make it on. To another screen. If you miss out, then you can always wish list it. Wish list is your friend. Um, 
And I've just popped out for um, a little uh, um, visit the ladies' room. And I, on my way past, walking in the corridor, I see one of the call centre managers upstairs. And he's like, it's busy today, Al. Busy today. Yeah, I'm not surprised. We're launching. We're bringing giveaway type AJ and I. And right now, brand new colour. There are only 30. Look how beautiful it is against the skin. One price crash. Everybody pays the final low. Well done to Mary and Valentina and Angela and Chrissy and Janice and Dorothy and Eileen and Timothy and Tina. Um, well done. This is the first time we've ever done 14 millimetres. 39. Whoa. <laughs> you know what I'm thinking, don't you? They're all available on pre-order. Pre I was expecting this to be over £50, to be truthful, because they are huge. Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Not that with like a coral. Oh, color would be nice. Yes. Coral col colored cord. Say that fast. Coral colored cord. <laughs> um, how beautiful would that be? <laughs> I love it against the skin, though. You've got to be quick. There was only thirty. Mary, Valentina, Angela, Chrissy, Janice, Marie, Eileen, Dorothy, Tracy, Linda, Denise. I've got Christine, Barbara, Rebecca, Dorothy, Tina, Suja, Suri, Stephanie, Maker, Catherine, and Sharon. It's totally and utterly natural. You know, Sarah Bennett was a big fan of Angelite. Oh, really? And when she was actually a, um, a solo artist, a, a, a singer, um, she was called Angel, I think it was. That's right. So you can understand there's that connection too. But yeah. she loved pastel colours. A lot of Sarah Bennett's jewellery was in pastel colours. Yes. But I never recall, in all my years of working on Gemporia as well, do you remember, Roscoe? There was never this colour, was there? Never seen anything like it, yeah. It's beautiful. Angelite is very rare to see. You remember, it's in its 30s, Angelite. It's a, it, 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 it's a positive puppy in <laughs> comparison to the other gemstones in the world. It's a baby. It's a bubba. Down to the final five. Well done, everybody. It's going to be an on-screen sellout. Make sure you are shopping ahead on the other sizes. So 14, 12, 10, and 6. That, that's what I can bring you in the rounds. They're all on the website right now. And then I've got the two other shapes as well. Down to the final one. Oh. I'll leave it with you. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. 42 of you have the final one in your basket. Shopping ahead, well done. I would be doing exactly the same. Let's do the 12. Should we get up close and personal with these? Oh, yeah. my goodness. Let me get the white background firstly. There's 365 carats. If I roll it towards you, Michael, how does that... Never seen anything like it. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at that one there. Can you see how it lights up? It's gorgeous. Look at that. Debbie, look at that. That's magic. It is like magic, isn't it? You know, I like a magical gemstone. We have got a bigger quantity, but it is still only how many? 40. Look at this. That's just gorgeous. Look how beautiful that stone is. It, it has got chatoyancy, hasn't it? Look how beautiful that is. All totally and utterly natural. Oh, they're stunning. They're, it's like the finest quality Larimar I've ever seen, only it's not Larimar, it's actually probably, oh, some might even say rarer. Some might. We've got a slightly bigger quantity with your 12 mils, only by 10, by the way. Already almost half the stock has gone. It was savvy to shop ahead. If we're bringing you the 14 mils at 39.99, we didn't say, we didn't announce that this was going to be an avalanche, but <laughs> yeah, I'm feeling... Kind can, of is. Yeah, I can kind of get that. I'm getting that vibe, Roscoe. Is that right? In the rounds, anyway. Yeah, thought so. Dorothy, Newport, Margaret, well done to you, London, Carolyn, Nottinghamshire, Angela, Mary, well done to you, Tracy, Monica, Gwyneth, Judith, hello to you, Jackie, Elizabeth, Gloucestershire, Linda, I only have 40 opportunities, and look, just by the, the volume of names that I'm reading out to you, you can tell this is incredibly popular. We do gravitate towards it, whether you, like I said, you're a believer in the metaphysical side of gemstones, or whether you just, how does it make you feel? Yes, and exactly that's that. The perfect, the perfect way to describe it. it how is. does this gem make you feel? And, you know, I've not met anyone who doesn't like Angel Eye. Of course, there will be somebody who doesn't like it. But um, when you when I offer, you know, what, what do you want to stretch it? What do you want it made of or whatever? And, I, and I'll say what I've got. And people nearly always say Angel Eye. Yeah. Because there's something romantic about the name. Yeah. It's just everything about it. Well, we spoke about angels already this morning, didn't yeah. we? You know, an angel is a symbol. It's not just 
you know, it's not just about sort of lost loved ones. It's, it, 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 it is calming. It's comforting, I think. It is very calming. Um, I mean, that's why you probably do see it in things like your Marla style necklaces, because it's that kind of prayer. You can see that too. But it's also really beautiful as a, pal as a palette of, of colours. We've never had peacock before, though. We've had it in the blue, obviously. We've mm -hmm. had it in that vivid pink, uh, vivid pink, sorry, vivid green that sold out entirely. First time today launching your beautiful peacock colour. But it's peacock also with translucency. Um, well done. I only had 40. Suri, Helen, Alison, Helen, Suja, Linda, Monica. What are we doing? We've got how many left? 18 left. What? I'm so surprised by that. Time's a ticking. I want to bring them all to you today. We want every single one to be a sellout. I think it's fair to say there's two ladies here in the studio that would like to get hold of this as well, Roscoe. So many of you with it in your basket. He said, I can justify this price okay. drop. We're over allocated by about 50 people. Okay. So maybe we're not quite there. And if we can, if we can, we absolutely will. Yeah. You remember. $34.99 for 365 carats of a brand new colour that we've never seen before in our 13 years of broadcasting. That's pretty amazing. It, and also, it just... I don't know. I love it. I think it's beautiful. Like, I love the fact that it's angel like, but if it wasn't, I still love it. It's the colours. It's everything about it. It's so different. Beautiful. Well done. We're going even lower, though. First time ever. Are you obs... Oh, I've just had an idea. Debbie? Yes. Have you got any pearls with you? Pearls with me. Um... Imagine these with, with beautiful white pearls. You don't have to grab them, don't worry. I... They'd be lovely with pearls. I would put them with pearls. Yeah, me too. Definitely. No, I'm just thinking my pearl necklaces went off somewhere. They went off for photographs. Um, just imagine. Imagine lovely white strand of pearls on there as well. And, you know, <gasps> all Fingers that... on it. Oh, she's... Yeah, amazing. Yeah, because I think that's what I would... Because I love pearls, but it just oh, kind of match made in heaven. Oh, I mean. my <gasps> goodness. Look oh, at that. Look how lovely it is. That it's is beautiful. Stunning. Hi, Margot. I bought six millimeter anovals on pre order just to be sure. I don't, that's the way to do it. Trust us on the six mils. We've got a huge deal on those six mils. So, uh, Margot, you're going to be delighted that you did that. Shop ahead. The quantity left on these? Five. Oh. Okay. We want it to be an on screen sellout. We want you to enjoy this gemstone. Um, I, don't, I don't know. I haven't spoken to Wayne. Is there a likelihood that we'll get more of this or is it a very exclusive parcel? Well, the, the quantities would suggest that, wouldn't they? True. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, of course he'd have got more if it had given the chance. Um, it makes more sense for us as a business to get as much as we possibly can. The last one. Um, well done. I'll leave that with you. I'm not leaving. The, I'm not taking those pearls off my hand. Margot. Uh, what about Colombian emerald, a space Ooh. You, Margot. Not just any old em uh, emerald either. She wants to I'm, put I think, in Margot, what lovely. a lovely idea that is. Sounds beautiful. I want to see that piece of jewellery, please. Me too. Oh, my goodness. Look at this as a combination. I love that together. I totally love it. <sighs> I love what size is this? Six mil? Well, Eight we're going to do. These are 10. Right. Oh. These are six. Shop ahead on the six. We're doing the 10 now. If you have. Hands up if you've got pearls in your stash. Can I put two hands up? Yeah, it, it, it makes it pop. Ross just said it really makes it pop. It does, but against the pearls, doesn't it? Is that not it? the most perfect combination ever? I'm me. It. Pass it and me. And me. Unfortunately, though, Kinga's a really good floor manager. I know she is. So she kind of would notice. She would arrest me. <laughs> she would, Debbie, do not leave the building with those. We had 30 of the 14, 40 of the 12, I've only got 50 of the 10. Six mils are coming up. And that was to start with, by the way. Half the stock has gone on pre-order. Look, oh, right, okay. Samantha, Midlothian, Jennifer, Helena, Eileen, Lincolnshire, Tracy, Nora, Maker, Elizabeth, Judith, Nancy, Christine, Wiltshire, Lynn, you disappear off the screen, so I can't see all of your names just yet. 
um, Janet, Alison, Gloucestershire, Rebecca, Kent, Pamela, Julie, Myrtle, uh, Linda. You're all there. I, I, again, there's a delay on my call screens, but I know you're all there. We've got 50 available opportunities. It's so beautiful. It is so You know, let's, let's just have a little bit of fun. You would call, say, I don't know, um, you might call, a, you call a ruby passionate, don't you? Yes. Or, a, you know, that, that shows, you might call a Zarite elegant. Yes. Or a champagne diamond yes. elegant. This is, this is just beautiful. It's yeah. beautiful, isn't it? It is absolutely oh, pretty. stunning. It's one of those, it's one of those beautiful colours that I think we all are gravitating towards. Adore it, and I think I like. Oh, dare I? I like this the best. <laughs> yeah. I, and that's saying something because I loved, I <coughs> loved the green, loved, loved, loved the green. But I think I like this the most. This is my favourite. And the blue's nice. Is it your favourite? Yeah, because the oh, colour. So we're all confessing. Well, well, we're amongst friends, aren't we? Oh, yeah, and I, you know, I don't like to pick favourite, but it's, it's the colour. It's my favourite. <laughs> There's only one way to say. It. We all know what you think. Okay, I just yeah. say it. It's I my favourite. Like <laughs> <laughs> but don't, it's my favourite. I don't want to be disrespectful to my other little angel Oh, they're all beautiful, <laughs> aren't they? In their own individual right. But out of, if I had to pick one, it's going to be the peacock angel light it's every single time. Just it's oh, stunning. Stunning. Twenty four ninety nine. We have fifty of these. Everybody, or rather, I should say, had. Um, they have absolutely flown on pre-order. Amazing, because we are starting to... I mean, I, th I would use them all, irrespective of the size. Angelite is not a really heavy stone either, so it's very, very wearable, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, 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 definitely. You know, this, I've shown you before, and I know it's a totally different colour, but it's Angelite all the same. So, Roscoe, you know that you know that really lovely long line necklace? It's a bit of Debbie, actually, that, with one crystal at the bottom. Look, at the, look how beautiful that is. Yeah, that's beautiful. That's not knotted, it's look just simply... That. Really simple, beautiful, £240. It's not as rare. It's not as rare. No, the blue isn't. is not as rare as this colour. It's sold out. Well done. All three have sold out. Remember, let's go through the quantity. 30. Oh, hang on. 30. And by the way, they're all behind here as well, so there's loads. Um, 30, 40, mm. 50, six mils. <gasps> oh! There's 150. I still think they'll sell out though. Yeah. Are you ready? And it has to be. Look how beautiful that is. I had 150. 73 oh, have already co uh, confirmed on pre order. Okay. Good luck. Star by. It's your six mil. It's go. I was whittering on a little bit, wasn't I? <laughs> to be fair, he's not wrong. How rude. Oh, no, to be fair, that's not for that. Thanks. I'm sure lots of you wish you could, but I'll just put the star by sting in, will you? <laughs> <laughs> no, Adam, I like it. I like it, lovely. Thank you. Half the stock has gone already. Um, your six mil is the most popular size. It always is. We say it's that. Well, it's your Marlers, isn't it? Uh, it's your, yeah. Imagine that in a Marla. <laughs> what kind of noise was that? I don't know. You snarled I a went, little bit then. Um, I, was like, I went, oh, oh. In a Marla and a long line necklace. I mean, that kind of take inspiration from that beautiful design. I'm snarled. not great at knotting. Just pop, just bead them. And I don't want to separate it from the pearls. I think they look absolutely amazing with the pearls. They do. Um, we had, we've had sellouts across all three of the strands so far. 107 of wow. these have already gone. That means I've only got 43 left. And we haven't even suggested bringing the price on your screens. We're going to do it in one amazing price crash. Natural colour. This is not dyed. It is not enhanced. It is all Mother Nature's doing. In 47 seconds, it's going low. Do you agree it needs pearls? It needs to go with pearls. Oh, 100%. I mean, you know I love my pearls. Oh, my goodness, Debbie, look at the four screens. I'm not surprised. Four rows of names. I'm trying to not look because I'm not going to get any. <laughs> I know. We're very nearly almost sold out. We might well beat the clock, actually. We will still bring it to you at the amazing uh, um, star by price point. Don't you worry about that. But don't, don't wait. That is the really, uh, you, like I said, don't wait. 
trust the process. You know Jewelry Maker's going to bring the best possible deals. It's natural. It's never been on our shows in 13 years of broadcasting. And here we are, bringing it to you at that star by price point. We will absolutely... We're not going to just elevate the price tag just because the core screen's been no. busy. Um, from the very beginning of this launch, you've had Angel Light. You've had Viv Vivid Green Angel Light, which is natural too. Never have we had this beautiful peacock colour. And I know that Wayne was really fond of this one, wasn't he? You can't 1999. What? Yeah, you're right. You can't not be, can you? You can't not love this. <laughs> These sold out in 115 seconds. Yeah. I'm not surprised. It's gorgeous. It's different. It's the colour, everything about it. It's natural. You could have just not said anything and just shown it and just... Yeah, that's we, could true. Have, we could have gone for a coffee and come back and they'd have been sold out. Yeah, absolutely. I agree. Look at those together. Look how lovely they are. It's just oh. dreamy. There's nothing else like it, is there? Look at that. It's beautiful. It has toyancy as well. It's just beautiful. Okay. We are not done. Because, and I'm still keeping this pearl strand here. I think these were Debbie's pearls from your kits this morning. Yes. Because um, I've still got... <gasps> and that's it, by the way. This is it. Our portfolio of Peacock's Angelite is this. <gasps> I There's love 50 this. 50 of each. Me too. I normally gravitate to the rounds and only the rounds, but I have to say, I really like these shapes. I like the ovals because if you put the little rounds in between, it's really going to pop. Can we just... If you're one of the 150 people, or less probably, that got that... Does it get any more beautiful? Oh, Stunning. They're coming up. But be warned, there is 50 of each of those. Bang on, on the nose. We're going to start with, which do you say? The ovals, the one that... Uh, and then we'll do the coins as your finale. Okay. So this is one that you gravitated towards. Yeah. Oh, look. Let's, let's for a second. Let's work our way across the strand. It's stunning. It's so beautiful. That, can you see almost that chatoyancy that occurs naturally these aren't dyed these aren't coated these aren't enhanced it's all mother nature forms over millions of years and yet millions of years these have taken to form but do you, do you get i like the fact that they've been hidden away all those millions of years so do i and only discovered in 1987. Oh, no. fascinating sorry ross what did you just say you can't believe they're natural. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, that's what blew me away because the colour is almost too perfect, if you know what I mean. Yeah. It's just it's stunning. This is what, and I know it's a slightly different saturation <coughs> colour, but... Excuse me. You know, you think about Larimar, they want to look like this, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Larimar when they wants grow up. to look like a peacock angel -like. Yeah, they do. It does? Yeah. We're at £99.99. And 99 pence. You could treat these as cabochons if you wanted to. Yeah, you absolutely could. And we are going even lower. Good luck, everybody. We've only got 50 of each of these. We're not stopping at 99.99. Sorry, I'm putting them with pearls because they just have to happen. I think <laughs> it just has to happen. I think they need to be with pearls. It does have to happen, definitely. Yeah, I mean, I'm not telling you how to make your jewellery. You are way more qualified than I, are, <laughs> I am, but I just think it has to happen. <laughs> and if you want to put those lovely papaya pearls earlier on this morning, that would look lovely too, wouldn't it? £24.99. Oh. We've only got 50. They are not going to hang around. That, and, and do you know what? Today, we're launching Peacock Angelite. You can always wish list these items, folks. Our call centre will call you if anything falls back into stock. Um, Roscoe, have they all sold out thus far? We'll give a stock update after this one. I don't think this is... I think they're going to sell out on screen from the original launch, an entire sellout. £24.99 only for your beautiful puffy ovals, cabochons if you wanted to, whichever way you want to uh, um, sort of imagine it. Team them with your pearls, beautiful, with your rounds, absolutely amazing. This is the closest that you could find. You typed in turquoise, Angelite, OK. Ooh, that's nice. It's not this, not as nice as this, though, is it? Five hundred and twenty dollars. I mean, it's not, it's not five hundred dollars worth. 
Mm, well, because it's not even. Would that be the rarity? Do you think? Because you can't, people can't get hold of it. Yeah, probably. But it's probably. not as nice as these. These are like two tone of opacity and. Um, I totally agree. Lucency. I know which one I would choose. Me too. And you think how many of those you can make out of this one strand? Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. I do love the puffy <laughs> coins. I like the fact we call them puffy. <laughs> I do. Puffy coins. Oh, a puffy coin. I'm sure that's a Paula Bennettism, you know. <laughs> oh my. Little puffy coins. Oh, look. I love those. They might be my favourite. I think they might be some of mine as well. I don't know. Do you notice I then, I saw, oh, some. I don't know, because I love them all. I do. I wouldn't, you know, I'd take anything that I could get as far as size. Me and, too. But, I, yeah, there's something really gorgeous about these. Wait, Debbie, if this was a kit. Oh, can you imagine that in a kit? <sighs> not to get your hopes up, it's probably not going to make it in a kit. But I wouldn't have thought probably, so. Probably sell out, but look how lovely that is. It's beautiful. We have 50, and these are individually, uh, in terms of the carrot weights, up there in term, with, with the um, highest price. Uh, carrot, sorry. 250 carrots of your beautiful, natural... Oh, my goodness me. Uh, beautiful, natural, peacock, angelite. <sighs> Good luck trying not to be, desperately trying not to get distracted right now because tomorrow's launch has just been put before me and it is absolutely insane. These are going to sell out. I'll show you in a second. These are going to sell out, everybody. Well done to you all. 15 millimetres. Individual stones. I mean, again, let's just, 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 just for kicks. I don't, you know, oh. you'll probably reconfigure it, but just imagine it. Imagine it in a beautiful necklace, whether it's short, long, in between, whichever. Are you going to treat them as individual stones? Either way, it's stunning, isn't it? That's a little bit special right there. Look at that. It's stunning. Good luck, everybody. 250 carats of beautiful peacock angel eye. Make sure you're checking out. Would bring in that price point on your screens. I think we could well beat the clock in terms of a sellout. It's the biggest carat weight, is it? Outside of the 14 mils, yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised by that. Biggest dimension, though, aren't they? Circumference, diameter, whichever way you want to look at it. Love these. $24.99. Is that Wayne? Wayne, these are Hello. incredible. Can you get more? He says, do you want to know how long it's taken me to get these? He'll try, but probably not. Right, fair enough. It's worth an ask, isn't it? It's always worth asking. You know... If it is, it's probably going to be December time, yeah. I'm not surprised, but look how, look how popular they've been. I think it's going to be an on-screen seller. Stunning, absolutely stunning, and the fact they are completely natural. <laughs> Guess what? Sold out. They've sold gone. out, sold out. Oh, my goodness. Let's do a little stock update so you know. 14 millimetre. There are three left. Of the 12, 2, 10, sold out. Six, sold out. Ovals, there's one. Coins, sold out. Wish list them. You can still get a couple of those. Don't wait, because like I said, it's going to be probably Christmas time, if, if at all, that we get them again. Um, am I allowed to mention? Oh my goodness me. <laughs> Do you know, seriously, I was like that then with Kinga. <laughs> Kinga stepped into the studio and she's like, look at these. Oh, my goodness. And I, oh, in my entire career, I just made a really strange sound. I've never seen a mellow pearl. Me neither. <gasps> and Wayne said that. Oh, they're beautiful. Goodness me. They're unbelievable, aren't they? And when are these oh, on tomorrow? tomorrow? Oh, look at that one. What's it like on the back? Oh! Hoo -hoo. Do you know, this one's reversible, though, because you could wear that oh. mellow pearl either way. In fact... Oh, my goodness, these are beautiful. I'm going to show it that way because it's got a slightly different colour, but on the other side, you've got the, yellow, the orange. This is one of those, look, can I just show you, that pivots... Is it? Does it? No. 
Hang on. But it's reversible. So do you notice how that's got the circumference there? But the other side, if I turn it that way, can you see it's encrusted on the bale? Oh, that's amazing. So you can actually, oh my goodness me, that's beautiful. So you can wear it that way, where you've got the pink, that way, where you've got the orange. Oh, these are, this is the first time I've ever seen a mellow pearl. Remember, if you're thinking what's a mellow pearl, uh, it's a, it, I understand not many people will have heard of mellow pearls. They are arguably the rarest gems. Ah, what? Oh my goodness, I need that. <gasps> Sorry. Oh my goodness me, it's incredible. Oh my goodness. What? I'm going to be telling my husband to shop the top shop tomorrow. You better be watching tomorrow, Tom. They are very, very, very limited tomorrow at 10. With... Mr. Dave Tross. Also, I don't know if you've noticed. I know it's insane, isn't it? Hello. <laughs> also, coming up tomorrow, we are launching some brand new abalone. And my goodness me, these pieces are insanely beautiful. Um, abalone, you might have noticed there's the pen. You've got some really beautiful, like, kind of mosaic motif shapes. They are all, oh, it's incredible, Debbie, isn't it? Absolutely incredible. Hello. Mellow pearl, yeah. Suits you. You know what she's like on Sex in the City with her shoes? Yes. That's what I feel about this ring. Look at that. I mean, I don't think I've seen a ring that I like so much for a long time, and that's saying something. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Now, coming up tomorrow at 10 o'clock. Now, um, we've uh, loaded onto the website some more Angelite deals. Very limited. Some of them are actually selling out already. So oh, this cool. is obviously your more... Recognise blue, let's just put it that way. Um, we found two of the vivid greens, but they are, uh, there's less than 10 of each of those. Um, but we also do have one 10 millimetre blue. Haven't brought... Oh, yeah. These would work beautifully, actually, alongside um, alongside the uh, the peacock, don't you think? Now, this is the only one that we can actually find with any, um, any quantity. Angel Eye is very, very limited, and it's actually, well, you know, again, with Wayne in the, in the, in the gallery, it's, 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 it's younger than us, Wayne, this gemstone. <laughs> it's gone, is he? It is. This is a gemstone in his 30s. Absolutely beautiful and totally and utterly natural. And again, if you've been inspired by that necklace that we were showing, um, it's $240 or pounds, whatever it was, to make that. <coughs> um, and probably a, um, a significantly smaller carrot weight. Angel Eye in the more traditional blue. It's it's, I love the combination because you have with the vivid greens and the peacocks, you have those areas of translucency yes. and transparency. Whereas with the blue, it is that sort of opaque, beautiful, solid colour. Yep. It is that azure blue colour. Uh, we this is about. what you think about yeah. for Angel Eye, don't you? You just uh, you think of this colour. It's so stunning. You do, you do. Now, we've got quantity of it, totally natural, azure blue. Again, remember the scene that we were put. Imagine, you, imagine we're all together, we're on a picnic, oh, beautiful, yes. glorious summer's day. We've got a blanket and we stretch it out in a meadow somewhere and just lay back oh. and look at the, the azure blue of the sky. It's this. And when we launched it, the Peacock 10 millimetres were at 24.99, which completely sold out. Now, purely because, oh, it's not an excuse really, but I'm going to say it anyway. <laughs> purely because we've had the Blue Angel light before, we're going to squeeze it under 20 and I'm going to tell you that we're not done there. We've got quantity, 60. On the back of the launch of your beautiful Peacock Jay, uh, Angel light. We're going to do an amazing deal on the blue colour. Join us, though. And again, it's one of those that emotionally lots of us gravitate towards. Yeah, this is, I've got lots of this. Um, and I just, again, I've got stretchies. I've got like a long line necklace in this that's very much like a mala. Then it's got a tassel on the bottom. Yeah. Oh, I've got another one with a Buddha on the bottom. Um, yeah, it's just your classic, beautiful blue that you associate with Angelite. 
And it is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it really is. This is the Sarah Bennett Angelite that I remember of her collections, you know? I, I'm not a blue person, really, but uh -huh. I like this blue. Yeah, it's a different blue. Yeah. It is kind of lilac Soft. blue. So yeah, much, yeah. much, much softer. I always refer to it like a chiffon blue. It's very distinctive. Yeah. You I know agree. what it is by looking at it, don't you? Now we're going even lower. Not enough of you on the phone lines, though. If we're going to do this mega deal, if you've got 60 available and we want them to sell out on the back of the launch of your Peacock Angelite, I don't think there's enough of you there. You done it? Oh, the, oh, sorry, it's my call screens. There is sixteen Woo. pounds and ninety nine pence only. So if you're watching today, thinking, oh yeah, that's pretty, but I really like the blue. I want some blue. I need some blue angelite as well. You know, we launched the the, the peacock at twenty four ninety nine for the same size, bringing you. Um, yeah, when we say angelite, most of us immediately think of this colour. It's like blue to a sapphire, it effectively, is. yeah, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, we think immediately of this colour. Catherine, Gloucestershire, Myrtle, Julie, Cheryl, Linda, Samantha, Tracy, Kent. Um, make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. You can still do it. There's quantity um, available but it's always a very, very popular gemstone, whether it's the metaphysical side of angelite or whether it's just a pretty stone mm. in your eyes. Um, well done, everybody. Do stay where you are now. We've still got lots to bring you, um, including under 10, two, just after the break. So we'll go straight into under 10, yeah. And don't forget Debbie's amazing masterclass kits coming up. Beautiful, but these bicones are going to blow you away. That stunning jewelry. They are lovely. You would understand why. Had if it wasn't jewelry maker, I would almost imagine they're glass. Yeah, but, because but of the not. quality of them, and also you get some lovely clasps with gem settings. Oh, yes, know? I've just seen those. Yeah. I haven't, I haven't missed those. Um, so lovely masterclass kits coming up with Debbie in the twelve o'clock hour. But under ten, fast and pacey after this. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. This July, join us for the big summer blowout. We are launching 927 brand new products. We have a mega managers clearance event. Mark Smith's anniversary show and Christmas in July. Yes, you heard that right. Christmas in the summer. So join us for Jewelry Maker's big summer blowout. It's going to be a scorcher of a month. Miss it and you'll miss out. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Oh, welcome back. Under £10 pound deals. Can I just say for a second, I kind of dropped this on our lovely Debbie this morning. I was like, Debbie. Help me, situation. Situation critical. Yeah, it is. It, it is because I have a, a, a mortified little six-year-old who doesn't want to go. As what's his name? As a, as Patrick. Patrick off. Um, I think I look lovely. SpongeBob. Like, I'm in it now. This um, she said, like, "Mummy, I, I can't." She was like, "I'll get bullied." I was like, "You won't get bullied. I think it's going to be one of the coolest costumes ever." Anyway, she doesn't want to do it. Debbie to the rescue. Look at that. I think it should be sideways on. It's all I could find in the studio, but it's my little starfish headband. She's a starfish rock star, by the way. I make her a trident. Yeah, she's going to love that. It, she she doesn't have to wear it. No, <laughs> she's going to love it. I'm going to video her reaction. Thank you, Debbie. Now, who wants an under £10 deals? It's going to be fast and pacey, says our, our Roscoe. Let's do fast and pacey. Wait a minute, because, Ross, you've said that, and then what do I have before me? Okay, no, no, yeah, what... Some jade deals under that? £10. Pounds. <laughs> Bottling clasps? Yes, please. Under, is this all under £10, what's coming now? Some. Oh, some, okay. Some of it. A lot of it. Most of it. Most of it, yeah. Ooh. They're lovely, aren't they? So we'll always Good tell size. you. Yeah. So they're not too fiddly. Mm, I but find bolt ring clasps difficult. This is a perfect size. Yeah, they're difficult if they're tiny. You know those tiny ones? Yeah, yeah. I agree. Um, previous closing price, £12.99. pence. You get a pack of 10 of them. I'm not stopping there, though. I'm happy under £10. I was happy at £12.99. That's mm -hmm. great. That's one, what, £1.30 each? 10. 10? 10 of them. And they are precious metal... Pressure. These are silver. Mm -hmm. Wait, I thought they were they were going to be base metal at that price point. Ah, no, no, no. We've got a huge quantity. How often do we see bolt ring clasps? Really? When we do, are they normally this size? I've realised on air I, I answer my own questions quite a lot. <laughs> Sometimes I don't know if you want me to answer or it's <gasps> just like a, you know, what's it called? Ugh, uh, brain. Um, a question that you don't expect an answer to. Yeah. Texting, <laughs> you know the word. Uh, rhetorical. Rhetorical. rhetorical that's the word. Um, yeah. Seven ninety nine. But you know, this is very, very popular at the moment. These got everything gold plated. Yeah. You know, even the designers are doing gold plated because mm. gold is so expensive. So expensive. You know, solid gold would m make things so so expensive. Absolutely. But usually, you will pay a premium for having that coating. Yeah. Yeah. You go to somewhere like uh, Al Alex Monroe. Yes. You pay a premium for gold-plated there. You do. I don't know any other. You don't. No, it's always true. a bit more expensive, isn't it? Monica Veneda, another more one. expensive. Yeah. Seven ninety-nine, and we're going to go low. We've <gasps> got a big quantity of these. Stock up your stashes. That's very good at seven ninety-nine. Very good, but we're going nowhere. Oh, okay. <laughs> if you find it tricky using like your seven mil, six millimeter bolt ring class, then you'll find these a lot easier. So if I put my hand behind it, mm. you get an idea of perspective. Really good size. Um, yeah, much. Can this is one of the largest, to be truthful, um, bolt ring class that we've actually brought to air. The fact we're going even lower and you get a pack of ten. Gold. I thought I assumed that these were going to be base metal just because you said under ten pounds. Just assumed they were. How many have we got? Ooh, 200 of them, £6.49 pence only. <laughs> do you remember, Debbie, mm. when we used to do them in packs of three? Yeah, absolutely. 
I'd pay for that for six forty nine for three. Me too. Because you know you've got the gold plating there. They're a good size. I mean, this is a size that I really lack because you know if you've got larger pearls or larger gemstones, you know mm. you don't want a tiddly tiny little clasp because it's fiddly, but also the security of your piece. You yeah. don't want you know you want it to be able to hold on to the weight of the gemstones. Uh -huh. You need it. You need it to yeah. Grip the class on in needs there. to hold on. Well, you're not getting three anymore. You're getting ten of them. That's good. That's amazing. So what's that? Sixty-four, sixty-five peach. <laughs> Six for gold-plated sterling <laughs> silver. It's gone crazy. It has gone crazy on the phone lines. Twos, threes, fours. Amazing. Barbara, Donna, Jane, Denise, Pauline, Elaine, Linda, Deirdre, Alan, Linda, Carmel, Carol, Patricia. The reality is, and there is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, and the reality is, look, we can get, ro and I say this quite a lot, you can get romanced by the gemstones, we've got Mellow Pearl launching tomorrow, oh my goodness, you've just had Peacock, uh, uh, um, Angelite, you've got beautiful kits with Debbie coming up, you know, we could uh, your Jadeite, your pearls, whichever it is, you need the fundamentals, you need the clasps, but with certain launch, most to be fair, but with certain gemstones in particular, I would go, but it has to be precious metal. Yeah, me too. And I expect it to pay, I expect to have to pay a slightly higher price point. Not the case here though. They're not really bitty, are they? Uh, They're I, big. I'm really, really lacking gold plated findings because mm. everyone seems to, to want them at the moment. I mean, gold went out for a while and it was all silver and then it was all gold for ages. Yeah. Like people wanted gold and nothing else. And now it's gone a little, silver's come back a bit. Yeah. Um, but so I just, ran out when yeah. everyone wanted gold everything it's gorgeous isn't it six pound 49 is such a good deal it, 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 it is crazy absolutely crazy we had 200 of them i don't think they're going to last though twos threes fours amazing west midlands the fact as well that they are that little bit bigger than your sort of more traditional bolt yeah, ring class definitely and um, because they best one in the world they are a little bit fiddly aren't they whereas these You've got, you've definitely, well, you've got something to get hold of, haven't you? <laughs> At the end of the day, you which is always have. better, yes. always better. Um, okay, I can't believe you just said that in my ear. Yeah. So for the record, this is a high goo. For the record, we ha nothing has changed since the last time I spoke about jadeite this morning and to, to this present moment in time. Jadeite hasn't all of a sudden become incredibly accessible. and They've just opened the mine in the break. <laughs> Guess what? There's some more. Yeah. You know, how oh, I just decided to open it. We are still talking about a gemstone that, as we said, commands some of the highest price points in the gemstone world. Four carats. That's lovely. You know that mellow pearl ring mm -hmm. that we've just shown? Mm -hmm, yeah. You could do a version of that, you couldn't could. you? Good. It also has that double, ah, oh, can you imagine like one, what do you think that is? Three millimetre round brilliant cut stone there. Yes. And then just here, maybe a little melee sized diamond to the centre, to the side. Or if I hold it, is it that way? Where's yeah. it gone? Where's it gone? There. That way, it's a pendant. Just, I love the simplicity of that as a pendant. You know where you could even just put it the chain through it and have it sideways yeah, or a jump ring or a large jump ring or one of our decorative jump rings it would be so pretty debbie <laughs> big summer blowout <laughs> Hello, <Beverly. laughs> Anyone who's ever had children knows that quite well. Absolutely. <laughs> Nine ninety-nine only. He's the best character in the whole of Frozen, isn't he? <laughs> Olaf's up there as well. Um, <laughs> ooh, um, <laughs> Nine ninety-nine. Oh. Seriously, then we're talking about Taipei, Burmese Jade. The mine is closed. Hundreds of years. A tenner. A tenner. You know, like Susie talks about the fact that her and her mum used to go to uh, um, like the jade markets, used to save up once a year, they'd yeah. go to the jade markets and, you know, she used to spend, she used to buy little pieces like this, but they would never, ever, ever be anywhere near the prices that we do right now. Yeah, because she's got that unique perspective. She's yes, she seen has. that in her life. And like that would have been a while ago, wouldn't it? Yeah. So imagine what it would cost now in the yeah, jade markets precisely. or what they'd even have available. And also to actually get type A grade, you know, because most, you know, Dave, we've shown you certainly Dave's experience when he was looking at a type A, uh, looking at a bangle. It wasn't type A though. It was actually polymer impregnated. Oh, really? Yeah, and it was more, more money. $5,000, I think it was or something like that. Um, 
Oh, these are lovely. And, and <coughs> look amazing with that pendant that we did earlier on. You know, the flower pendant? Mm -hmm. Because that was in white, wasn't it? So you could mix it. And also, can I just say with your peacock, Angela, that'd be nice too. Um, look at those. She got oh, a parcel, lovely. effectively. Um, <laughs> what's going on there? Where does... <laughs> oh, it's my hand like that. We've had some good thumbnails, haven't we, on yeah, YouTube? Yeah, great. We've had some great ones. We get stitched up quite a lot, don't yeah, we? Yeah, we do, yeah. Um, I look like I'm judging you there. <laughs> yeah, you're like... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Under £10! And you don't look too happy either. <laughs> we don't like we're having a fallout. <laughs> <laughs> Under £10 for a full parcel of Taipei. <laughs> um, emerald green, or oil green, they actually refer to it. Very good. And for your Taipei jade, I, I love that. I absolutely love that. That's, that's going to be the thumbnail. Oh, there oh, we are. There We're you happy go. again. Happy again. We made friends. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> you know, the last one was because we couldn't get any of the angel light. We were disgusted. Disgusted. Mm. Uh, appalled. Um, well done. Under £10 only for six carats. They are through drilled as well. So, again, perfect little accents. So, do you know what? I've just thought of this. Roscoe. You know, we said when we launched the angels, it was like, okay, we've put it with the with the space uh, with the base metal, so that everybody can afford. Yeah, we're doing it for under a tenner <laughs> at this of one of the rarest gemstones in the world. That's not an overstatement. Do you know what I do with these? A stretchy ring. Oh, that'd be lovely. Mm. That'd be perfect. Um, yeah, because they are that smaller size. Yeah, lovely. I've got a little pea pod. <gasps> I love these pea family. pods. Represents family, your little pea pod. Pod of peas. Um, yeah, and protection as well. You know, I actually included, when I did the Willow and Tig collection, included a pod of peas. And I remember yeah. explaining it to our um, um, buyer, um, at Caroline. And she was like, you want, to do, you want to do what? And I was like, a pod of peas. And she was like, why do you want to do a vegetable? Why, why a vegetable? Yeah. And I was like, because it's what it means. It's representative of your family. And they're in their little blankety beds, aren't I they? Like All that. protective. Um, look, this is imperial pure white, your pod of peas, love this, if I turn it on the side profile you can actually see it there as well, um, your little pod of peas, so you said you've got three children, mm. little pea, my little peas, your little peas, well, not little anymore but yeah, I call Willow little pea, in 37 seconds we're taking it, no, no, hang on a minute, Roscoe, what are you taking us to, no way, really? It How is type A got? white jade. How many is available? 40 available. There won't be after this. That is just... Do you know what we announced at the beginning of this hour, what we said we were doing, and, and but it won't include absolutely everything. It surely can't include absolutely everything because I have got white jade out here and it's imperial white and it's it's got that fine texture translucency that Richard Wise spoke about. Surely that cannot be going under £10. There's absolutely no way that this can be going under £10, surely. No, definitely not. For that little pea pod, that's very disrespectful to that little pea pod for £9.99. Uh, talk to Ross. Ross. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ross. <laughs> <laughs> You know. That's amazing. How unbelievable is that? That's so good. Well done, everybody. Gloucestershire, Christine, Deborah, Catherine, Noreen, Denise, Suja, London, Cheshire, Sheila and Rachel and Sean and Elaine and Maker in London, Carmel, Elizabeth, Linda, Anne, Rachel, she... I can't keep up with you. I really can't. 9 99 for your little pod of peas. And by the way, that's not just family, because you might be thinking, well, you know, it, it's not just children or grandchildren. It can be friends as well, just uh, loved ones. It can, I, he, it's representative of people you love. Yes, or, exactly. Things you or, love. Exactly. Like it could be your animals. Yes, or, absolutely. You know. Doesn't have to be sort of family members as such. You know, it's whatever you hold dear to your heart. That's what it means. And wrapping them up and protecting them. Oh. It's also that season, isn't it? Peapod season. Oh, I love peapods. I'm a raw. Oh, yeah, me too. Just pop through pop. them. <laughs> yummy, 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 yummy. Um, they've sold out. Well done. Amazing. Do you want another one? Yes, please. Mm. The root, oh, you know, this, that's like your peas. These are like your fine beans, squeaky beans. <laughs> this is like, yeah, this. The... <laughs> I, I, again, I think poor pods of peas. I like pods of peas. 
So pods of peas, you can get in like, I don't know, I don't know, you can get those in your Tesco's and your Asda's. Yeah. And this is for the Waitrose of you, the, you know, the, the fine squeaky beans. I feel that's, that's something that Jamie Oliver would call and them. My granddad used to grow these in his garden. Did he? Oh, they went so good. Squeaky beans. Bit of what, what do you say? You were friends with Jamie Oliver? <laughs> Adam's like, uh, I met him once. And? That's best mates if you've met someone. Yeah, once, and is it. he a nice chap? Yeah, good, good, good. Did he, did he cook for you? No. Have you been to his, have you, did you work in his restaurant? I know Adam's a chef, or was a chef. Did you work in his restaurant? Briefly, okay, fair Ooh. enough. So, did they have pea pods? <laughs> did they have these? <laughs> Probably. Mm. This for me is crying out to go on a stretchy bracelet, on a slider bracelet. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> Let me show you all the way around first. So this is like your your beans. How many drill holes does it have? Well, it's a good question. There, there's one there. Can you see it? At either end, effectively. Can you <gasps> see those? So. And you've got that lovely curved shape. Oh, I love that. Me too. Hang on. If you got that Acropraise slider bracelet earlier on, is that not just perfection? Oh, now you're making jewellery. How nice is that? That is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Lowest price, what? Lowest previous price, 49.99. Guess what? Sold out under ten pounds. Amazing. Are you kidding me? We under did do it, didn't we? Here's me whittering on and not even paying any attention. Not actually doing my job to be. That's fair. an amazing deal. I know. If you've just tuned in, tomorrow at ten o'clock. Oh my goodness me! Mellow, mellow pearls. I'm going to be there at ten. I'm going to be there at five to ten. <laughs> yeah. This is the, 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 there won't be anything rarer than this. Oh, it's so... So many people say this is the rarest gem in the world. But even if it Number one. wasn't the rarest gem in the world, look at the jewellery. Yeah, it, it is, is stunning. stunning. It is absolutely some, uh, stunning. Coming up, coming up at 10 o'clock tomorrow. Adam, is Ross being needy? Is he being a bit needy? He says he, needy. he is needy. <laughs> Are you, Ross? Very needy. In what way? Do you just need cuddles every so often? You need reassurance. He sounds like one of my Labradors. <laughs> <laughs> well, you said that. Aww. Did you? Ross said to his girlfriend, um, he was like, look, if this is going to be a thing, you need to text me regularly because I need... That's fair enough. Otherwise, I think you don't. Well, they should do that anyway. You shouldn't have to ask. Yeah, but I think that it's good to say what you need like that um, in a relationship to be able to, because people aren't psychic. Yes, oh, yeah, do you know, good. It's nice. Good for you. Ross. I don't see, there's nothing wrong, you know, like, there's nothing wrong with being affectionate and showing your emotions and your feelings. I think it's good. He's, oh, he needs, he needs to be reminded. I, well, I'm glad you've said that, Ross. I will say it more to you. Ross, you're amazing and we love you. And he's a very good producer, he's isn't the, he? Oh, the best. Absolutely. But you always think people who are good know, don't you? <laughs> Genuinely, though, I've say, I say this and, and you've just reminded... I know we've got off the beaten track here, but um, I do say that in your absence all the time, Ross. I do say that in your absence all the time. She has said that to me. I can I? vouch for that. Yeah. yeah. In, I do say that regularly. Um, he says, it's like, the truth. Do you believe it's true? It's true. It's true. He says he knows it's the truth. That's nice. Right then, should we do some under, uh, more under ten pound deals? Uh, because I'm a blowout. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, family. And the little towels. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to want to watch that. Do you, now, know, no, but do you know why? Because I've been watching it with Clemmie. Have you? Because so, I do love it. Yeah. It and I'm good. like, yes, a second chance to watch Frozen. It's the best line of the whole time. And, he, and he's so funny when she goes up that mountain and she walks in and he just goes, hoo hoo. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> oh, 
Oh, uh, I don't see those. Oh, I do. I do, I do, I do. I beg your pardon. Beg your pardon. Aquamarine, beautiful stud earrings. Woohoo. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, we are doing this, aren't we? It's beautiful aquamarine, gorgeous orbs of glacial blue. Oh, they're lovely. They're stunning, aren't they? Ah. Oh. Oh, Daisy's best friend would like those because that's her birthstone. Oh, there you go. And you know it's going under £10. Very, very good. You know, they are sterling silver. Crazy lows, says our Roscoe. Should I put them in the ear as well so you can imagine? This is a studio sample. So they're gorgeous. I mean, nice little, I'm going to say it, stocking filler. Why not? Are they sterling silver? Oh, yeah. yeah Solid sterling silver with a classic little, uh, little six mil round. You can't get hold of aquamarine as much, can no, you? No, yeah. So if you know something... Me. You've been married 19 years? On the 17th. Have you really? Yeah. These were made for you then. Oh, look how beautiful they are. My little willow would like these as well. <sighs> Glacial blue. You're right, you really don't actually see aquamarine. You don't, do you? It's very hard to... I always say to Willow, you've got aquamarine eyes. Um, three carats of, across the two beautiful, uh, perfect round, six millimetres in their size. A classic stud. I mean, this is the kind of jewellery that you can put on and never take off, really. It's lovely. It's really pretty. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, make sure you check it out. Nice little stocking fillers, but we are going even lower. Have we got a quantity of these then, Roscoe? 28 available. In 12 seconds, going even lower there. You'd struggle to get costume jewellery. I'll just put the other one there. I feel he feels a bit lonely on his on, on his Todd, doesn't he? Um, you know, <laughs> you, you go into somewhere like Claire's Accessories or New Look or, I don't know, Marks and Sparks, I think genuinely you'd struggle to get hold of costume jewellery at anywhere near that price point. Definitely uh, pay more than £10. We paid £9.99 for six plastic hair clips in one of those shops the other week. Plastic hair clips. It's true. It's true. Not a genuine gemstone. It was, they're plastic. In my desperation last night, I bought some plastic starfish. <coughs> and there were more than that. Yeah, but you know. Desperate times. Exactly. I don't need to worry anymore. And you're going to make a... I'll make a trident. trident. Yeah. Make a trident. So in street of past the fabric, I'll make a trident. You are on it. I'm on it now. Seven pounds and 49 pence only. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. Nice gift. Earrings as well, you can't go wrong. As long as you know they've got a piercing, um, then it's generally speaking one size fits all. Um, let's do what, sorry, some chain. Which one? Cable chain. Classic. Sterling silver. Cable chain, so for example, ahead of tomorrow's launch, or maybe if you got hold of the pea pods. Pea pod, pea pod. Mm. You, why did I sound like, hey, bird? <laughs> <laughs> hey, bird. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember him? <laughs> <laughs> Don't, because I'll have to be nipping off there to the bathroom in a minute. <laughs> You're going to need your sterling silver chains, though, aren't you? Uh, oh. Well, for Bert. <laughs> <laughs> for your peapod. Yeah, sorry, I just said something and realised I sounded a little bit <laughs> like him. Hey, Bert. <laughs> um, <laughs> Five ninety nine. Yes, it's solid sterling silver. Can I also just say our sister channel are so desperate for chains at the moment. So I wouldn't be surprised if we've got uh, Gemporia audience watching too. Um, yeah, you can't go wrong with a sterling silver chain, can you? No, you All can't. your high goos that we've brought you so far this morning. There's so many things that I mean you just need on a, even at like single pearl. We were talking about the yeah. single pearl oh, yeah, necklace. Yeah. Just pop it on a sterling. Oh, look at that. that there is, you go. You order far. Do, 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 do. There you go. Let's imagine one of those. Oh, Let's put that on the bottom. I need that. Five ninety nine. Yes. Stock up your stashes. Opportunity. Um, make sure you're guaranteeing yours. Have I got quantity of these then, Roscoe? No, of the chain. On the verge of selling out. Have we got quantity of this one? Forty available. Even if you look at this to deconstruct, I mean, I don't think you need to. Um, it is smoky quartz, which we rarely oh, ever I see. I love smoky quartz. And me. Oh, I'd put a charm in the middle of that. Oh yeah. You know, in the nice. middle of the beads there, just a little jump ring, a little, 
initial or a whatever you have. Nice. We've all got charms that we've bought and we haven't done anything with yet. Don't forget as well our on and offable class that we had this morning. Yeah, that would that be really would work good. on there, yeah, wouldn't it? Would, yeah. Nine ninety nine under ten pounds, solid nine two five sterling silver in the slider bracelet, and then you have got your beautiful uh, uh, smoky quartz. We haven't seen a great deal of smoky quartz for quite some time, and uh, Linda Bromwell always used to say it's the soft black, isn't it? It is the soft black. That's a really good description. And works with everything. It complements everything. It's lovely. Whether it's pearls, whether it's Amazonite, whether it's your garnets that are coming up in the 12 o'clock hour, all of the above. Make sure you're checking out those baskets, everybody. Under £10 deals. Ooh, ooh, big summer blowout. Um, amazing. Stay where you are. I don't. No, I don't see a Peridot one. Have we got that in Peridot? Um, I've, got, I've got tourmaline, black tourmaline in the slider bracelet. Is that what you mean? Yeah, beautiful. So I, I know again, Debbie, you're really into the metaphysical side of your gemstones, aren't you? Mm. Black tourmaline is a very powerful gem, is that right? Yeah, it's, it's sort of known as the power stone, isn't it? So you sort of root chakra and... Protective. Yeah. Love it. Look at that for a finished piece of jewellery. And not everybody wants the sort of the intricate, the delicate, the, you know, the ornate. Some people, simplicity is the best. Absolutely. And, and this is for layering. I mean, you, yeah. know, you wear a lot of silver bracelets or bangles and you can just pop that in between and it's just absolutely perfect for layering. Well, as you mention it. Yeah. Something like this look. The more the merrier. Yeah, absolutely. Well, you often wear multiple net bracelets, well, don't you, as do. well. Um, these are coming up next and yes, they are sterling silver. Um, so... Let's do the Amazonite first, shall we? This is my favourite. I absolutely love this. Yeah, one of my favourite gems. Uh, and ahead of your masterclass kit that's coming up in a few moments' time. So we were saying when and I launched these, um, to source the Amazonite in terms of the rounds and to source this component. You know, how much would this be on our screens? Then mind out elsewhere. Mm -hmm. That is a 925 sterling silver charm carrier, effectively. Yeah. Um, it is solid sterling silver. And, yeah, so just to... Is this going to be in the under 10? Yeah. Oh, okay. Usually. That component on its own, 7 99 would we all agree? Here at Jewellery Maker. Uh, oh, here at Jewellery Maker, yeah. It'll be more elsewhere. Yeah. Fits perfectly. But you have got the Angelite as well. Uh, sorry, the Angelite. I'm stuck on, transfixed on Angelite. <laughs> You've also got the Amazonite. Nine pounds and 99 pence. That's so good. That's incredible. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, it's lovely. You know, put one of your pearls on there, maybe your encrusted pearls that we had earlier on. Your on and offable. On and offable class. Perfect, because you've got the carrier just there. Nine pounds and 99 pence only. They were launched, I think, part of the birthday, I seem to recall. Um, we are down to the final few of them now. Nine ninety nine. Again, even if you deconstruct it, to source the Amazonite, to source the sterling silver component, very giftable. Stretchy bracelets always yeah. are. Oh, yeah. Um, I know that many of us favour Amazonite, say it's one of our favourite gemstones, because it has, again, it's got that palette, isn't it? A bit yeah. similar to the Peacock Angel Light that we had a few moments ago. How many have we got left of these, though? Because I know it's not many. Oh, it's more than I thought. 38 available, but Jane's just got two. Carol's just got two. Susan, well done to you. Shirley, Linda, Georgina, Nita, Pauline. I could go on. Lots of you there. Shop ahead. We're bringing you lots of under £10 deals. Woo hoo. Tell you stories about saunas, you know. <laughs> okay, yeah, perhaps, perhaps you're right. Um, no, <laughs> well, I know I used, I used to ski. I used to ski a lot. So oh, did you? yeah, when I was younger, yeah, we used to ski quite a lot. And uh, it's a, you know, it's it is a whole experience, a sauna, you know, in in places like Austria and everything. Yeah, because they it's Roll part of the their snow. culture, isn't it? Mm. Mm. Roll in the snow. Um, anyway, right, let's go to, not Austria, let's go to Australia, um, oh, yeah. Western Australia more particularly, and this is a beautiful mookite. I love mookite. Me too. Everybody has to say it with a slight Australian twang, oh, don't I'm you? rubbish at Australian yeah, twang. But this is nice, I think, when you're layering. Mm. So if you mix in your metals, this is nice, because you have gold and silver bangles. Rose gold goes with anything. It's such a pretty stone. It's a variety of jasper, one location in the world. So incredibly rare. Mm. Um, and last time I actually checked, I will actually update my, uh, you know, just double check this too. But last time I checked, there was only two mining licenses of this gemstone. So it might well deplete. Ooh. You never know. We're at $9.99. Again, you get that lovely sterling silver um, pendant or charm carrier just here. We were saying on the original launch. And when we first launched them, we had, we had a pearl variety, didn't we? That sold out. 
Um, we had the Amazonite night that you just saw there as well. They absolutely flew. We were saying just deconstruct it, vis you know, just in your head, for example. How mm -hmm. much would I pay for the mookite? How much would I pay for that sterling silver? Yeah. It's not going to be five pounds, is it? No, <laughs> absolutely not. Definitely not. And we're going even lower. How many have we got? 50. Ooh. We did buy a big quantity of these for the launch. They were launched as part of the birthday celebrations. We're down to the final 50. I couldn't, I don't recall us taking this lower than 9.99 though. So yep, yeah, we went even lower than that. Okay. So giftable, because you're covering lots of different palettes, aren't you, as well with Mukai. I wonder if people are buying for like presents and thinking ahead for birthdays, birthdays. and anniversaries, Christmas, that sort of thing. Oh, I'm glad it's not just me. Claire rolls her eyes every time I mention Christmas. No, you have to. If you've got loads of people to buy for as well, you know, people with big families, you can't buy it all at once. No, and furthermore, I want I want my money in December. That's and I don't I want, want to be money. stressed in December. No, same. Good. I'm glad it's not just me. Um, and a very much a um, I, I think gents, ladies. I yeah. think it's one of those that oh look at this one here um, that everyone's going to absolutely love. Look at this. Look how pretty that is. That's so pretty. Seven pounds and 99 pence only. Um, again, separate it if you want to, if you're thinking or visualizing something else. You might take some of the Mukai out, team it alongside another gemstone, whichever it might be, deconstruct. It's up to you, it's 7 99 The point is, we were saying, I think you would pay that here at Jewelry Maker just for that sterling silver. Yeah, absolutely. Go on, off you pop. And that um, would be a good deal. Yeah. It'd be an amazing yeah. deal. And you're getting the Mukai as well for free. Um, we had 50. Make sure you're checking them out, though, everybody. 0800 um to guarantee your success. And speak to our wonderful UK-based call centre. Um, if it's in your baskets or um, on the app, make sure you're checking them out. 50 can go in an absolute nanosecond. We've had lots of sellouts already this morning. Um, yeah. Yeah. Under £10 is just madness. If these it? are really? left at the end, I'm going to get both of these. Yeah. Um, just for gifts, yeah. for the stocking fillers. Yes, absolutely. Because do you think we're going to be able to get hold? You remember, just for the geography, the air miles of Mookite. And it's not worth getting a strand and a, and a, you wouldn't be able to usually get a strand and the bead, the sterling silver bead and the elastic. It's just not worth making it. No. Not for that, Seven no. ninety nine. No, I agree. I agree. Well done. Stay where you are on those phone lines, everybody. Um, um, in one auction's time, we have Ooh. Tanzanite. And it is going under £10. Oh, what did you say? Nice. Just a few more ago. I know. Thank you, lovely. Um, yeah, but we've seen like one today. Yeah. Some days you don't see any. And like we used have to we? Have, have we seen Tanzanite already today? No, no. I mean, this is the oh, one. Oh, this is the this one. This is the yeah. one. Yeah. Um, you know, and before, like years ago, when we were in the old studio, you'd have like loads of deals in a day of Tanzanite, wouldn't you? And oh, that wasn't that long ago in the scheme of things. No, 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 no. And, and, and again, gems, I, we used to do Tanzanite weekends. Yeah, exactly. Whole weekends where it was only Tanzanite. I've got one Tanzanite strand now. It's coming up in one auction under £10. To take us there... Ah, oh, matte mm. black terra jasper. It's so exciting, this stone. I think it's got a moodiness to it. If it, you know, we were talking about gemstones' personality. Yes. This would be the like, like a, almost like a Heathcliff character. I can imagine my son's wearing a stretchy of this. Yeah. Because it's yeah, it something be quite cool masculine. about it. Yeah, yeah it's something I agree. Quite cool and trendy about it. A bit lava rocky. Yeah, and just, but it's still a jasper, which they'd be interested in. Yeah, I think they would wear this. Under ten pounds, what? Wow. By a long way. And I'm thinking about all the different, like, like your David Beckham's. Yeah, that's the. Sort He'd of, yeah, wear this, he wouldn't he? And your. It's got a bit of class about it. It has. I totally agree. And what's the other? Grealish. He's he's fond of his. <laughs> you saw you saw what a lad in um, a, a, a guy in Coventry wearing those pearls, the Grealish bundle. I like how you've named it after that now, the Grealish bundle. Oh, is it called the Grealish Bundle? There you go. And it's ah. just, yeah, pearl necklaces, effectively. Um, but, yeah, so many. It's lovely to see as well, you know, the gents wearing um, beautiful gemstones like this. See if I can show you. But, yeah, I can't imagine, like, Lewis Hamilton, something yeah, like yeah. that. There he is, the Grealish Bundle. 
I mean, he's ever so slightly inebriated in that photograph. Who is isn't that it? person? He's a footballer. Oh. He's a footballer. A very good footballer, I think. I really like his necklaces. He looks cool, doesn't he? Yeah, do you want to see what, how much they are? Uh oh. Well, actually, considering you, he's got a fairly substantial bank balance, I, sh I should imagine, being a footballer. Um, how much were these, Roscoe? Those necklaces? Wasn't too bad. About £170. Do they call it? Where's the, where's the Grealish bundle? Oh, yeah. Oh, I see. What if they, did he get it from there or did they just copy it? Yeah. Oh, I see. Love it. Very nice. They probably gifted it to him. Oh, yeah. You it's know. a walking advertisement. Absolutely. They probably gifted it. And, and why not? You do it. Go, send, some, send some links to your footballers and your celebrities, etc. Anyone wants to send me jewellery to wear on Absolutely. Feel free, you know. Yeah. Tiffany, you know, any of you, I'd be perfectly happy to do. <laughs> <laughs> happy. <laughs> happy, 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 happy. Van Cleef. Yeah. Chanel. You know, any of them. Yeah. Yeah. Like, that's going to happen. Do you know what couldn't possibly happen? What? Oh. Mm. So earlier on when we were talking about Angelite and he was saying that here's a gem, Angelite's a gemstone that formed over millions of years and yet was only discovered in 1987. So for millions of years, it was like one of Mother Nature's secret. Oh, yeah, mm. I love that. 585 million years ago, Tanzanite was formed. <gasps> wow, it's my yeah. birthstone. Is it? Mm. Your December baby. Mm. Um, when the tectonics created Mount Kilimanjaro, they created this beautiful gemstone. And as we know, it was launched to the world by Tiffany's and Co. in the 1960s. And it is the only other gemstone that's kind of nuzzled its way into what is now the big five. Um, of all the, you know, like your diamonds, your rubies, your emeralds, your stuff. Actually, to be honest, only diamonds that are, in my opinion, only diamonds get the marketing that Tanzanite has had. True. Do you agree? Like yeah. De Beers, diamonds yeah. are forever. You know, there's that marketing, the most successful marketing campaign, full stop, in the world ever of anything. Mm. You know, Tanzanite is another one. You know, they... But we know that whilst it is a one locational gemstone, once upon a time, going back to when, what, like we were describing, Debbie, when we used to have Tanzanite days, yep. we used to have, you know, sell, be able to do showcase after showcase after showcase. That's when we used to go direct to the mine, yes. which you can't do anymore. And we used to source it from, if you look, predominantly do, uh, block D, uh -huh. and I can show you a diagram. We used to source predominantly from Block D. And the reason why it was Block D is because they were artisanal miners. Mm. So we could negotiate with them directly. We, I'm not saying we didn't ever shop with Block A and, uh, um, and B, but now we can't because they're closed. There is one mining location, and that diagram, as crude as it might be, you can see the road all the way around it, there is quite literally a wall. Oh, really? Built around it. So nobody, you know, it is commercialized and again you know we've got a video of steve bennett going down a vertical shaft into a um into a tanzanite mine and this is going back some years yeah, now so it's probably about i don't know 10 years yeah. ago eight nine ten years ago maybe um and we were talking about you know depths hundreds of meters look at where we are now can you imagine for a second and it's hot in tanzania oh yeah can you imagine for a second doing this twice so down and then up in any given day firstly 93 meters down a vertical shaft right and that's just the first that's the first picture if you like statue of liberty then imagine climbing vertically up up the uh, the, the, the the height of the shard or the eiffel tower or the sears tower or burj khalifa right now we are at the point of the Burj Khalifa, the, la the highest building in the world, beneath the Earth's surface. Mm. Now, and it is be becoming harder and harder and harder to get hold of. Do they have to go deeper to get it now? Uh, yes. Mm. Yes. Like I said, they'll, they will reach a point where... They can't go any deeper. Can't go any deeper. Right. Absolutely. Can't go any deeper. Becomes more dangerous, of course. Yeah. 
Um, so what they do is they, 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 they literally go down vertically like this Oof. on a ladder. That's a ladder. Christ. Stay down there all day. And then what, hacking away? Yeah, and come up. That's amazing. After everything we've just described for a <laughs> second and the fact that we get less of it now, we're still going to do it under £10. Just mind-blowing to consider that. I mean, that in itself, I would, you know, even if they, you, to go down, that's terrifying. Almost a thousand metres below the Earth's surface. A gemstone. And that's why I love, that, you know, here at Gemporia is the fact that I love Tanzanite, but I didn't know any of that before when I worked in the jewellers. I didn't know that it was... I didn't know it was one locational no. when I worked in the jewellers. And I, I remember, I've told this before, but I went to the doctors. Uh, this is years ago when we were in the, probably 10, 11 years ago, and Tanzanite was quite big. And my doctor said, if I wasn't a doctor, I would have been a jeweller. And before he even asked me what was wrong with me, he went, and is it true the Tanzanite mine's closing? <laughs> he was more concerned about whether he could get hold of Tanzanite anymore than I know him really well. Like, yeah, he looked yeah. after my babies, but... Um, yeah, and he, you know, people started to panic, and that was then. That was ten years ago. Yeah, exactly. That you couldn't get the Tanzanite, and it's been proven because ever since then, look how much we don't have on our shows compared to what we used to have on our shows. And how much it is, generally speaking. Ignore what we're doing right now. Ignore <laughs> that for a second, because we know that's not normal. How much is Tanzanite elsewhere? Mm. Is it double figures? No. Reality is no. It's not. Tanzanite generally is four figures, generally speaking. Um, there's a lot of, yeah, you can see here, there's the wall. Literally the wall surrounding. Is that to protect it? Protect it, oh. yeah. Because basically what they were having, if you, go, if you think back to that first uh, picture, um, they were finding that um, miners were, because uh, um, at first it was artisanally mined, there's nothing wrong with that at all, but they were really struggling with uh, um, theft etc oh. and then we were finding some of the mine shafts they were digging across into one of the commercial mines so it was all getting a little bit Ooh. so it needed to be uh, uh, commercialized yeah. basically um so the tanzanian government sort of took over and and i've got to be honest you know there's there's pros and cons in there but the, but they have you know made it safer basically which so, is important for yeah. the people who are mining it. and no rough is ever exported from tanzania it's all faceted as well in tanzania so um, but yeah, I mean, you think about Tanzanite. If you were to if you were to see it elsewhere, it's not going to be a double figure price point. You know, it's not stopping here. Again, it goes back to what we were saying earlier on. This is the last of your under ten pound deals. Make hay while the sun shines, because we used to have people messaging all the time. Oh, Tanzanite's rare, but yet you keep bringing it on air. And I get it. I do get it. I understand it. It's kind of like uh, uh, um, contradicting what we're saying. I get that. However, like I said, we can't buy in the same way anymore, not with no. Tanzanite. Um, in 42 seconds, we're going even lower. It's a pound per carat for beautiful cornflower blue. It is lovely. It's a pretty colour, isn't it? Yeah. If you want your quad A colour, look, again, I can bring it to you, but I won't be able to bring it to you anywhere near these prices. No way near. But you still want it to be pretty. It's not Tanzanite that's not so pale, it's white and wishy-washy. Not at all. It's Tanzanite with that lovely, uh, lovely, very distinctive saturation and colour. Launched by Tiffany's & Co. back in the 1960s. Again, we're never going to regret Tanzanite purchases, are we? No. You know, most people know here is a gemstone that, generally speaking, costs a pretty penny. I've got um, I've got my Tanzanite stash that I've been collecting over the years. It's in a drawer that I haven't done anything with yet. No, well, this is a thing. This, these are opportunities that we've got the chance to purchase mm. that future generations might not. Mm. You know, we're not stopping there. Under ten pounds, everybody. The last of our under ten pound deals. Going even lower, nine ninety nine. That's really good. That's super good. It is, isn't it? We've had some amazing deals today. This show's been epic. Yes, from start to finish. Yeah. When we launched Tans Night here at Jewelry Maker, however many years ago that was, it was in Nuggets. Yes. And they were more than what's on your screen. Right <laughs> yeah, now. definitely. Yeah. Much, much, much more. It's actually diff more difficult to get hold of. How many have we got then, Roscoe? We've got 100 Ooh, available. Well, we need it. Doesn't that speak volumes that everybody, all by one person, has checked out? Doesn't that speak volumes? It does. You know, um, okay, you've got some company now. Everyone's in the process of. You're not leaving it, though, to chance. The reality is, do you know, do, most people recognise Tanzanite, as you just said? Yes. 
most people know that it does command, you know, um, a higher price point as well. Mariska, Annette, Linda, hello to you, Rachel, Marion, Leslie, Jane, Carol, Susan, Linda, Karen, Samantha, Maker, Maker in Tyne and Ware, Sharon, New Maker, getting involved, lots of multi-buyers on this as well. Congratulations. Yeah, to get a hold of Tans Night at single figures, it's just, well, it's, it's unheard of. So, amazing. Do not go anywhere, though, because I'm going to be joining our lovely Debbie for her beautiful masterclass pieces um we've got the most incredible bicones also the wall of fame it's the draw oh, i forgot it was wednesday oh i don't think i've been on a wall of fame draw for ages oh, that's well exciting then, then you must simply must do the winner and the runner-up there Ooh. you go there you go don't go anywhere make sure you check out your baskets debbie and i will turn after this Two years ago, we partnered with the High Jewelry House in Hong Kong to produce a collection of never been seen before conch jewelry and conch carvings. Um, we were aware that that time was coming to an end and we thought we would have to part ways. However, they have delivered something that is even more exceptional. And I know, how do you get even more exceptional than the legendary Queen Kong? Well, the Indian Volute Sea Snail is one of the rarest of all pearl producers uh, in the animal kingdom. It is far rarer than the Queen Kong, lives deep in the South China Sea, off the coast of Vietnam and Myanmar, and very, very rarely has it ever been encountered. The pearl itself that is produced is known as the Mellow Pearl and can trade hands for millions of dollars. Today, we are in a position to deliver what we believe is the first ever collection of prized mellow shell to our collectors, featuring that unique, beautiful apricot natural color and the form that produces those record-breaking auctions. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. This July, join us for the big summer blowout. We are launching 927 brand new products. We have a mega managers clearance event Mark Smith's anniversary show and Christmas in July. Yes, you heard that right. Christmas in the summer. So join us for Jewelry Maker's big summer blowout. It's going to be a scorcher of a month. Miss it and you'll miss out. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Oh, welcome back, everybody. And if like that, 
back at 12. How is it 12 o'clock already? I know, we've had a great show. It's been such fun. It's been a giggle, hasn't it? Yeah, from it has. start to finish. Stay. It's always a laugh. One thing you can't accuse us of is being serious. You know? <laughs> oh, and there's still an hour left. Right then, Debbie. Should we do the reading out? Oh, where is it? Where is it? Here it is. Get yourself organised, Al, seriously. Um, right, are you ready? Wall of Fame. Ready. I'm going to pass you that. And we'll oh. do that after the draw. So 945 is from Angela. Hello to you, Angela. Beautiful visions of colour. Oh, lovely. Hello, everybody. This week's entry to the Wall of Fame was a necklace and bracelet set made using size 11 sea beads, bugle beads and fire polished crystals. Everything from jewellery maker as usual. Good luck to all fellow waffers. That's stunning, Angela. Beautiful. Good luck, Angela. Number 946 is from Becky. Hello to you, Becky. Oh, is that angel eye? I think that is angel eye. It is angel eye. It's gorgeous. Um, Becky saying hi. My entry this week is angel light and pearls. We were just saying how perfect that combination mm -hmm. is. Uh, knotted with silk with a magnetic clasp. This is a 50th birthday present. Oh, wow. What a lovely present. Isn't it just? They're going to love that. Number 947, uh, sorry, is from Caroline Brown. Oh, very oh, beautiful, that's pretty. Caroline. Yeah, lovely. Are those? Oh, gemstone as well. Kind of like snow, uh, snowflakes. Yeah, they, they are. Else? Well, they snowdrops, that's it. Um, hello, jewellery maker, staff and viewers. This is my entry to the Wall of Fame. Um, it is a string of multicoloured pearls with rose quartz and pearl pendant. Um, any chance of some more shaped beads, please? We'll certainly sow that seed. Um, <clears throat> good luck to all entrants. Best wishes. Good luck to you, my lovely. Number 948 is from Julie. Hello to you. Oh, that's pretty again. Very aquatic, I feel. Oh, I love that. Um, Julie says, hello, lovely jewelry maker peeps. I hope you're well. Please find attached a picture of a Larimar nugget, blue shell pearl squares and white crackled quartz necklace, bracelet and earring set uh, that I created for my amazing sister. All made with jewelry maker materials, of course. This is my entry to the Wall of Fame. Best wishes to everybody. Oh, I Number bet she was chuffed. Oh, that. over the moon. Mm. You would be, wouldn't you? Um, number 949 is from Melanie. Hello to you, Melanie. Oh, Melanie, that's gorgeous. So pretty. Um, hello, everybody. Please find my entry this week. It's a fidget bracelet made with 11 o Mayuki beads and rose quartz nuggets from Jewelry Maker and some heart beads from my stash, all threaded using Fireline. I hope you like it. Good luck, fellow waffers. Love it. Over to you. Over to me. So, from there. Oh, right, OK. Ah. Yeah. I'm getting all my bits caught up. Uh, now I've got 950, oh, wow. Sandra Fortune. Oh, that's beautiful, Sandra. Hi, all. Okay. Here is my latest entry to the Wall of Fame. It's a loose side necklace and earring set using the summer coloured flowers from JM, apart from the small bells. I use JM gold on silver chain, a butterfly findings pack and gemstones, green and red onyx, citrine and two shades of gold shell pearls for the centres. Thank you as usual for the fabulous shows and the lovely products you bring. Good luck to all entries and much love to all. Sandra, that is so, so beautiful. Loving that. Um, I've got 951, Isabel Morgan. Hello, lovely friends. Inspired by Laura Binding last week, I made this dragon eye pendant, which I'm going to hang outside in my garden. Made from JM copper coloured wire and 60 seed beads with the eye cabochon from my stash. Have a lovely day all. Oh, Isabel. How clever is that? Very dramatic, isn't That's it? That's amazing. Uh, 952, Jill Taylor. Hi all at JM, here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's a dainty necklace with dyed turquoise magnesite heshi beads with little hematite cubes which really catch the light. All finished with sterling silver clasp, all from JM of course. Best wishes to you all. I absolutely love those colours, that is so effective. Great for layering as well. Um, a 953 Sue Thursfield, hope I've said that properly. Hi all, here's my entry for this week's WAF. It is a very long strand of different colours and sizes of cultured pearls with larger stations made to wrap around the neck however many times you want. A bit extravagant but looks good on lots of clothing styles. Love this one so much it somehow became mine. I know that feeling. Yeah. And I wear it a lot with shift dresses but it can be adapted to suit. Already have a couple of orders after wearing and will change it slightly so each one is unique. All from JM, of course. Easy for beginners too. Hope you like it. Good luck to all. That is absolutely beautiful. Love that. So, yeah, I, I don't think I'd be able to part with that one either. 
And the last one, uh, 954, which is um, Vivian Thode. Hi all, here is my latest make, a frosted aquamarine with 10 mil rounds and moonstone tiny faceted rondelles. It's long enough to go over your head, but I added the sterling silver clasp for a finishing touch. I think the bottom middle aquamarine looks like a little globe. Best wishes to you all. That's absolutely beautiful, Vivian. Uh, good luck to oh, everybody. No, there's a Moomin. Moomin, I hello. Moomin. Hoo hoo. <laughs> <laughs> Do they make that sound? Hello, uh, Moomin. They were cute. Aww. I like the Moomins too. Um, okay, Debbie, are you ready? Come on, make it lucky. So this is for what we're we doing, runner up or winner first? Which would you prefer? Runner up first, right now. Winning what, 50 pounds was uh, credited to their jewel maker account. Number? 9.55. Ooh. Alison Queens. Queens. Queens, well done to you. Congratulations, Alison. You're our runner-up, so amazing. 50 pounds being, that's the runner-up, yeah. Winner. <laughs> is. 901. Oh, 901. Olwyn Hills. Olwyn Hills. Oh, congratulations. Hills. Hills. Well done to you, Olwyn. Amazing. I'm, for, I'm sure I've seen your name today. It, they, they might be different, Olwyn. There's an Olwyn on the phone lines right now. Or was. I wonder, Olwyn, texting. Is that you, lovely? Congratulations. Amazing. How amazing. Yeah, love That was it. exciting. It was. We do it every week. We have done for as long as we have been broadcasting. It, yeah, it's amazing. So do send your photographs of your fabulous creations with a little message. The only stipulation, of course, is that they are jewellery maker products. That's all. Right then, everybody. You're ready for Debbie's beautiful masterclass kits. Now, genuinely, genuinely, when I first stepped into the studio and saw these, I assumed they were glass. Um, and that is an indication, A, of the quality of cut. Yes. And also the quality of the gemstone. These bicones are beautiful, they Debbie. They are so beautiful. I couldn't choose which one to start with. Um, the one you're seeing there is um, Amazonite. I left <gasps> that till last because... Amazonite in a bicone. In a bicone. So, yeah, that's just a little flower that I just kept going with. <laughs> so it's kind of like a flowery Speaking of snowflake. frozen. Speaking of frozen. I know. So, you know, you can do anything with these. You can make um, a bicone bracelet, a very simple one, and it will be absolutely beautiful. Um, so that was the, uh, the Amazonite. But I chose to make little flower components because I thought if I show you how to do that, then you can either have one on a pendant, you can put them all together, you can do lots of different things. And so I started with a peridot. Mm -hmm. I know, this is amazing. Because <gasps> woof. It woof. just woof. Did you just woof the sound? I woofed. It's just a be beautiful you're strand. Not, you're not wrong. They so are unbelievable. So delicate and the quality. sparkly. It's genuinely some of the best peridot I've seen. The colour. You know when you know when Dave and um, Jake go over to China on Monday? Mm -hmm. I think it's Monday they go. There's a, exciting news on the peridot world. Uh, in the peridot world. So um, we'll obviously relay that back. Look at this, though. Seriously, look at the quality of this peridot. It is... That perfect chartreuse, vibrant green. It is, and it's natural. I know. It's so stunning. Should we start with this then? Yeah, let's. Hang on. You get this beautiful clasp as well. Peridot sterling silver clasp to go alongside it. Yep. Hold, hold on a minute. You also get the jump rings. Yep. And. You get your three millimeter nine two five spacer beads, of which there is fifty. And I've not seen them like this before. No, they're like a matte texture. Yeah, they're aren't a matte they? texture, which goes perfectly with the sparkliness of the bicones. I thought. Um, so you get fifty of these, I believe. And they are sterling yeah. silver. And they're sterling silver. Wow, this kit's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. The clasp is stunning as well. It is. I mean, there's a lot of silver in that too, isn't there? Yeah. It's twenty. Oh, sorry, you can't see it. Um, Twenty-one millimeters in its length, and that is. I'm trying to show this to you as best as possibly can. There you go. Um, and that is uh, um, a pair. Oh. Peridot in the, in the centre as well, making a right hash of this. <laughs> um, have we got quantity of these then, Roscoe? 80 of each of the kits, so do shop ahead on them. For the 4mm Peridot, they're insane. And Just whisper in my ear, Ross, what you're taking it to. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. 
dial early. I mean, Debbie, this is a classic beading kit, isn't it? You know, you can yeah. use it with your, your nine o'clock kits as well. I think you can bead with it. You can see bead with it, which I did, but you can. Yeah, there's the clasp. Isn't it lovely? Yeah, beautiful. And I just think that it adds that professional touch. Like, you know, somebody was saying on the Wall of Fame that they added that clasp on anyway, just to add that professional touch. And I think if your clasp echoes the gems that you're using, I mean, there's some lovely, very easy seed beading projects to do with spacer beads mm. and bicones, where you've just like got your bicones just going across. Very wearable, very well, that stackable. that bracelet that we got excited about, you know, the rose quartz bracelet that you, you, des you did oh, recently. Yeah, yeah. Um, and you sent me the photos. Oh my gosh! that's amazing you could do that with these yeah um, you need 250 okay I, I think there's about 100 on there i think i okay. counted so you would need uh, just two two and a bit two and a bit but if you put some spaces in some of the um, netting instead of you probably get away with two kits oh, amazing can you imagine that yeah and beautiful. they wouldn't be heavy as well because no. they're, they're quite light be beautiful and you could mix the colors up as well 39 pounds and 99 pence there's a lot of silver in this too you know in the s class in the spacer beads in the jump ring so you're getting 50 sterling silver jump uh, sorry spacer beads there and they are like debbie said a kind of matte mm. really beautiful kind of matte texture $29.99. Ooh. Let's look at it this way. Never mind the jump rings, because I know you're only getting a couple of those, but one, two, three. Would we all agree? Three big components here. Oh, well, you're getting everything. That's a tenner each. Exactly. You're getting everything that you need. If you were going to pop that onto um, your beading wire, then you've got what you need because you can just yep. pop it onto beading wire. You've got your clasp, you've got your spacer beads if you want them, and some jump rings to add to your clasp. So you just need to add sort of your beading wire and your crimps. That one's lovely, isn't it? Look at that. But likewise, I could hold the um, Amazonite, I could show the garnet. In fact, let's can't do the garnet. I can't pick a favourite of I these. can't either, it's tough. They are all absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at the garnet. Oh my goodness me! I tell you what, on that basis, then because we are, uh, we actually think that few people are going to struggle to choose a favourite. So if there if there is a, a way to make them as affordable as physically possible, you know that we will always, Let's always endeavour to do that. Mm -hmm. We're going to go even lower. In fact, once I say these words, it's going to create a bit of a frenzy on the phone lines. <laughs> Did you say there's a hundred? Sorry, 80. There's 80 available, oh, and we're going to do this kit under £20. So, again, I know there's sterling silver jump rings in there, and I don't mean to just sort of sideline them, but one, two, three. And the clasp. If, uh, yeah, three big components. I Divide divide that price, that price pledge by three. That's working out at £6.66. £6.66 for the bicones. And that clasp, though. £6.66. It's, that's 6 .66. amazing. Amazing. Yeah, really, really, really good. And they are gem set too. Under £20, you know it's happening. I've said it out loud. And again, it gives you an opportunity, hopefully, um, to not have to choose one. If you want to multi-buy, if you want to purchase the other colours, then hopefully we, we've helped you do that a little bit. You don't have to use the clasp as a clasp. If you have a look at the kind of frozen necklace, um, I've taken it and used it as a component because it's so beautiful um, there. If you can see it there above the little flower snowflake, it's um, all I did was I squeezed the end so that the little um, like shepherd hook yeah. met, you know, like the shape just yeah, met so it's not gonna work the gemstone, its way out. so it's not going to work its way out. So you can most definitely, and if you put that sideways, that could be the centre of a bracelet as well. It's also, for me, that it looks like a symbol. It actually looks like, it, a, it looks, like an infinity yeah. symbol, doesn't it? Yeah, and it's just such a lovely component that I would probably use that as a centrepiece of a, a bracelet and yeah. add bicones to each side um, by just crimping onto that, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Um, there's so many design opportunities with a kit like this. I love it. I can't believe we did it for 19.99. Shop ahead on the others. They're absolutely flying. So again, let me just show you these these spacer beads where you get fifty of them, and they they come in each of the kits. Yep. How much would they be? Fifteen yeah. pounds? Yeah. For a pack of fifty? Yeah. For fifty, you're not getting like twenty 10 or twenty. 10. Yeah. Often you get ten or twenty in a kit. Yeah. You're getting fifty. Yeah. Exactly. Um, should we do the garnet? Oh yeah. How quickly do we think this one's going to sell out? Seriously. I love all the other components. I absolutely do. I love that S-clasp. I love the sterling silver. But for me, it's all about this. 
the quality of this. If I was garment. to choose a favourite, it's probably the garment. Mm, yes. Mm. You see, I'd have thought I would have said the Amazonite when I got it out of the packaging. But then when I started working with this garnet, it's unreal. Yeah, the refraction's mental. It is. It's actually some of the best garnet I've seen. It, they're just so beautiful. And like obviously we're in the studio, lights it dulls them down. But the sparkle on them was what surprised me for garnet. Yeah. It's the most sparkly garnet I've ever worked with. Yeah, absolutely. Well, well, garnet, you know, it is one of those gems. You haven't got a gem here that brings you triacrosum, pleochrosum or anything like that because it forms in the same way a diamond does. But when it's cut well, prime example of what where, what cutting can bring to the table, yeah. um, garnet is one of the most refractive gemstones, so it will play with light if it's cut well. Look at the quality of this strand. It's mind-blowingly beautiful. Plus, then you get your sterling silver um, garnet S-class. Let me hold that with the tweezers so, again, so you can pretty. see the quality of that. And you're getting, if I scooch my hand forward a little bit, sorry, Michael. Um, and you're also getting your sterling silver spacer beads and, of course, the jump rings. This, yeah, love it. With some pearls. Beautiful. Nineteen ninety nine. <laughs> Do they tessellate? What do you mean? As in, could you kind of like tessellate them together so they fit? alongside one another. Yeah, oh, so yeah, of like, course. Like, like, yeah, a, yeah. like a brick wall. With the yes, tessellate. you could. Which is essentially kind of what seed beading is. It's like a, yeah. it's like creating a puzzle out of the shapes that you have. Yeah. Um, so you most certainly could do that. This would look amazing, one of those Capriccio bracelets. Can you imagine one oh. of those Capriccio bracelets with the sparkle? Now, I have done, and I still can't find it. I will find it, bring it in. But um, I have done one with bicones that are glass. Oh. But something like this, where you've got the sparkle, it would be incredible. You'd yeah. need three kits to do it. Yeah, okay. So, but at £60, though, you can make that that bracelet, can't you? Oh, yeah, absolutely. For 60, for 60 pounds. Um, we had, well, how many did you say, 80? 80 of each of these kits. Alwyn, Vanessa, Mary and Jerry, Newport, Rhonda, Lancashire, hello to you, Nicolette, Belinda, Amy, um, Emma, sorry, uh, Julie, Karen, hello to you, Kathy, Jeanette, Jean, Devon, Anne, Jeanette, Michelle, Susan, I can't keep up with you. Lots of multipliers getting involved. And you've used, what, probably a couple of inches of the strand for that necklace? Yeah, I mean, there's one, two, three, four. There's six in each, so one, two, three, four. It's six times six. 36. How amazing. So let me just show you what six is on the strand that yeah so there's loads left you're going to make a lot of I've, those of, of those beautiful components i've got i made that um I made that necklace and I've literally got all of this isn't a separate strand I don't know if you can go on the overhead I've got all of these left from that necklace so you got loads and loads and loads, loads and loads, loads, and, loads, and, loads and, and loads and loads and loads. Keep dialing through for this one everybody yeah oh goodness me yeah there's tons shall we do the amazonite now you will be excited by the S-Class that's come that comes alongside yeah. this. Um, because we didn't commission um, this S-Class with Amazonite. We brought it with Garnet, we brought it with Peridot. We also brought it with Opal. Yeah, it's so pretty. Ethiopian Wellow Opal, full of hydrophane performance. You've got a beautiful, beautiful uh, um, play of color. And then here is that gorgeous strand. I don't know, it's so hard, isn't it, to choose a oh, favourite? No. They're all amazing. This gives you a totally different feel. Yeah. So if I had to pick, I'd say I'd got two joint favourites, and one was the garnet and this one as a yeah. completely different look. Yeah. Yeah, I get that. This would look lovely with your deal of the day, wouldn't it? It would look absolutely amazing with your pearls. It would look amazing with your pearls. And I think that you could do literally get away with just doing the bicones with your spacer beads and this clasp for yeah. this one. Yeah. Because it's so wearable. That necklace though, Debbie, I and mean, you've you've made, you know, it's a it's a gem heavy piece, isn't it? Oh yeah. But that necklace, should we pop it in the centre again? So I Is can this you one? can tell, yeah. I can always tell, or I think I can anyway, which which gemstone or which kit is the designer's favourite. <laughs> Because this is a bit of you, this is. I can imagine you wearing it. I've added pearls to it because I think... And also I've added... <gasps> that's a shell pearl on the bottom there. Yeah. And then also I've used the pearlised 11O seed beads. Now, if you didn't do that, if you took those... You didn't sort of halo around, you would get more of a flower vibe than, uh, than a um, kind of snowflakey vibe. 
but it so, sits you know, upwards. I it, love yeah, that. Yeah, so it's like three dimensional, but it. Um, so you can stop where you want, really, with it. You, yeah. can, you can add those on or, or not, just have the colour. Both work. Amazing. 1999. Absolutely beautiful, this. And it comes alongside all that sterling silver. Again, I've got to go back to when we used to do CB packs of sea beads like this you're three to four millimeters mm -hmm. in sort of round i'm sure they were either they were either like 15 20 or 30 which i know that's quite <laughs> um quite abroad but but they weren't they were they weren't far off this price do you mean the spacer beads space yeah beads, absolutely yeah. they were weren't they yeah. were they in packs of 20 or 30 I, mm, either way i want to say 20 or 30 i think not 50 not 50 and they weren't far off that price no no can you remember which is what you generally pay for a pack of spacer beads. Yeah. You know, the... So the fact that we're now doing spacer beads for 19 99 <laughs> in a pack of 50, and you're also getting some beautiful bicone Amazonite and sterling silver with Ethiopian opal. Again, can we just... That's that's six pound sixty six. That's six pound sixty six, and all that's six pound sixty six. Individually, it goes back to what we were saying, <coughs> excuse me, at nine o'clock, we would not be doing the six pound sixty six each. Here at jewellery maker. No, 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 no. And you know, this is a lot better than plastic hair clips. <laughs> Definitely. Which is what I paid for that. <laughs> yeah. You needed those plastic hair clips. I'm happy I bought them, but you know, I'd yeah. rather have this. And me, I would rather the the opal, the Amazonite, and the sterling silver. It's beautiful. It's These so aren't beachy. Metals. It's beachy. It's yeah. very on trend. Yeah. Last one of these kits, arguably the most seductive. Yeah, the most classic. Mm. Yeah. I think so. And also the one that's going to compliment the most. Oh, oh, Debbie, they're beautiful. Little earrings. Imagine those against the skin. Uh, yeah, and I think, you know, if you put the different colour spacer beads or seed beads on the end, you get a completely different look. If you match the colour of the gemstone, then it kind of brings the gemstone, yeah. your eye, to just the gemstone. £6.66 per component, effectively. You know, crazy. Six pound sixty six for natural black spinel. Look at the location as well. This is Burmese black spinel. It's amazing. So so sparkly, it's classic. Lined with your Burmese ruby. Exactly. Put it with pearls. Put it. You know, I know I say the breakfast and Tiffany's analogy, but it is very Audrey Hepburn. It's yeah. very classic. Yeah. Lovely in tassels as well. Bicones. Oh like this. Four yes. Four millimeter bicones. Beautiful tassels. Plus you've got your black spinel S clasp as well. Um, with your cabochon, so that is a genuine black spinel, and then you've got all this sterling silver, so sterling silver spacer beads. Um, unbelievable, we had 80 of each of these kits at £19.99 pence only, you know it's a great deal. Debbie, I'm excited, which of these pieces are you going to create? Or oh, talk us through them all first, because they're absolutely beautiful. Um, I'm just going to show you how to do the flower component, and then if I've got time, I'm going to show you how to connect more than one flower component okay. together without having to do them separately and then sew them together. Um, I just wanted to make something that I thought everybody could have a go at. But there are so many patterns out there with four mil bicones. Mm. You know, four mil bicone is like your, your absolutely perfect size. Um, you only have to put into a search engine, you know, four millimeter bicone patterns. And there's so many beautiful jewelry that you can make, usually with glass, but with this, you get to make with gemstones, which for me is even better. So I started off with the flower. Um, and, you know, some people like to be more delicate, don't they? So they'll yeah. have like one flower. So I thought I'll just, tr I tried to stick to one design because there was another bracelet design I wanted to do. And I thought, but then what will I demo? So I, I stuck to just the flowers and the take on the flowers. And the first one I made was the Peridot necklace. Yeah, it's beautiful. Um, earrings to match and bracelet all out of one kit. Uh, see, that's gorgeous, isn't it? If you're going to a wedding or something like that, I mean, how I th lovely yeah, would that be? I think it's very delicate, but it's also quite different. Yeah. I think the bracelet is my favourite. I think I would wear definitely wear that bracelet. I just think you've got that sparkle, and I just think that because it's gemstones, it, it adds to it. They're all natural as well. Is that right? So your black spinel, natural, peridot, yeah. natural, garnet. Amazonite, I think they're all natural stones. So, yeah, and I just, so I just started with that, and then I think I went on to the... Um, Amazonite? Garnet. Garnet. <laughs> <laughs> 
um, I went on to the garnet and thought, oh, what? and I just made that up. So I just thought, how can I attach these? Can I do it in one go? Lovely. So I just did that in one go. So just variations of the same design. Um, so to kind of show that you can make one component and, and then just really go with it. And I did the Amazonite last, which was a bit more of me, like you say. Um, I would have a long line necklace probably with that as a component. Beautiful. Okay. So I'm going to show you how to make a flower. The flower. So this flower or that, that flower, or are they this, the same? This flower. Right, okay. Um, but once you've made that basic flower shape, you can keep playing with it. You can keep going around and adding things and making different, different shapes. So what you need to add in is some 11 OC beads mm -hmm. um, to, to make this design. So what we're going to do is you want to start with this is a size 10 beading needle and I've got some fire line here now I did do it with six pound fire line but it tended to be a little bit too floppy so the eight pound fire line was much better now if you've only got six pound don't worry you can do a few thread passes to actually stiffen up that flower um, it's not a disaster but I just found that the the eight pound worked a little bit better so even though I don't know if you've got ten pound that might work as well but I've not tried it so to make one component you probably only need about half a wingspan and by wingspan I mean um, about half a meter of your thread so what I'm going to do is I've got my 11 OC beads here and I've chosen the silver color so this is just galvanized silver we do them here and I'm going to pick up six one two three four five six so this is what I have on my needle. Now, usually with a seed bead demo, I try and get some bigger beads to show you, but then the little petals wouldn't fit in. So I'm going to try and just go nice and slowly so that you can see. So if you've even not done seed beading before, you might, you'll be able to try this. So I've got six of my 11 O's, and I haven't put a stopper bead on, and I'm going to drop these down. Just be mindful of how um, long your thread is so they don't go flying off the other end. And usually I don't do a knot in this sorts of designs, but this is fine because it doesn't block the holes at all. So what I'm going to do is just an overhand knot to bring these into a circle. So I'm not doing it super tight I'm just, because I don't want to really pull this knot into one of the beads. So I'm just doing, you know, a shoelace knot. So I've taken that over twice. And you'll find that usually your beads will kind of sit next to each other a bit like herringbone, mm. but don't worry about that because these will go into more of a shape as you go on. So then I'm going to just progress through the next bead and I'm simply doing this so that I can take my needle away from the knot that I've just created. Now I would probably use a white thread if I was using uh, these gems, but I'm using a black so you can see what I'm doing. And then I'm just going to pull that through. Now what I'm going to do with this tail now is I'm going to just clip it off because it's going to get in my way. And if you've got a thread zapper, which I absolutely love, because these scissors are blunt, there we go. Um, just get a thread zapper and sort of shrink, shrink that knot into place. Okay, I'm not going to do that now, I'll do it at the end. So I've gone through my next bead in the row and I'm going to pick up one of my bicones and one of my 11 O's. So this is what I have on my needle and I'm going to drop it down. Oh, I've got cramp in my hand. Mm. Oh no. <laughs> That's all the jewellery I've been making for prom. Okay, so this is what I have. I've dropped a bicone and an 11 o down to my circle of six beads. Now you always want to just ignore that because that's going to be your stopper bead and just go back through your bicone and the next 11 o in your circle. So I've gone through my bicone and through the next 11 o in the circle and I'm just going to pull that and you'll find that that sits nicely in between the two beads. So I'm going to carry on doing that. That's all there is to it, really. I'm going to pick up a bicone and an 11 OC bead. So that's what I have. I'm going to drop it down. And I'm holding the actual little ring of beads that I started with in my fingers. It just makes it a little bit easier to manoeuvre. So remember that you're going to ignore that 11-0 that you've just put on because that's your stopper bead. You're going to come down your bicone 
and through the next bead in the row. So this is what I have. I'm going to hold on to it and I'm going to pull it. Now I'm not sure if I cut that knot when I cut my tail out of my way, but we'll soon know because it will come apart if I did. So that's two there. And then I'm going to do the same again. So I'm going to pick up a bicone and an 11 -o. And I'm going to go through the next one in the row. And pull it through. So just make sure that you don't get any of your thread caught anywhere. And you can see that that's starting to build. And again, I'm going to take my bicone, my 11 o drop it down, and remember to just leave your 11 o and just go through your bicone and through the next bead. And if you're finding that you do think that your petals don't have a lot of structure to them, you can do another thread pass all the way around, follow your thread path, and it will bring everything in. Now, you just continue that until you've got all of your petals. So that here's one that I did with the Amazonite. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six petals. Now, if you want to continue... Just let me cut this thread. If you want to continue and actually join on, which is probably what... I'm going to do it in a different colour so that you can see. You can either tie off your thread if your thread's not long enough, or you can continue with the thread that you've been using all along. If you want to add some thread in, it's quite easy. You just choose a place to add your thread. Now, obviously, I'm adding black so that you can see what I'm doing. And you could put a stopper bead on here if you want to. And then you just want to find a place between the beads where you're going to bring your needle up through the center until you've made a little loop and then you're going to go through that loop and pull that knot down so i've essentially now added a new thread to my project so what i'm going to do is decide where i want my join to be so i think i want these to be joined through the top one so i'm going to take my needle up through one of the petals and the seed bead on top of it. So you might be able to do that in one go or you might need to do that separately. There you go. So I've gone through one of my petals and through the bead at the top. And so what I'm going to do here is join on another flower without doing them separately and then sewing them together. So let's do a garnet one so that we can see what we're doing. So Ooh, can you imagine like a mixture of all these Oh yeah, gems? I think that's a That'll really good lovely. idea. Hey, I just, yeah, mind. I think that would be really pretty. Mm. So what you're going to be doing is sharing one of these petals. So what you want to do is add on one of your petal colour. So if you, it'll be the same colour if you're doing sort of the same sort of thing. And then we're going to add our central flower stem. So six beads like we did in the beginning. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So this is going to be the sort of the stamen or the centre of our second flower going to drop it down and then I'm just going to go through back through the first bead in the row to make my circle now you might find that this little center of your flower sort of travels down your thread a little bit so you need to kind of just push it up so it's meeting the bead and then you're literally going to just carry on with what you've been doing so you're going to do a bicone and an 11 seed bead drop it down and then we're going to once again leave this seed bead because that's our stopper bead we're going to go down our bicone and through the next bead in the row like that can you see and then pull it so this is exactly what we did with the first flower so what we're actually doing if I put it down and it will tighten up as you go round you've actually joined this flower to this flower and, and you've shared the seed bead at the top there. So that's how you would join without making separate flowers and then sewing them together. But you can do that if you want. There's loads of different ways to, to do the same design. 
and you just keep going around and you'll find it'll look a bit messy to start off with because you'll have some thread, some excess thread, but that will all start to tighten up as you add all the petals and as you make some multiple passes sort of through your beads because then it will st all start to become a little bit more sturdy. And you're just adding in, mm. adding in your, your petals, so joining them up. If I grab, is that the red one? I think it is. Do you know what they remind me of? Millie Fury, which is Thousand Flowers. Oh, yeah. Reminds me a little bit of that. So this is basically how I made this. I just oh. kept going, added those three. So I think those three on their own would be nice. So that was the bracelet. So I just kept going with that. And you can add thread in so that each one of the flowers shares that 11 o seed bead. That's yeah. how, you know, you'll just keep, keep going. But you can make them separate and then add, you know, whatever you want in between. But it's just that adding of the one by cone and then the six and just carrying on and then you'll do the next one, carry on. And that's how, that's how you do it. So it's not a difficult yeah. and um, you can mix and match your colours. That's a good idea. Yeah. And uh, it's not really seed beading as such. It's, uh, it's a good one if you haven't done anything like that before. No, it's beading, isn't it? It's beading, which I find really, really relaxing. Yeah, totally. Mm. especially these shapes well done everybody they are beautiful bicones i think you'll agree um they are uh, yeah stunning, aren't really they? precise bicones because you know sometimes a bicone can be a little bit more curved i suppose and it wouldn't work for some things if it wasn't exact and they're not going to be exact but it didn't phase the designs no the not design. at all um make sure you're checking out your baskets everybody now we do have another um amazing bicone opportunity to bring you and um whilst debbie was uh um just demoing i asked the question i was like oh, it's <laughs> um because genuinely no 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 genuinely this is one of the loveliest bicone strands i've seen we don't see this gemstone very often in a bicone um, and that is because it's an expensive stone. Basically, a bicone, if you think about it, say your business is you're, you're a gem trader. You, most gem traders are almost programmed to obviously try and retain as much carrot weight as possible. How many times do you tune into our sister channel and they say, oh, we cut for beauty, not carrot weight? You know, um, our, our oh, gem, nice. you know, cutting house, and we don't cut jadeite, but you know other gemstones, we cut for the beauty of the stone rather than retaining the carrot weight of it because it can be detrimental basically to yeah. the stone. But people, some people, not everyone, some people want the biggest basically. It's gone, and diamonds has a certain uh, um, a certain accountability to diamonds for that because again it's like the marketing of it all or the one carat diamond, you know those kind of milestones. Yeah. So we just want the biggest, don't we? And it's not necessarily the best. Anyway, by the by, when you're talking about something as rare as type A jadeite, a gem dealer will want to retain as much carrot weight as physically possible because this is an incredibly valuable material. That makes sense. Yeah? Yeah. Remember that proverb? Gold has price. Jade is priceless. We don't want to cut those, that, those pound signs away. But when it is done, and I remember us educating Dave Troth on the bicone, he was like, what's a bicone? And then we showed him and he was like, oh, yeah, oh my goodness, he, he couldn't believe it. And he was like, well, you're not going to get people to do it. It was obviously another gemstone that we showed, it, showed him. And he was like, you won't get it in jade because that is an expensive cut. It's like a Marquise. When have you seen Marquise? Faceted Marquise type A jade? Do you mean because of the waist? Because of the waist, right, what you yeah. cut away. Because it's around and then they cut the sides. Yeah, that makes sense. That does make sense. But when he saw it for the very first time, he was absolutely blown away. And here is why. It's stunningly beautiful. Probably one of my favourite shapes in jadeite. I don't think I've seen um, bicones in jadeite. Oh, it's beautiful. It, it's stunning. It's full of luster. It's got that wonderful kind of... Uh, um, um, ice white luster um it's very 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 limited lovely jewelry makers there are 90 carats it's totally natural to get whole 40 available opportunities 
to get hold of type A jade I, one thing in a round, beautiful, amazing, you know, what you see in your Sotheby's, your Christie's and your Bonhams. However, to get hold of um, bicones, how many of those auction houses, first dibs or otherwise, how many of them have you seen actually offer bicones? Uh -huh. And if you're thinking, oh, okay, yeah, that's a really good point. Why, why, why aren't they in bicones? It's because it's expensive. It's a really expensive cut. And only we would be bold enough, really, to say, yeah, Cut best part of a third of a carat weight off this material. That's why there's only 40 available. Genuinely, you're going to love this. Again, we spoke about pearls earlier on alongside your um, peacock um, angelite. It's, it's beautiful with pearls. Really, because you've got that different shape. So yeah. you've got the bike and lends itself to then a round shape. Yeah. It just looks absolutely beautiful. You can play with them, so you can stitch them together in different forms. Um, a bicone is a great tool for a jewellery maker, I yeah. think. I think so. They're lovely on tassels or on the bottom of They're tassels. They're lovely on tassels, yeah. Great sort of like gurus, if you like, in your beaded necklaces. They tessellate beautifully together. You could do your demo, couldn't you? Oh, you could yeah. do it with a larger size. You can upsize it to a bico. You certainly could. Even here at £199, I think we all know that this is a gemstone that one day, foreseeable, immediate future, to be truthful, we're not going to see on our screens. And we certainly are not going to see it. Um, at the price points that we do, um, we've said we're going to have to do type B or C. The reality is we haven't got the jade to do type B or C. So mm. actually, mm. that's looking unlikely too. At £199, you got what, sorry? Lots of beautiful pure whites, yeah, with alongside that lovely delicate bean green. It's all totally and utterly natural. 40 were available. And see how quickly these fly out the door <laughs> for for bike owns at 79.99 they're a good size as well are they six mil yeah, yeah i thought they were they're a lovely size we're not done there but if we're going to do what we're going to do we want to see you there it's a two-way thing really you know live tv is very different to any other um you know we go to an auction house they don't go down do they they go up yeah. very different yeah. We don't do that. We do the opposite, don't we? So we kind of have to read the audience, if you like. Um, and the most transparent way of us doing it is if you sit it, look, is if I say, look, if we see enough of you there, we will take it to the absolute lowest price tag. How about under 50? If there's enough of you there. Wow. If there's enough of you. We are taking here what we are looking at, are looking at. And again, it's that don't be blasé. This is type A Burmese jadeite. Hello, Karen. I have the Bicone uh, Jadeite strand, and it's so beautiful. One of my favorite of all my Jadeite collections. Absolutely, Karen, I totally agree with you. It is stunning, isn't it? Right. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to crash, and then we're going to put a 60-second clock on your screen. And in that 60 seconds, we want to see at least 20 of you. <sighs> at least 20. And then we're going to go even lower if there's that 20. Live TV is very different. Shopping TV is very different to any other retailer or any auction house who does it in the opposite way. We're not crashing up, we're crashing down. <laughs> and what I'm actually saying, if there's 20 of you there, we'll go even lower than what's on your screens Ooh. right now. Even lower. Um, this should be a closeout deal at 49.99. That's madness. They're six mils. They are a really good size. And you know, it's lovely. If you've got that pendant, you know, even if you've got the pendant this morning, the beautiful white jade yeah, flower. Yeah, oh, lovely. These would be lovely on the neckline with that. Yeah, they? definitely. Amazing. Really pretty, that beautiful. would be. Beautiful. What is, a piece of jewellery that would be. It is a pretty shape, isn't it? Mm. We only need six more people, says Roscoe. We are still going to go lower. So if we get more than uh, um, the 20 people, we're still going to, obviously, you know, we're not going to hold it higher. You've just got to hit that magic number for us to basically quantify it to the powers that be. We need three more people. You've got 18 seconds. If we don't, oh. We only had 40 available opportunities. Okay, so is this maybe um, lesser quality? Absolutely, categorically not. These are carved effectively. Massively over 20 of you joining us on the phone lines and on the web now. There is a delay on our call screens, but Ross can tell me real time. There's about a 40, uh, 45 seconds wait on the phone lines. Multi-buyers taking advantage to a point you've frozen my screen. I can't see you <laughs> as of yet. £39.99 only. 
How beautiful is That's that there, yeah. Debbie? Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm. It's mm. stunning. It's so pretty. Think of your ladder wave. <clears throat> it's actually right angle wave, but we used to call it ladder wave. Um, and you could just make a little ladder wave pendant. And, you, you know, you could have ladder weave pendant. You could probably make, oh, just, oh, I don't know, four or five out of this strand. Yeah. Um, you know, so you can think of different things to do when you've got this oh. unique bicone shape. It lends itself to so many lovely designs. Yeah, it really does. Tassels, beaded necklaces. These can be little punctuations, couldn't they? Again, if you look at, you know, we show you lots of different uh, beaded examples of type A jade. I, never mind the price points that they, uh, that they fetch and can and do um, reach, but, you know, they're not $39.99 no. at one point, are they? <laughs> um, here is a gemstone that it, we should have to. Uh, Dave always puts it so perfectly. Here's a gemstone that we shouldn't be able to purchase from cash that we get from a hole in the wall. <laughs> it is yeah. so true. Normally, yeah. jade, you have to wire transfer or something like yeah, that yeah. You know, to get hold of. Barbara, Elaine, Sh uh, Charlotte, Jackie, Anne, Combria, Sandra, uh, Cumbria, Multi, Buying, Well Done to You, Nicolette, Northamptonshire, Susan, Alan, Marishka, Elaine, Christine, Elaine, Mary, Helen, Maker in Cumbria, Jackie, you disappear off the screens. I only had 40 available opportunities. You do need to be checking out to guarantee your success. It is one of the prettiest strands I've ever seen, Jen. Genuinely, I mean that. It's pretty, and I think it's the palette. What are you doing? 46 people have it in the baskets. Okay. Can you? <laughs> he's doing it. Oh, he's doing it. He said it, yeah. I'm doing it now. Go for it. How many have we got left? 19. 47 of you have it in your baskets. He says, I want to sell them out today. I agree. They're too beautiful to be in our vault, oh, aren't they? Oh, yeah. They need to be enjoyed. They need to be used. Worn. Worn, yeah. Celebrated. Yeah, because we look at a bicone like a facet. It is a facet, I suppose, like a cut of hmm. gemstone. This is, you could also look at it like a carving, you know. I think it is when it comes to something like jade eye, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. And we'd have had to educate them on this, by the way. Oh, really? You know, normally it's the master carvers. They wouldn't have known what a bicone is. Or they might yeah. do, but... So they would have done it with this gemstone for our audience. Yeah, very much. Oh, it is absolutely. That's perfectly put. Mm. Very much tailored for the jewelry maker order, audience. Uh, every pound, every penny. We cannot go a single penny lower than what you're about to see. <laughs> oh goodness me, thirty-four pounds. Thirty. That's an amazing deal. That. Oh my goodness. That's an amazing. There's only seven left. When we first launched Jade all those years ago. It was almost three times. It was almost three times that price, and it wasn't a bicone. It was a plain round. That's a really d decent length strand. It's a thirty-eight centimetre strand yeah. as well. Uh, five of them left. Good luck. Was super over allocated. So well done, everybody. Congratulations. <laughs> Can we uh, just for a second look? That's when I was going. Oh goodness me! Look, look at the. It's a lovely one. There's the YouTube thumbnail. Yeah, totally. Um, amazing, amazing. Okay, last. I have got the tiger. I thought he was a Pixu. He's a tiger. I've got, um, and let me just double check. Hang on. Is he drilled? Let's have a little look. Oh, he is a tiger and he's got the colourings of a tiger. Now, he's adorable. Do you know what? Nice little item sort of to carry with you. Uh, with you. Um, I'll put it in jewellery. It's up to you. Look at him. Oh, he's so cute. Ah, oh, rawr. Rawr. He's hand carved. Roscoe, um, if you look at Tiger's Eye, I think it's in Liam's. Is it... Um, oh, we've got nine seconds. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> I didn't realise that. Um, but the tiger is symbolic in, 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 across many different cultures, isn't it? It's considered a solitary animal. It's considered the protector Absolutely. of the family as well. Absolutely beautiful. He's never been on air, and he is carved on the reverse as well. Oh, he's like a little ornament to me. You could, of course, put him in jewellery if you wanted to. £29.99. Oh. He's so cute. They are so beautiful. I reckon if you were to choose the most beautiful animal that exists on this planet, a tiger's oh, got to be up there. They are stunning. Stunning. Last auction of the day, 38 carats of type A grade. Oh, wait, right, I thought you'd, I was going to say. I was going to say, oh, is that not your price? Oh, okay. So you'll forgive me for moving on when I was thinking, like, 
The tiger, the master carved tiger. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> Believe to bring you courage. Ooh. There are already 30 of them though. Coming up tomorrow, I can't believe I'm about to say this, we have Mellow Pearl at 10 o'clock with Dave Troth. And we've also got your amazing abalone showcase, which is oh, going to be unbelievable. Beautiful. Yeah, look at these. The, uh, I say arguably, many people, most people would say Mellow Pearl is the rarest of all. Um, Debbie, I, you can get what, sorry? The bicones and the tiger for less than fifty pounds. Amazing, Debbie. When you back, beautiful lady. I think the twenty-first. About ten days. About ten days. Some. Thank you so much for joining. Oh, me. thanks I've for loved, having me. It's been so much your fun. Kits. We have had fun, haven't we? Yeah. And thank you for getting me out of that situation, my lovely. My I will send you a photograph of Willow, the starfish rock star. <laughs> have a lovely day, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker.